Hello? Is my mic working? It wasn't working for a second. I don't know what was going on with it. I'm a little bit sus. I could be the imposter. My mic wasn't working. So, essentially, some good news, actually. We're going to start off this week with some good news. First of all, sorry about the no stream yesterday and about it, but a bit of a delayed one today. But we might go long today because I don't have work. But uh, I got my hands on a uh, NVIDIA graphics card. I got the new 3070, boys. It's in the computer right now. Now, I haven't tinkered with any settings in OBS and, and sussed out how exactly, you know, the shenanigans in the, in the uh, settings and stuff like that are going to work. But that might allow us now to stream other things and also allows us to stream FIFA directly from PC. So, like, mods and stuff like that as well. So... You know what I mean? What's going on, chat? Anyway, what's going on? <laughs> Xander, Jamie, Albi, SPK, Sukhail, Jack, Caden, Albi, Ashish, Bryant, Joe Hay, my guy Joe Hay. Anyway, what's going on, everybody? <laughs> oh, man, I've missed you guys. It's so good to be back, dude. Oh, these weeks where there's F1, that extra day. Mm. Also, sorry about the delay stream today, guys. But like I said, I'm gonna make it up to you. I might go a little bit. Uh, I might go a little bit longer today. I might go. We might go four hours today. I got nothing else to do all day. Uh, as you can see, we just. Well, I literally left this save at the end of June. Is there anything you guys want to see before we head into the next season? I don't think there's too much that we want to see. I was watching Flickify. Oh yeah, no way. I did. I did see he was streaming. Actually, yeah, you're right. Maybe I'll go in there and tell him to raid me. Hold on, where is he? <laughs> You're right. Yeah, he, oh, PS, he's at PSG now with his journeyman. Nice. He's literally signing Camavinga right now as we speak. We dropped a little comment in there. We dropped a little comment in live uh, Flix live stream. Hopefully, hopefully he sees that I'm live streaming and he raids me today because he owes me a raid. Oh my god, this Shatine guy, this Sh Shatine, Shatine, twenty five goals. Evanelson, twenty one. Everton was our our whole, our top score. Oh, ugh, I can't even speak. Our top goal scorer for for the uh, campaign but uh, all right so we're basically not really managing anyway what's your reaction on man united versus arsenal match ashish don't even get me started on that one i mean, I, don't, I just don't understand how you can lose to arsenal you know what i mean also we've got it we've changed the lighting setup a little bit so we've got the red lights going on now for benfica and it's already bright here in melbourne so i gotta look at maybe blocking out this window but yeah anyway how are you guys how are you guys enough about me I've, i'm talking too much yet. enough about me What's going on with you guys? Uh, he signed Fatty? Did he really? Pogba should leave. SPK, you're right, mate. Get into uh, World Cup 2022. Get in World Cup 2022. That will be fun. Do we have a national team? I'm not, I'm not managing a national team at the moment. Arsenal is such a clapped club. Uh, sad for United losing. Yeah, legit. I mean, it's just like... It's just like, really? Arsenal? Yo, Ahmed, you were on Flick Stream. You said you subscribed. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if you guys were watching Flick. He had he has like 130 people in there. Good on him too. He's um, you know what? Flick's numbers have been really, really good on his career modes and stuff like that. His Southampton series. I'm very happy for Flickify. For those of you that have been watching the stream long enough, how many times did I tell you that Flickify makes the best career mode content? How many times have I told you? Give me a number. Between 1 and 10. Oh, also, my desktop audio is not working. Can you guys not hear the music? Um, What about if I do that? No, that's not right. You guys can't even hear the music. I just noticed that now. Is it this? No. Is it this? Yes. Alright, you guys should be able to hear the music now. I haven't seen him yet. Hey, Guardy, what's up? What's going on, Benny S? Welcome to the chat, dude. SPK, not once. Never. You guys are such liars. Yeah, I heard it for a second. Yes. You guys... That's music. That is music. You guys are such liars. I've said it so many times. I've actually said it so many times that Flick makes the cleanest career mode content. Six and Stones may break my bones, but the drugs won't hurt me, so I'm not worried, says Caden. That's incorrect, actually. Drugs will hurt you. 
actually a lot of scientific evidence goes into saying that it does permanent brain damage so there you go um toffee gold says hi again what's going on toffee goals joe hay says that's music that is indeed music yeah so what happened basically what i was trying to say was when i put the new graphics card in it's actually changed well not changed it's set a lot of things to default um so more or less the position that we're in now is uh, a lot of things are back to default settings which sucks so <laughs> i promise i haven't heard no you're liars straight up i have said it before maybe you didn't hear me ahmed i mean i'm just saying don't get frustrated sam we're taking a piss flickers and amazing yeah no albie I, I was joking but that's okay you guys are still liars you guys are all imposters. For once, for once, it's not Guardi that's imposter. It's chat that's imposter. For once. Um, but yeah, I got to take a look. I got to do a deep dive into the settings. So I got it yesterday and a lot of yesterday was putting it in. We had some problems making it work. So I, I got to tinker around with settings today post stream. I got to make sure... I, well, I got to get all the OBS settings done first. And then I got to see what it's like streaming off PC. I've got 2K, NBA 2K21. I might stream a bit of NBA 2K21 on Twitch later today. I don't know what I'm going to do, to be honest. I might be live later today on Twitch. I don't know if I should drop my Twitch link. Do you guys use Twitch? Should I drop my Twitch link right now? Would you guys be there? I don't know if you would. I don't even know... Can you check Tierney for left back? Okay, this is the squad. So you guys think about um, signings while I'm quickly having a geese. Go on then. Okay. Because uh, maybe later tonight for me, I might be streaming. And it, it'll mainly be a test stream just to see how things go from, uh, from PC. But this is... That's the Twitch. But sh do you guys think I should just stream it here on YouTube? I can't be there. That's okay. No pressure. Do you guys think I should just send it on YouTube? I'm kind of... I don't know. What time would you... UK, would, do you reckon? It'll probably be... Like... In the morning for you guys. It'll be in the morning for you guys. I don't know when exactly, Joe. I can't give you an exact time. But it'll be... If I had to guess, I'd say maybe like... 7, 8 a.m. <laughs> 7 or 8 a.m. Like 5 or 6. No, no, a little bit a little bit later in the morning. Better you stream on YouTube. I know, but I just don't want to stream on this channel, I guess. I don't know why. Yeah, I've gotten out in the morning. Just depends if it's like 3 a.m. No, no, not 3 a.m., Joe. No, 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 no. No. It'll be, it'll be like 7, 8 a.m. for you. Who did some... Someone said Tierney. Tierney. Kieran Tierney. Hey, let's go get him. Spot on. I'm there. Okay, cool. Hey, Gardi. I'm busy today, so I won't be as active in the chat today. No worries. In India now, it's like 2 a.m., says Ashish. What are you doing awake, Ashish? Jeez. Check Bradderich. Okay, I will do that. But, um, yeah, this uh, this new graphics card allows me to do... Why am I tired? I started later to get extra sleep. Why am I tired? No. Excuse me. I won't allow myself to, to sleep. Domo, domagoi, domagoi Bradaric. Bags of potential. Bernardo Silva? Drop Twitch a follow. Okay, cool. Thank you, Xander. Thank you, uh, Xander, Joe. Anybody else that follow the Twitch? Thank you very much. Maybe I should put it in the description. I was not prepared this morning, was I? Jesus Christ. I've got to be honest, though. Yesterday was a bit of a headache. Just getting all the... Um, just getting the graphics card to in the computer and working was a bit of a, a it, it was a bit a draining and uh what's the word uh it was a bit uh, taxing on the old brain do you know what i mean so i didn't have time to actually tinker around with it yesterday i just had enough time to put it in there and you know hope for the best and it worked well i didn't even put it in there it was my older brother i didn't really do anything to be fair like i'm acting like i did something and i didn't really do anything uh, I'll have collage, but I'll watch alongside. No worries, Xander. I mean, you never know. There might be new viewers in Twitch. I don't know. I don't know how Twitch works. I've heard that it's actually really difficult to gain 
new followers on Twitch. Like, uh, if you're starting out, just like I'm lucky, I have like a, a few people here, like that would watch or or potentially that would watch. But if you don't have, you know, that, then uh, if you don't have that, then there you go. Can you show the squad? Yes, I can show the squad. That's the squad at the moment. We got a lot of midfielders. Like midfield is forget about it. Center midfield is is our strongest position. We've got maybe we need like a backup striker or even potentially a new striker and have Nunez as the backup. This kind of depends on what you guys want. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I'm yawning, man. What the hell? It's like 7:20 in the morning. I shouldn't be yawning. It's an appropriate time to be awake. Um, the goalkeeper looks good to me. Maybe a new center back is probably the thing that's glaringly obvious and a left back as well. But uh, yeah, I have school, so I can't watch your Twitch. That's okay, Sandy Doggy, no problem. Bring in youth uh, player from Inter Milan. Who was a youth player from Inter Milan anyway? Dan James for right mid. Oh yeah, definitely. Jovic. Yeah, we'll bring in Dan James. No worries. Pace, Pace Merchant Dan James, we'll bring him in. Jovic. Um, would you try to get Bernardo? He is GOAT in Korea. I mean, Bernardo, yeah, but where, where are we putting Bernardo? On the right? In the middle? <laughs> Fatty? Do I just send it with Fatty? Also, thank you to everybody that liked the stream, dude. Thank you very much. 12 likes with 20 people watching. I very much appreciate that. Thank you. Ahmed says, Agweme, search him up. Okay. And uh, Bryant is saying, buy calendar? And no, no chance, KJ. How dare, how dare you suggest such a thing? No, we left calendar. No, actually, do you want to buy him? We could actually buy calendar, you know, just for the. What, is it Drake? Oh, he's a free agent. Should I buy calendar? The uh, Inter Miami legend. He he complained, I think, and then I released him. From memory, I released him because he complained, right? I'll sign him. Uh, Agueme. Okay. Aguemme. Lucian? Sure. I've never heard of this guy in my life, to be honest with you. Chris Brown is 80 rated, 93 potential, and 18 years old. Uh, who was the other one? Uh, Jovic and Bernardo Silva. Okay, cool. Jovic? Jovic should not need scouting, right? Surely Jovic does not need scouting. Okay, he's at Tottenham. Maybe we won't sign him, because him leaving Tottenham for Benfica doesn't make much sense. But Bernardo, I guess, if he's a little bit older, like, wants to go back to Portugal, we can kind of... That can kind of be sold a little bit, right? He's kind of sick of Man City. This is the storyline with Bernardo Silva. Pep has dropped him, because he found out that Bernardo Silva... Uh, doesn't like bold people. So he's being dropped and now he's upset. Gadi, I'm following your Twitch now. Okay, thank you very much, Jamie. I appreciate that, dude. We also need a center back, Zaha. No, I don't. We need a center back. Because we got, at the moment, we got Conti and Kabak. I like Kabak. Kabak is a, a good center back. Look at that. Look at, look at the stats on the man. And he's 22 years of age. I like him. But uh, we kind of do need a, a second center back there. And also just depth. as We just don't have depth in that position either. Conti. Bro, that guy looks like Cal Fre He looks like Cal Freezy. Does anybody else think that that kind of looks like Cal Freezy? Uh, I followed you on Twitch, but I'm pretty sure I'll be sleeping when you stream today. All right, I'll be no problem. I, mu I might not stream today because it's going to be bloody hot in the afternoon. And this room is going to be, you know... It's not going to be fun to, to record up here or to stream up here. So I'm making my Twitch account now. Yeah. Okay. I might not stream today. Don't, don't, it's not, to, it's not hundred percent that I'll stream today. Gadi, what time are you going to be streaming on Twitch? If I do Jamie, it'll be like morning UK. So it'll be like seven or 8 AM morning UK, but it's not guaranteed that I will stream today. Just so everybody's aware. So they're scouting a pacey prolific striker. No, I don't want that. What else have they been scouting? A free kick specialist and first team quality striker. No, we're going to change all of that. No, Benfica, I don't know what you guys are doing, but I'm going to fix you guys up. Don't worry about it. Position, center back. No, actually, you know what? Let's just do any and we'll do first team quality. And just whoever you get me, you get me. Get Nelson Semedo. Isn't he from um, Benfica originally? I actually like our right backs. 
We've got Catarino, who's a right back slash right mid, 26 years of age from Brazil. And we've got Tavares, who's a bit quicker and younger and Portuguese. But he's also tall as well. That's interesting to see. So I think right back is solid. If anything, we need a left back because we're playing Gilberto there at the moment. Are you still in contact with B Ford Lanza, says Ashish? Uh, no. No, I'm not. I haven't talked to him since we made our video. In fact, the one time I, I, I responded to him on a tweet was when he gave somebody else credit for my video idea. True story. He, uh, he was putting up a tweet about Hometown Heroes, I think, and he said, oh, uh, shout out to T-Ray all day for, uh, you know, um, you know, this video idea. And then I responded like, uh, really? T-Ray all day? It was my idea. And you've done a whole tweet and you, you're shouting the wrong person out. Should we accept a loan to offer, loan to buy offer from Porto? No. We don't want Porto having any of our players, but we will sell Gilberto to Strasbourg. So Theodore the Third is in the chat. What's going on, dude? Good to see you again, Sir Theodore the Third. So Sook is in the chat. What's going on? I have an exam tomorrow, so I have to come say hi and goodbye. So Sook, no worries. I appreciate you being here very much. So Victor Lindelof, shall we bring Lindelof back? Uh, what's your exam for, Sir Sook? If you're still gonna stick around for a little bit, Gardy, I'm back. How are you, Sir Theodore the Third? I'm great. How are you? I uh, watch your Leeds career mode from FIFA 18. <laughs> Did you really today? Oh my gosh. Do I look a little bit different or no? Is it? Can you guys tell the difference? I can kind of tell the difference because I almost I know how much heavier I was back then. But yeah, Hayden, take care of yourself, mate. Ashish is absolutely right. Tap soba or Romagnoli? Okay, maybe not Romagnoli. That's maybe a little bit too much. Hakimi for right back. Mohammed, I don't need a right back. I need a left back. Your room was messy, XD. Was it? I mean, it still is. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yesterday, when I was looking for some um, cords for my graphics card, to, to I needed a new, like, I'm not new. I needed an extra thing for my graphics card. Are you planning a career mode series soon for videos, Joe? Hey, I don't know. To be honest with you, I'm not sure if I want to do a traditional career mode or not. I was gonna look somebody up. Up sober. Uh, so when I had to look for that extra cord, I had to, I had to, um, Jesus, what am I trying to say? I had to go through my old stuff. Like I had to go through a box that I haven't been through for a very long time. I had to dig up that box. And basically what, what I did was made a huge mess in my room just to find this one cord. There you go. That's the end of the story. I know that was such a big build up for absolutely no reason. And the story probably wasn't even worth it, but all, all that, I said all of that, just to let you know that, um, that my room is messy now. I mean, usually my room is clean or cl somewhat clean, but now it's super duper messy. Guedes, Gardi, did you FMG's video on rating FIFA YouTubers? No, I didn't actually. Shall I watch that and react to that and see what I agree and disagree with? Let me pull that up on my phone and I'll just get to the end where I can... I don't I don't want to watch the whole video, but I just want to go to the end and see where he's put everyone and I'll give you my assessment. How about that? I mean, he's more in... Ooh, this guy looks good. Too bad we have so many midfielders, but I'm going to actually keep him there. Gelson Dalla, I thought he was a winger. It seems like he's a center forward now. Pedro Nuno. Um, is there any left backs here? Diego Rico. Okay, let's have a look at this. I don't know if he's going to meme this or do it seriously. So I'm just going to kind of see and give you guys my thoughts on where he's put everybody. So he has put Legend of the scene. I don't even know all of these, to be honest. So Spencer FC is there, Sidemen, Road to Shore, Matt HD Gamer, Adriano, I think that's Chris MD and KSI. So that's not bad. Oh, wait a minute. Is that B Ford? Oh no, that's Bateson87 has blocked him. Oh, okay. 
I thought, oh, B B Ford is in solid with the Master Bucks and MGH and it's way back. I'll tell you what this essentially is from FNG. And I love FNG, don't get me wrong, but I'll tell you what this is. Top tier is just really um, famous people. Top tier is famous people that he probably wants to like do a video with. The second tier is like people that he gets along with or people he finds entertaining. So there's Cutsy there, Rich Lee's there, Chani Swartz is there, Wolfie's there, Viz is there, uh, JCC, Jared, B Mona. So it's everybody that he basically knows. Solid, I don't even know who all of them are, but Solid is people that he doesn't really actually like. I'll tell you that right now. That Solid tier, from what I can tell, is people that FNG doesn't like or doesn't find entertaining. But he's put him in Solid to make it not look as bad. And I, again, I love FNG, but he should have done this where he literally just called him out for being shit content creators or people that he didn't like. Cutsy is goat, Legi but Cutsy is actually good. Yeah, I do. I appreciate that. Because to be honest, like he's put, I mean, everybody he's put in the second tier is pretty good. Like Visa, I don't think should be there, but I think he gets along with Visa and he wouldn't want to put him in a lower tier. And that's the thing. When you do a tier list like this, that's so public, naturally, right? You're not going to do it how you actually feel. Lennon's in the chat, what's going on? KJ's threat as well, Muhammad's here as well. Bob Bob is here as well. And thank you to everybody that's liking the stream. But it, I should just say, like, naturally, right? He's not going to do a, a career, like, a, a career mode. He's not going to do a tier list that actually has, like, everybody in the right place. Like, he's not going to actually call people out. Visit just takes too much of a piss. Murder on my mind, says Caden. Ka oh, no. No. <laughs> Oh, I accepted it. Oh, I'm, I thought I was on reject. Oh my gosh, no. Oh, I'm so stupid. Oh my god, what the hell, dude? Oh no. Can I get this back? Is there any way I can get this back? Can I? Oh my god. Is there any way? Just offer him a new contract? Will that work? Reload the save? No, I can't be bothered doing that. Renew contract. Does that work? Oh, wait. Now looking for a new left mid. Serm Sook, I know, right? <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, no. Can I actually re just renew his contract? Will this work? All right, let's give him a new contract. So, okay. Is he on his way now or no? How do I check now? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I'm so stupid. How do I tell now if I've accepted or if it's not going to go through? Hello. Uh, so it's got an X next to it. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, cool. All right, the new contract thing does work, but I can't do it again because we're not going to be able to offer him a contract. All right, so that did work. It's, guys, 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 guys. Okay, look, I am stupid. I won't, I won't shy away from that, but I'm lucky that I have such a smart chat that will um, save me. But yeah, this FNG tier list, honestly, is just... Uh, I love FNG, don't get me wrong, but it's... Um, and he's a good kid. But uh, that is literally just the, the weakest tier list I've ever seen. That is just like the, the softest tier list he could have done to not hurt anyone's feelings. Like, he's got three positive tiers with people that he would thinks might watch the video or people that he interacts with. Then he's got one tier which is people that he doesn't really care about and he's he's happy to tell the, uh, the truth of them. Then he's got Bateson, which is a meme, and then him and AJ3 is a meme as well. So, I don't know. It's I reckon that's a bit of, um, I reckon that's a bit soft from FNG. I reckon he should just do it how he really feels and who cares, just send it. We're gonna send David Tavares on loan to Bordeaux, actually. All the mid tiers he said he didn't watch that much was all the same, eh? Honestly, it's not even that, Joe. The ones that he said he didn't watch that often is ones that he actually doesn't like. It's the ones that he doesn't find entertaining. So why not just say it? Like, if you're making a tier list video, just be honest. Just say, these are the ones I don't find entertaining. So make the, make the thing, make the tier not entertaining to me or something like that. Like, just make it the truth. Don't say, Oh, they're solid. Oh, they're, I watch them here or there. Oh, it, I, you know, like they might be good content creators, but you know, no, just say how you really feel, dude. Just say how you really feel. And I'll tell you right now, I know he personally, well, last time I spoke to FNG, and bear in mind, that was a little while ago, but a few years ago, 
Um, I know for a fact he doesn't like the Master Bucks. Like, I know for a fact he doesn't because he, him and Master Bucks had the beef with that boy and the box, right? So I know for a fact he doesn't like him. Unless they've made up since then or whatever. I know for a fact he doesn't like him. So it's like, just... Why can't you just be honest about that part, you know? It would make the video even better in my books. And who else is in there? B-Ford Lancer. I'm pretty sure he doesn't like B-Ford Lancer. The other ones, I can't speak to. So like, A9 Skills, I'm pretty sure he's just a meme. MGH, I just don't think he finds him entertaining. Zwayback, I don't think he finds him entertaining. Reeve, I don't think he... And I don't know who that jelly, that green and white one is, but... He brought that up. Did he really? Did he bring the, that boy, the box thing up? Is that the, what, the thing you're talking about? Hey, hey, boys, what's going on, Suchu? Good to see you, dude. Rafael Guerrero and Theo Hernandez are perfect transfers. We do need a left back. Actually, Hernandez is not a bad shout, eh? Gardy, I can't believe Leicester didn't win the league in the weekend vid. I know, right? I was so surprised by that. That was a great experiment, though. Shout out, shout out to Jamie. He was here before. I don't, I don't know if he's still here. I would put you... Ah, oh, he is. He said, I would put you on top. Yeah, he brought that up, it, uh, but made a joke out of it. <clears throat> yeah. I mean, I don't know. I'm just... Maybe I'm a little bit different, or... I guess, um... FNG has a bit of a reputation to uphold. Like, you don't kind of want to be known as the guy that just has a problem with everyone in the community, right? Not that I do, but... Hey, what's up? What's going on, Muhammad? Good to see you, dude. Brandon Williams? No, I think Hernandez is a good shout. I'm not gonna lie to you. I think Hernandez is a good shout. I think... All right, it's uh, Zed. Lucas or Theo? I think Luke... Do we want Lucas or Theo? I think Theo is the more left-back orientated one. He's at Milan, so we can actually bring him in. That kind of does make sense. Guardi showing off his muscles. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to uh, flex on you guys. Sorry. My bad. Get Tavares um, for left-back. I thought we had Tavares. Isn't that Tavares right there? But he's a right back, not a left back. Lucas, way too expensive. Oh, yeah, true. We don't have that much money, I guess, compared to what we're used to. We only have 100 million, so we have to be kind of careful with our money. Also, we have a qualifying for the Champions League. Rapid Vienna? Really? There's a different one? Oh, it's a different Tavares. Okay, my bad, my bad, my bad. Sorry, 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 sorry. But yeah, if I was doing a tier list, I'd be brutally honest. But just nobody... Who cares about my opinion, right? Like, I'm just some guy that was doing are they brothers these two or what i was a guy that was doing youtube and then stopped doing youtube like what do, what do people care about me tierney is a cheaper option is he really suchu darwin is a beast irl i can keep darwin i can keep darwin nunez i'm, I'm looking at this uh, mateus reese as well no is he any good lucas fernandez Oh my god. What the hell? Who is this? Nathan Yamga. You're getting signed up big time, brother. How the hell have we stumbled up on this guy? Gadi, I followed you from your old days in YouTube. Ashish, I really do appreciate that. Thank you. It's kind of weird that people just... I wasn't here for two years and people are still interested in what I have to do. Yo, what, are, what the hell is up with uh, Nathan Yamga? <laughs> you are... Check the free agents. I know, I didn't realize there would be such a strong... Such a strong presence in free agents. Also, I gotta say another thing about this... Uh, I gotta say another thing about this tier list. I don't know how you don't have... Jared in the top tier. To be honest. Jared has revolutionized... Career mode content, in a way. Jared was the first guy, or one of the first guys, who said, you know what, screw this episodic series. I'm just going to do one video where the whole career mode is in the one video. That's revolutionary. I don't know how you can't have him in Legend of the Scene. Like, I know he hasn't been, like, as big as some of these others for that long, but if that's really all you're doing a tier list for, like, Jesus... Like, if he, if he really just made that based on, like, sub count, like, that's... Because all those top tier guys are all massive sub count guys. And it's kind of just like, well... I, okay, I appreciate that... 
Road to Shore has a large subscriber base, but I don't think Road to Shore is that good of a content creator, personally. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm harking on this too much. I'm, I'm thinking about this too much. But uh, I, I don't know. For me, it just... Uh, I love FNG. I don't want to say things like this. It just seems very, very f uh, fake, this tier list. It just does. Um, Sign Fabio Silva. He is future. Do you have um, any plans to do collab with any YouTubers? Ashish, not at the moment, no. I need to think of something to do that I could do with other YouTubers. And if I was going to, then it, my first couple of ones would be with b Monus and Flickify, to be honest. Jared is my inspir inspiration with my internet in career mode and others. Johnny Castro, that sounds like a sick name. That sounds like a... Um, like Johnny Bravo, like the uh, cartoon. That guy must be a region. He has to be Xander. But who's a defensive midfielder who, from France, who would have retired recently? I can't, I can't think of anyone. Like Kante shouldn't have retired. Yeah, I do with Flickify. He's so good. Yeah, Muhammad. I know Flickify is good. I've been saying it from the beginning of when I started streaming. Like he's making the cleanest content in career mode right now, in my opinion, by far. Who are we looking up? Johnny Castro. Can I just look up Castro? Cat Castro. All right, Johnny, Johnny, where are you? No, there's no Johnny. There's Javier, but there's no Johnny. There's Christian Castro. It seems like a Vieira region. Vieira or Matsuidi? Maybe Matsuidi, actually. Yo, it must be Matsuidi because he did retire when we were at Inter Miami. That's true. Maybe I'll have to switch formation to include... You know what we might do? We might have Vald, Vald Schmidt as a backup striker or Nunez as a backup striker and play three midfielders. So I might make this a 4-3-3. But I don't know. I feel harsh. Dropping either one of them is kind of harsh. But I feel like it's better for the squad at the moment. We're gonna get this guy straight in, or should he? Or should we play one of these blokes instead? Who who should who should play the third midfield position? Pedrinho can play right mid, isn't it? Pedrinho can play right mid. That's true. I might I might actually do that. I might actually change him to a right mid. Do you create any new tactics to each player? Honestly, Ashish, I haven't gotten into that. So play Florentino as the CDM. Really? Yamga? Yamga should be in that third position. Put Yamga in for Weigl. Okay. Weigl's in the thumbnail, so don't you guys tell me to sell him. I'm not going to sell him. Plus, I like Julian Weigl. He's personally a favorite of mine. See, Yamga looks like more like a center mid. He looks more combative. He's got the pace. He's got the physicality. Whereas Julian Weigl is more defensive. I'm actually thinking the other way around is better. I'm disagreeing with you guys. I'm actually thinking Yamga as a as a center mid. I think we just train him to be a center mid. Wingardi makes inter interest with internet. Ah, oh. you said interest. <laughs> Jared is my inspiration with yeah my interest in career mode. Yeah, okay, <laughs> I see what you mean. <laughs> I see what you mean. See how long it takes y uh, to train Yang, but Yang Yamga. That's gonna be a difficult name to say, I think, for me personally. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I did mix that up. I mixed up interest and internet, right? I'm pretty stupid, aren't I, Jamie? Anyway, Jared was your inspiration, and that's pretty cool, because it's kind of strange for me to think, like, uh, someone like Jared is now inspiring other people. It's kind of weird. I've known Jared for a re really long time. I've been watching Jared for a really long time. Was, Jared was one of my inspirations at eight as well, so... All right, let's give him uh, some boots, right? Let's give... What, what boots should we give him? Let's give him these uh, white and pink ones. Or shall we give him black and pink ones? Let's give him black and pink ones. Let's give him those ones. And then, um, and then I'll quickly do... Lol, you have the animated picture like Flickify on Twitch. Yeah, I, uh, I, I had that made at the same time as Flick did. Or, or just very, very close to when Flick had that made. Alright, development plan. Are you gonna sell Pizzy? Gardi, check Rafinha or Sa? for right now okay so yamga let's see what it takes to be a center mid 27 weeks is not too bad i'm pretty happy with that 
Are there any other positions we want to change? Not, not for now, right? I kind of want to focus... We're in July 23rd, so I kind of want to bring some a center back in specifically. Hey, bring back Matic. Ah, we're so stacked in midfield. I just don't think that's a good move. What about this um, Tap Sober guy? Is he any good? Or should I wait for him to come through with the scouting report? Also, 51 mil. To... So we might get Tavares for left back. Also, Bernardo Silva is going to be way too expensive. We can't bring Bernardo. Okay, Jovic, no. Jovic is out. Tierney is going to be 35 mil. Braderidge is going to be 21 mil. I kind of want to go with uh, Domagoy. Calendar is a free agent. Agume is 3.4 million, apparently. Ain't nobody tear me off the drugs, says Caden. Caden, I don't get it. I f you know what, Caden? I feel like it's all cap. I feel like you just say these things and it's not true. To be honest, I've, I've stopped believing you. Hope you're a good guy. What's going on, Callum? Good to see you, dude. Untuck his t-shirt. Albie, that's the first thing I do with any, like, regens. Is the first thing I do is untuck the t-shirt. We've got 30 people watching. What's going on? 18 likes as well, so... Thank you very much to everybody that's liking the stream. If you have any transfer suggestions, please let me know in the chat, because we've still got plenty of time. Uh, we're coming up to a qualifier game against Rapid Vienna, I believe that is. Get calendar. We will get calendar. I just want to sort out the other signings first. Imagine someone signs calendar. Konate. We're going into full lockdown again. Callum, I saw that. I did see that. We are the complete opposite. We've, we're getting zero new cases a day, and we're getting out of lockdown. So, it's my turn to live a little. You guys have been living this whole time. It's my turn to live a little. Why did it go into the Champions League graphic already, man? Seriously. So, Gonzalez to Lil. And they want to give us Rinildo as well. And Waldschmidt. Oh, no. Lazio want him. Should we let him go? A swap deal. I feel like we might even just accept this. I mean, like, do we really want Yoni Gonzalez? I don't even know who this guy is. Maybe we'll just reject it now. Do we want Waldschmidt to go? Get calendar for the memes. Yeah, I will. Many of my friends didn't know you came back for streaming, so I shared your stream links. Oh, thank you very much, Ashish. I appreciate that, dude. Thank you very much. I've fallen out with my best friend too. No, Callum, what have you fallen out over? They're thinking of putting a 9 o'clock curfew for restaurants here. Albie, we had a curfew as well. Sell the center forward. Should I sell Waldschmidt? If I can get like 70 mil for him, I might sell him. Is 70 million a good uh, a good price? Such a long story, bro. Callum, I got time. I got plenty of time. Ask for big, big money. Look up Konate. Yeah, Bryant, I will actually. Yeah, thank you for reminding me. So let's let's go for 75. Let's ask for 75 milli. Let's go. We have a 10 o'clock curfew for restaurants in the UK. We had a we had a curfew for everything, not just restaurants. We had a cur like you couldn't be out at that time. After that time. Unless you were going to work. Work was the only thing you're allowed to go. Cheers, mate. Let me think how to say it. Yeah, Callum, honestly, take your time. I'm here all day. Now, these, they don't want to offer. They don't want to offer big money. Nah. I'm sorry. La Lazio are not being serious about it. Sorry. They, they, uh, you know, I come to the negotiation table. I expect you to take it seriously. Don't, don't you know, mess me around like that. Doesn't really matter because we're going back into full lockdown on Thursday. Ah, oh, that sucks. That does suck. <clears throat> best of luck with you guys. How many cases are you getting a day? But best of luck. Because uh, lockdown does suck a little bit. This glitch though, I hate. Don't you think it spoils gaming mo uh, mood? Yeah, Ashish, I can't wait for to be playing with mods, to be honest. I know you're probably telling me to move on. Uh, Callum, <laughs> how dare you assume such a thing? <laughs> Look at Trin Chow for right mid. Dude, we don't need right I, I need to look up... Um... <laughs> okay, he's too expensive. I need to look up Konate. Like a few thousand, around 300 deaths. So that sucks. That really does suck. Uh, Ibrahima Konate. From... He's at West Ham at the moment. Have you heard about the France incident? No, Ahmed, I haven't. Uh, have a look at Talvin. Basically, she's been through a lot. Oh, I see. This is... Uh... This is gonna... I reckon this is gonna be one of those ones, Callum, where I tell you to move on. Uh, Gardi the... <laughs> Gardi the Adias glitch is fixed. Check Kana. I don't mind Florian Talvin as a... As a, um, as a shout, to be honest with you. I don't mind that. Yep, I told you. 
Callum, still tell me the story because I might be... I might be willing to listen. Uh, Jamie says on PC right now. What is it? The Adios glitch is finished on PC right now. Uh, after this save, I will be on PC, I think. I think this will be the last save we do on console, to be honest. Just uh, as a rough... Just as a rough um, guide, I think this will be the, the last thing that we do on console. Have to go bye. Bye, Ahmed. See you, dude. Yeah, I might, uh, I might be doing stuff on... on uh, I might be doing stuff on PC after this. And then hopefully there'll be mods and stuff there as well. I can't wait for FIFA to put out his mod. I can't wait. What season are you in? I guess this would be season three. This would be season three. Or, yeah, yeah, it is season three, yeah. Akram basically attacked the Muslims. Uh, I didn't see that, no. I didn't see that. I also, I don't have an ex enough experience to know what's going on in France, to be honest. Andreas Christensen at Brighton. Guardian on PC, we can get the license back with mods. Exactly, Jamie. We'll have proper Juventus and stuff. Okay, well, we have such a great bond and we understand each other so well. Never had to, never had that with anyone before and I forgot her telling me that she had a BF at the start of lockdown one. Uh, this is not going to end well, is it? Callum, I can already tell where this is going. I don't, I, I this is not going to end well for you. Get yeah, Mukiele, he's a fast center back slash right back. Okay. AC Milan save on PC. Yeah, we'll definitely be dab we'll, like. Because we'll have the second. I think we'll have the second division. I think mods will add a second division. And because they'll put the real badges and kits and stuff, we'll definitely do Serie A at some stage. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> I was like, where? He's, a, he's apparently a right back and he's at Barca and he's 58 million. I think we might miss Mukiele. I think I don't think I'll go for him. Hmm, but the thing is, she's been sending me exes and basically fell for her. As, and I told her, as I told her all of my personal experiences. It's <clears throat> Callum, it is hard when you open up to someone, you do feel closer to them. It's kind of why they say that um, patients tend to end up falling in love with their like psychologists and stuff. Because it's it's natural, right? Like, you tell somebody all that, you feel like your bond is strong and stuff. I actually get that. I actually 100% get that. Alright, let's have a look if Konate's finished. Did he even need... Did Konate need scouting? Ooh, this guy's 82 rated. Yo, I want to go for this guy. Hey, Gardy, how are you? Samuel Perez, what's going on, dude? Good to see you again, Samuel Perez. Your human tendency. Yeah, it is a Callum feel you, bro. Look, look at everybody getting around Callum. Exes mean now, really, Callum, unfortunately. Oh, that is also true. <clears throat> Joe Hay makes a really good point. Females see exes as less important than males. Males think like an ex is like the biggest thing ever, but females think exes are just like normal. They're like, oh, it's just an ex. Like, it's just like, you know what I mean? Xander, mate, where are those suggestions coming from? You're making me so happy with these Arsenal players. Gab Gabriel or Saliba? No, no, no Arsenal players today. I don't want to think about Arsenal today. Yeah, I want to go for this guy. Let's undercut them as well. Let's see what they say. I'm back. Hi, what's going on, Archie? Good to see you. What? 39.8 plus Pedrinho. Jesus. Okay. Do we want to keep Pedrinho? Is Pedrinho really good? What other midfielder? Because we do have a lot of midfielders, but I don't know who I'd be willing to... Maybe Chiquinho. Maybe Chiquinho. Good bro on you. Yeah, Samuel Perez, I'm very good. Thank you very much. Well, Eric says it's worth it. Pedrinho is good. When did the stream start, says Samuel Perez? Uh, we have been up for about 45 minutes now. Try to lower the price. I'm a Benfica fan, but I hate Pedrinho. Wow. Who should I keep, Pedrinho or Chiquinho? If I had to keep one of them, which one would I keep? 
I feel like Chiquinho, he's 27 years of age and 80. I reckon I should get rid of him. Let's try and give him Chiquinho and 20 million. I got a few messages. Um, you ain't red, bro. Oh, sorry. She doesn't want to cut me off and I don't want to cut her off. I mean, that that's down to you now. Oh, they want... Okay, they do want... They do not mind taking Chiquinho, but they want 51 million on top. Callum, if I could give you some advice, it's, it's down to you now. If she doesn't want to cut you off and you don't want to cut her off, it's down to you. Do you think that you will be able to just be friends with her? You got to be honest with yourself and you also got to be honest with her because it's kind of not fair on her as well. You got to think. You got to think about... I mean... Well, actually, no. If she's happy to still be friends with you and you have feelings for her, I don't know. Maybe she somewhat likes you. You never know. I don't want to I don't want to give you too much hope here, but... Her thing is, her BF told me to cut me off. <clears throat> and she still doesn't want to? She still doesn't want to cut you off, even though her boyfriend told you to cut you off. Gadi has the best potential center backs in the game now. Do I really? She doesn't want to, but she's always going to listen to him. I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Um. Honestly. Hey, where's my man's? Oh, there he is. Honestly, that's very tough. Like, if she's going to listen to him because he's uncomfortable with your friendship. I got to be honest with you, Callum. I kind of agree with the boyfriend. I might be different from a, a lot of other people. Um, yo, Ryan with the 449 euro. You're nice to Callum. Ryan, dude, I appreciate that very much. Thank you, dude. I'm not, I, I think I'm nice to everyone. I like to think I'm nice to everyone. But I, I gotta be, now I gotta be honest with you, Callum. And this is just, I know this is gonna be difficult to hear. And even if I tell you, you may not want to listen, but I kind of agree with the boyfriend here. Like, a, a friendship between a male and female without feelings can exist. But... Obviously, if, if, she, if he knows that you have feelings for her, and you're also friends, like, I, I gotta kind of agree with the boyfriend here. Personally, I'm I'm of the belief, and I don't know what you boys think. I'm of the belief that a a, a guy and a girl um, can't really be friends forever without some feelings developing between them. I don't know. I just think it's a natural thing for humans of the opposite. Well, if that's what you prefer, um, I always think that. It, that, the, that feelings develop regardless. And that might be a, from personal experiences. It might be purely anecdotal. And maybe there are people out there that genuinely have had a male and female friendship that has been purely friendship. Like, no feelings whatsoever. And if that's the case, then maybe some, one of them was ugly. I don't know. But like... <laughs> I don't know. I'm trying to put a little lighthearted note on it. But, um... Uh, why is that then? Curious, boys. Um, I don't know why, which... Uh, Callum, what what are you asking about? Why is what? Why is that then? I don't know which I don't know which point you're asking the question about, but I just think, yeah. What did I miss? Uh, we're trying to get Callum through. We're trying to get Callum through some stuff, and we also had a super chat from Ryan. So shout out to Ryan. I don't think Ryan has said anything other than that super chat. So thank you to Ryan. Shout out to you, dude. You must be one of those ones that just lurks in stream. Sanchi P says, yo, 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 why you agree with the BF? Because, Callum, it's, um, it's just one of those things. I mean, I don't know if you want to say that he's threatened, but I think he's threatened, to be honest. I don't, and people will say, well, he's being overprotective. I don't think he's being overprotective. I think he's just being protective. Well, Cage's thread says it as well, because he's being protect because he's protective over his GF. It's natural. I think so too. I think so too. 
Yeah, yeah, just asking. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not, I'm not, you know, that's, it's a very reasonable thing to ask. Don't worry about that, Callum. Like, uh, I'm not saying this is an easy situation. And I, I'll be honest with you, I don't think there's a right or wrong here. But, um, I guess, the, imagine you were in his shoes. Imagine you were going out with this girl, right? And then she had a friend who had feelings for her and they were spending all this time together and you never know like that might for her develop into something as well so i think that's very natural from the boyfriend like i remember meeting up and she grabbed my hand in a weird way yeah see that that's the thing you tend to think about these little things that these might like little um actions that she's done you'll start trying to identify all of them um and you'll start trying to like what does this mean? What does that mean? Like, I've been there too, dude. I have been there. I, and Callum, can I just be completely honest with you? I was in your exact position. I was best friends with a girl in high school, late high school. We worked at the same place and we went to the same school. And she had a boyfriend who also worked where we worked. And, um, but it didn't go to our school. And so when we were working, it was a... Uh, like all the attention was going to the boyfriend obviously but when we were at school like we were best friends and i thought there was something more there i always thought that there was something more there like i always thought there was something she wasn't saying to me or something that she wasn't admitting to herself about me right and i was friends with her for years and i had feelings for her for years and then eventually I told her and we stayed friends, but it, it wasn't the same. And then eventually she actually started like ghosting me and eventually just wore off and we weren't friends anymore. And I could tell you from a personal experience, I think the best thing for me, for my personal mental health, for my personal, uh, for me to, for me to get, for me to be okay, and not think about this stuff constantly, the best thing was to not talk to her. The best thing was to actually cut her off. What does ghosting mean? She started like not responding to messages and stuff. Or in the middle of a conversation, she just stopped responding. But the best thing for me, and where I started becoming much more happy and much more confident, was when I stopped talking to her. Not that she was doing anything to make me feel not confident, like not actively, but just the fact that the constant rejection of that it like the constant like not not again not active rejection just the constant the the not reciprocating my feelings or the way i was talking to her that constant loop is not good for you and if that's gonna be how it goes moving forward i would honestly say that the best thing for you to do and i know <laughs> i know you predicted that this was what you were gonna say but I think the best thing for you is to move on. But I will also say this. I don't know if I should say this part of the story. But a few years later, she ended up um, like towards the tail end of her <laughs> relationship with her boyfriend. She ended up cheating on him with me. So there you go. But I don't know if that has anything to do with the rest of the story. That is, you know what I mean? That is, uh, don't. You can just, uh, you know, that part of the, <laughs> that part of the story is not important. You know what I mean? <laughs> Look at the reaction from the boys. <laughs> yeah, she actually ended up doing that. Um, Imposter Gatti. Yeah, full on, right? No, but the, the important part was, no, no, hold on. No, 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 wait. Bef <laughs> Before you guys start, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Before you guys start reacting to that, um, the reason I think she wanted me later is because I cut it off. Also, we're one nil down in these qualifying games. That's not good. I want to be part of the Champions League. Guardi, smooth criminal. Guardi from deep. Yeah, I pulled up from three and I, I sunk. Mr. Steal your girl. Honestly, no cap. It felt really good to... Um, to have one up over him. Wait, that looks like Motherwell's badge. Or am I tripping? My guy legendary. Bro, Ryan dropping another three pound fifty. <laughs> Gotti, what a comeback, mate. 
Guardy at the back post. I know. <laughs> Did you guys? <laughs> Do you guys like how I set that up? <laughs> oh my god. No, but that's not the important part of the story, Callum. I don't know what Callum has been saying. Um, he like he knows I'm a threat. Hundred percent, Callum. Hundred percent. It's hard to, especially when I've told her everything. Another thing you have to think of, Callum. Another thing you ha you have to consider, right? And this is what I realized after with my situation she cheated on him and all that you got to imagine this if she ends up cheating on him with you you can never trust this girl i'm just telling you right now if she cheats on him there is nothing stopping her from cheating on you so it's kind of a, a double-edged negative also shout out to ryan can we get some love for ryan in the chat please can we get some love for ryan in the chat please thank you very much ryan Uh, Gadi, one question. That guy came for you for fight? No, Ashish. I actually saw him in public, like, a, a year later, after we both stopped talking to her, she was single and whatever. I saw him a year later, and, um... No cap? I thought he wanted to beat my ass, but, uh, he didn't. No cap. I thought he was gonna, like... He was looking at me, like, he, we were... He was at a restaurant, and I was in, like, the shopping center, like, in the mall area, and he was in... He was in the restaurant, and he looked at me like he wanted to go. I think because it was a public place, like, he didn't do anything. And no cap, it would be an even contest. Like, he's a pretty big guy. Like, I got reach on him. Like, he's pretty short, but he's a big guy. Like, he's huge. Look at all the love for Ryan. Thank you very much. Shout out to Ryan, dude. Two super chats. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate that very much. Um, also, her BF keeps changing his mind. May I ask Callum, how old are you? Yeah, that's also important, Callum. How old are you? Cause that that kind of it because some things seem important when you're younger but they're not guardian two pack vibes <laughs> i love the reaction to that story you guys had like <laughs> back of the back post um pulling up from three and stuff like that <laughs> guardian's imposter i'm 19 okay yeah so callum bro that's insane that was literally the age that i was when like this sort of stuff was happening i was maybe a little bit younger i was 17 i think then I cut her off, and then we ended up, uh, you know, you know what I mean? Later, at like 19, 20. What the fuck? Yeah, I mean, it's a little bit, I was a little bit younger than you when it happened, actually. Um, we need a left back. I think, is Tierney the left back that we go back to FIFA, right? <laughs> Do we want to talk about FIFA for a bit? I don't. I actually like this conversation. Callum, mate, you got to give it the boot. That's mad. Yeah, legit, Callum. That's actually insane. I think, um, actually, I think a lot of guys go through this. Callum, do what's right. Use your feelings. You know it to be true. That's another thing, Callum. I'll tell you why you're indecisive. Because you don't want to give up that opportunity. You know what it is, Callum? In your mind right now, you're thinking to yourself, but if there's just a chance, like, if there's just even a, a 5% chance... I'm willing to roll the dice. That's what you're thinking. And I know that's what you're thinking. Anyway, um, is Tavares the left back we want to go to? Do what Gadi says, not what he did. <sighs> Xander, you know what? You may be right with that. <laughs> you may be right with that. But with the girl, with this girl, it's different. Guys, who do you want as left back? Real quick, we'll come back to this conversation. Do or do not, there is no try. Albi makes a very good point. You either do or you do not. Scout him first. Uh, we know how much he's worth. He's worth 24 million. So if you compare that to like uh, a Tierney who's 35. Or a, a Brad. I reckon he's going to be like high high 70s rating. Mate, it's not different. You're just stuck in it. Yoda vibes. Also, so KJ's threat makes a good point. It's not that much different from other girls. I remember a girl called Lucy who aired me so much. Oh, that's that's what I should have used it. Instead of ghosted, I should have said aired. Um, what is the situation? I'm confused. Oh, uh, Harry, it's a bit of a long story. It's um essentially... Our guy Callum, our boy Callum, is um, has a girl that he likes and that he's really close with, but she has a boyfriend. 
And the boyfriend's telling her to cut him off. That's the general gist of it. There's like little other bits and pieces in there. But that's the general gist of it. We're going to rest a bunch of players for this. I might play that second leg. Callum is a G. Callum is a G. So is Ryan. Ryan is a G. No cap. Ryan is a G. Dude, I think you're out of UCL. Is it not two legs, Bryant? Bryant. Don't, tell me it's not... It's two legs. It's not one leg. It's two legs. Bare knuckle fight seems like the only solution. Winner gets the bird. All right, gotta go. Bye, says SPK. No worries, SPK. Good having you, dude. Um, long term, Callum, you'll be stronger, more experienced for this. Once you get it out of the way, it's not the be all and end all. That's true. Joe's very. I mean, everything seems bigger in the moment. That's hundred percent true. Everything seems bigger in the moment. All I'll tell you, Callum, is is if if she's gonna leave the guy and get with you. But it's still for me, Callum, it's still for me a double negative. You either get her, and then you have to worry about, well, what if the next guy comes along and she likes him more than me? Or you don't get her, and it's going to be upsetting for a little bit, but you'll get over it. It's one or those, one of those things. Because, truth be told, time will heal this. Like, uh, if you do plan to move on with it, eventually, if it doesn't work out, like if you want to try for another couple months or however long, but if you eventually have to move on, time will heal that. Trust me. But, just know this as well. Sometimes, you cut it off with them and they want you more. And then, uh, a year down the line, they cheat on their boyfriend with you. Just so you know. The, the luckiest thing for me was when that happened, um, I didn't even want her anymore. She wanted me more than I wanted her. So there you go. Time doesn't heal pain. It just teaches you how to live with it. Itachi. Yo, Hyper JJ, what's going on, dude? Good to see you. Um, yeah, I w again, yeah, actually, I wouldn't say that it it, do it does heal it, Hyper JJ. But because te teaching you how to live with it is healing, if you think about it. Learning to live with it is part of the healing. <laughs> A lot of respect for what you're dealing with ATM, Callum. Yeah, me too, Callum. This is, by the way, this is not an easy situation. I'm sure this has happened to a multitude of guys and each one has taken a different path in how to deal with it. Like, this is not an easy decision for you and it's not an easy situation to be in. And it's, I guarantee you, it's something you're going to think about for a long time. So I don't envy you. But just know, Stream Chat and Guardi have got your back. Always, always. I want to. I want. I want updates on this, Callum. I want updates on this story. No cap. I want updates on this story. Some pain cannot be healed. Ashish, you're probably right. There are some things. Some, I would agree with that. There are some things that probably cannot be healed. But for something like this, I believe that time would heal this. Personally, I think I want to stick by her because she's been through a lot. So I can be there if she needs me. But I want to focus on myself too. That's it, Callum. You, you make the decision that you feel you want to make. Callum, don't trust. Guardi will bring you to the dark side. Jamie, don't say things like that. Come on now. But now you're back from outer space. I come in here to find you with that sad look upon your face. I should have changed the stupid look. I should have made you leave the you, you keys. Albie, what are you talking about? <laughs> Albie says there is conflict in in the there is conflict in the boy and Gadi's pulling him to the dark side with the story of the girl cheating on with him. I'm not pulling him to the dark side. G come on, chat. Don't turn on me like this. You were all loving that story. When I told you that story, you were all laughing and, and saying, what a guy and things like that. You know what I mean? Gadi, are you actually enjoying FIFA 21? Yo, Harry, it's not that bad. I'll be honest with you. It's not even that bad of a game. But, Jesus, they got to do more with it next year. But um, but for real, this is a very good starting point. If they f actually take things seriously now, it's going to be a good game. i got good feelings about it. And I'm pretty critical on FIFA as well. Because of comebacks, we laughed, Guardi. <laughs> yeah, look. No, my, my situation was not a positive if I still had feelings for her. But I didn't. If I still had feelings for her and she ended up cheating, I would have been in a pretty bad position because I would have ended up like being in a relationship with her and she probably would have ended up cheating with me. Probably. I don't know. I can't say for sure. 
Gardy, who's your favorite singer rapper? Nah, I. Uh, if you had feelings, Gardy, that'd fuck with your head. A hundred percent. And that's honestly, I was at the point, Joe, where I had matured quite a bit, where I knew that I didn't have feelings for her. Because I kind of saw her as like a little bit of like a, a sad person, to be honest. Are you still in contact with her, Gardy? Ashish, no cap. I actually kind of am. Yeah. I mean, I before I got with before I got my girlfriend, I was, but not not much anymore. Like we, like we check up. It's weird, honestly. It's it's actually kind of weird. Ashish, like we actually kind of are friends now. Like um, like when we check up on each other, it's just on a legit friend basis. And I know that goes against everything I said, but we're not that close. It's just like a, every couple of months we say, you know, you know, how's life? Or that, she posts something on Instagram. I say, oh, like congratulations at work and things like that. Very, very small things. But we're not as close as what we were when I had feelings for her or even after that. So it's just a very um, respectful, cordial kind of relationship where it's, you know, Congrats. I think she has a boyfriend now anyway. So it's like, uh, I, you know, I say things like congrats at work and stuff for her promotions and things like that. And she's, you know, she's seen my Instagram stories and says this and that. Uh, Gardi, if your girlfriend watches these, I think you might be in trouble. Honestly, Albi, there's no need for my girlfriend to even consider it. I've told her about her. I told her all like the story. Um... I, I, to be fair, I haven't told her that, like, there's been a couple of messages sent, just, like, congratulatory stuff and things like that. But in my opinion, it's not really a big deal. Like, to be honest, she might think it's a big deal. But I'll cross that bridge when I get to it. Um, play against Rapid. I have to play against Rapid. I have to get a W here. Um, we still haven't signed a left back, but that's okay. I guess Tavares could do a job there. On Chalvez at right wing. All right, let's go. Like, is it wrong to mind my distance but check up on each other every now and then? No. I, I actually think that's the best thing you can do. Gaudi, we all know that Albi is your GF. Has says, how are you? I'm good, dude. How are you? Ryan said three-way. I don't know who he's talking to and uh, who's involved in the three-way. That's the reason I said you might get in trouble. College starts tomorrow. Post your GF last one. Callum, stay strong, bro. Oh, for your GF last one. Bro, Ryan, you have gone above and beyond today, dude. You should have just considered being a member instead of donating this much, but I appreciate it. Thank you very much, dude. You should get the little badge next to your name and everything. Certified G is what you should become. But thank you very much, dude. I very much appreciate that. Another £2.30 for Ryan. So let's just... Ryan with a hat trick. Exactly. Let's get some love around Ryan. Bloody hell, Ryan. Ryan love heart. Ryan big champ. Everyone is getting around Ryan here. As they should. Ryan OP. Ashish Phillips says Ryan OP. Legit OP. Ryan has dominated today. Ryan is the MVP today for sure. Unless someone outdoes him, Ryan is the MVP today. <laughs> I don't expect anybody to outdo him. Uh, who have you signed? Ryan 99 pace. Hmm. She's also sick. What does that mean? Let's go Ryan. Let's go champ Ryan. What does sick mean? I'm not very familiar with that. Yeah, I guess that's like a religion or something. It's a religion? Okay, cool. <laughs> Sign someone called Ryan. She's Indian, says Ashish. What's that mean? Is that uh, an Indian religion? Also, Ryan, shout out, dude. Big, big shout out to Ryan. Thank you very much, man. I do appreciate that. The the fact that you split it up in three as well keeps the hype going. I love that. She speaks Punjabi. Oh, so she's Indian. Okay. Oh, wait. No, what? Italian? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Italian, but she's Indian? What? What? Gadi, you were the chosen one. You were to bring you. <laughs> you were to bring balance to the force and not leave it. Are you guys really calling me Anakin Skywalker? Are you guys really calling me Darth Vader for that story? Come on now. 
Sam, who have you signed? Um, we've signed a center back from Atletico Madrid. And that might be it. <laughs> we, but we need, we need a left back. Has. So if you can think of a left back, we might have one... Um, we may have one already ready to go. We've also signed a free agent that was, I believe, Matt Tweedy's regen. It's this guy here, Yamga. This guy, number 18. So we've signed a few players. Gone, gone, Chalvez. One touch on his right. Oh, he pushes it wide. Basically, she has family situations that are barriers. Okay, so she has, like, strict parents, right? What does that have to do with your situation, Callum? Yeah, I don't know what the um, religion... Is it because she has strict parents? Is that why you're saying that? My girlfriend has strict parents. Oh, Darwin. Yes, sir. Through to Everton. Who we nearly sold accidentally for 50 million. We nearly accidentally sold Everton for 50 million. Guardi, you're a Sith. Honestly, if you guys are calling me Anakin, I don't even mind. There could be a lot worse characters I could be in Star Wars than Anakin. That could be Jar Jar Binks. Or Jabba the Hutt. Nice, nice play here. Goncalves on his right again, and this time he doesn't miss. Okay, this team feels really, really good. Is this a season two of the journeyman? This is season three, actually. Jar Jar Bunks. Ricardo Rodriguez. Ah, that is complicated then. Bro, I like Hernandez. Okay, so she has family situations that are barriers. Dad, yeah. Okay, so she has strict parents. It's a strange situation, something I've never experienced anyway. Callum, I'll tell you this. No matter what happens, you will come out of it stronger. 100%. Whatever happens is an experience that you'll add to your life. The more experiences you have, I think, like, the stronger you are because the more you know how to deal with certain situations. The more you go through, the more equipped you are to handle future situations. That's how I feel, anyway. I could be wrong, but... <clears throat> if, I, uh, if I was Guardi's size, I'd do the same NGL. Wait, what? TTYL, boys? Oh, Ryan, see you later, dude. <clears throat> Massive shout out to you, dude. Thank you very much for being in the stream today. Thank you very much for the donations. I've not seen your name before, but I hope I see you again, dude. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Um, yeah, I've been through a lot, and I don't want to tell anyone else about them now. Well, think about all the things you've been through, Callum, and think about how, how much uh, stronger you are as a person overall because of some of the experience that, you, you, that you've been through, right? This is going to be one of them. It's just at the moment, you're in it. So it feels bigger than what it is or feels a lot more important at the moment because it is. Because right now is probably the most important time in your life. Well, technically right now is always the most important part of your life because it's, it's the part that you're living. So it feels very, very important. But I guarantee you in like five years, you'll look at this and be like, I was really worried and rightfully so, but now I've grown up. How big are you guys? I'm six foot three. Yo, from last stream, Gar Gar Binks. Yeah, Gar. That's actually true. Gar <laughs> I have been referred to as another Star Wars character. Oh, oh wow. Crossbar. Good eating burger and chicken wings. Oh, nice, Paz. That's delicious. Love myself some burgers and chicken wings. No chips? Just burger and chicken wings? No, uh, no fries with that? I think Paz, Paz, where are you from again? I feel like you're from America. I could be wrong, though. Hmm, it's strange. It's not as bad as what I've experienced. No, I I mean, if you've gone through things, then you've gone through things. Like, this probably doesn't compare to that. But it's still... It's a different kind of challenge, you know what I mean? Not as challenging, just different. Good defending. Uh, you're from Israel. That's right. With fries. Do you guys call it... Um, Do you guys call them fries? What do you guys call them in Israel? We call them chips here. In, in Australia, we call them chips. Hot chips. But then we also call potato chips, like crisps, we call them chips as well. We call them chips in South Africa. Yo, anyone Uchiha clan fans? I am Ashish. I am an Uchiha clan fan. And by Uchiha fan, I mean Itachi. Sasuke, not so much. Not as much. But my favorite character in Naruto is Kakashi. 
It's my guy. Yeah, go on, Darwin. Make a run, sir. Oh, okay. He made the run, but I didn't have the ball. Oh, look at Yamga. He's making some room for himself. That's offside. That is offside. We call them chips, but we call them cr uh, crisps also chips. Yeah, that's how it is in Israel here as well. Um, that's how... What am I trying to say? That's how it is here as well. Same as Israel. We call both chips. We call chips... We call crisps chips, and we call fries chips. Everything is chips. We got no crisps. We got no fries. It's just all chips. Have you seen Everton in the Prem? You mean the player or the team? <laughs> Uh, Hyper JJ says he's the anime guy here, and that is true. He is the anime guy here. So if you want to talk anime, you're Hyper JJ in the chat. Also, I gotta make a Discord server some point this week. At some stage this week, I'm making a Discord server. That's my personal goal for the week. I don't know what the what is the word for it in Hebrew though. Oh. Do you speak Hebrew or no? Oh, good stuff, Darwin. Oh, why did he not pass that to Yamda? What the hell? That was like the perfect hold-up play. Julian Weigel. Oh, bang that, Julian. Oh, decent save from the keeper. Oh, man. Taylor Carney, Carney says the team, man. We by far the greatest team the world has ever seen. Oh, you're talking about Everton, the team, I see. Okay. Gardy, you killed your angry. Hebrew is my first language, but I also speak English and Russian. Nice. Cool. That's pretty cool. Oh, Yamga gets up for the header. He's a big fella. I think he's like 6'2", this Yamga. He complements the midfield well, I feel. On Chalvez. Plays it through to Darwin. Oh. How's No Nut November going, gents? I failed one day in. Strong, says Hyper JJ. Oh, he just played me. That guy just played me. All right, it's one one at the moment on aggregate, so I'm pretty happy with where we are at the moment. We feel I feel like the team is much better than Rapid. Uh, Rapid. I don't know if it's Vienna or not. Rapid someone. I don't know who though. Nice, nice block there. We we've just been really, really solid. Yeah, I'm got nice ball over the top for Everton. Ah, my God. I thought uh, it was cancelled this year due to current circumstances. I've never participated in No Nut November. I'm sorry. I'm not a true G. Oh, Darwin. Darwin, Darwin, Darwin. I love that name, by the way. Darwin Nunez. It's really good. Oh, how did I not get the ball, then? Oh, no. He's all the way through. Sends it in. Oh, very good. Oh, imagine that was a goal. That would have been sick. Oh, man. A header to a header. That would have been a crazy goal. I wanted to... Jay, uh, Joe Hay says, I wanted to tell you something I've never told you. I used to love Newcastle when I was younger. Oh, uh, you're really trying to annoy Joe Hay, huh? You're really trying to piss off Joe Hay. Yo, we've got 36 people watching right now. So shout out to the 36 people. 27 likes on the stream. Shout out to all of you. That's insane. Where are all these people come from? Why does everybody want to watch a, a Benfica career mode? I don't know. Am I going to complain? No. Am I going to see some of these people again? Probably not. You know what I mean? Sometimes you, you got to live... He's offside. I mean, he's as offside as you get, right? Uh, Guardi, I lost my dog on Halloween and I was contemplating my life. No way, Hyper JJ. No way. Like, you lost it like it ran away or like it passed away? Um, Paz, Paz Trapal, you're a brave man. At least you've come to your senses. <laughs> no, I know Joe for a long time from BMO's channel. Well, that's a good channel to be a part of. BMO is a great channel. Great guy as well. Really down to earth guy. Um, also forgot to mention her BF doesn't want us to meet either. Just joined your live stream. It's nice to watch this, Leon. Well, Leon, I appreciate you sticking by, dude. I hope you, um, I hope you're here for the long haul. We got a great community in the chat. Get involved if you want. We've been giving Callum girl advice for the last. I think honestly, we've been talking about it for maybe like half an hour. I know we've stopped now. Technically, we've kind of stopped. But yeah. So yeah, get involved, uh, Leon. Good to see you, dude. And anybody else that's lurking in the chat as well. Anybody that hasn't put a comment in, feel free to. 
put a comment in. Get a shout out. You know what I mean? Max is in here. How many days do I sh uh, stream a week? Max, I stream um usually Sundays through to Thursdays. I did not stream Sunday this week. I st started on Monday, obviously, today. Um, but I will be streaming until Thursday this week. And uh, it's usually around the same time, around 7pm to 10pm UK. Today I'm going to go a little bit longer, and I didn't even explain why. Today is a public holiday in Melbourne, because today is Melbourne Cup Day. For those of you that like your horse racing, today is Melbourne Cup Day. And so, um, yeah, we get the day off here in Melbourne. Only city in Australia that gets the day off. Sucked in everybody else. So, um, yeah, that's why uh, I'm going to go a little bit longer today. Oh, did he save that? Great save by the keeper. That's pet a checking goal right there. Headgear and everything. Man, I don't know how Rapid are still in this game. I'm not even going to lie to you. Oh my god, speaking of Rapid, that guy's quick. I don't know how Rapid are still in this game. Oh, it's a foul. It's not a foul! No way! Anyway, Max, uh, you're a new name as well, Max. I hope I see you. I'm writing my final school exam. I'll try my best to find time to watch. No way, dude. That's sick. What's your final school exam? I don't get it. Oh, Vigel, just hit that. Ooh! Ooh, I can't spell the breed. He ran away. Oh, wait. Your dog ran away on Halloween? Come on, man. That sucks. That is the absolute worst. Man, I've never had a dog, but if it ran away, that would be the absolute worst. Just not knowing where it is. Not to compound your uh, thing. Taylor says, honestly, I've got school tomorrow, so I'm going um, off YouTube for the rest of the night. Uh, no worries, Taylor. It's interesting to see you calm with the game. Yeah, I mean, I'm not over the top. I mean, I do, I, there are moments. Don't, Leon, there are moments where I can get, you know, quite animated. But um, I'm cool, calm, and composed. I got the three Cs. Cool, calm, and collected. Or is it calm, composed? Uh, there's, like there's like six Cs, I reckon. There's cool, calm, collected, composed. Um, can we think of another C word that's like uh, chill? I guess you could... Oh! <laughs> yes, sir. That is a great, great goal right there. Darwin Nunez. Fantastic stuff. Obviously, you know he's good because he's got a man bun. Anybody with a man bun, you know that they're a good, uh, you know they're a good player. Uh, hold on back in a moment. Great plot, twi plot twist, JJ. We found him, but I don't know where I would be, RN, if we couldn't find him. <laughs> Hi, but JJ, you sold me that big time. <laughs> Gardy JJ, you full sold me that. <laughs> Did I say Gardy JJ? Hyper JJ. I read the word Gardy as I was saying Hyper JJ's name. Ga oh, Hyper JJ. If me and you did the fusion dance, it'd be Gardy JJ. Or if we use the Pataro rings or whatever they're called. Earrings, the earrings. That would be our, um, like, uh... That'd be like our, um... What are they called? Gogeta and... What's the other one? Vegito. We would be Gardy JJ. If we fuse, we'd be unbeatable. 100% Hyper JJ. I mean, even separate, we're both pretty undefeatable, right? Oh my god. Give me the ball. Um, Gardy for real by coming. He's a good keeper. Okay, I'll I'll buy coming. I'll get coming. I bought Sammy Kadir and Mustafi Marcel Halstenberg on loan. Pascal Gross on loan. Matt Turner, backup goalkeeper. Pedro Neto. Rob Holding on loan. Fabio Silva and Helder Costa in the sun. That's a huge transfer window, man. A massive transfer window. Ginormous transfer window. Vegito. What's your fave team? Leon, my favorite team is Manchester United. But uh, we're not going to talk about them because, um, you know. We're just not going to talk about them uh, for now. We're going to talk about them after our Champions League game where we win like 6-0. Oh, what a ball. Oh, what a goal. Oh, that's actually scintillating stuff. No, Gardy, you would use the dark side, that's all. I'm not I'm not part of the dark side, I promise. Or so you think. <laughs> Maybe I am Anakin Skywalker, you never know. It, it's possible. Oh, boys. No way. Your boy just won a bet. 
100%. I just want a four leg belt. Bet. Ugh, belt? I just want a four leg bet on soccer. I had a Portland Tim Timbers in the MLS yesterday. So not that I condone betting if you're not of a legal age. Um, so I had uh, Portland Timbers to beat Vancouver Whitecaps in the MLS. I had Braga to beat Family Cow in Portugal, which is funny because we're playing in Portugal right now. Sim to result, jump to result. Okay. We're going to trust our team to hold uh, this lead and we're going to jump to result. I had Braga to beat Family Cow and they won 1 0 with a 76th minute winner after Family Cow got a red card. And I currently have Villarreal to win. They're winning 2 0 against the Real Valladolid. And Lecce to beat Pescara in the second division of France, and they're winning th uh, of the second division in Italy, and they're winning three one. I'm gonna win like sixty bucks off that. That's sick. All right, so we did win three nil. They had a disallowed goal or a penalty, a missed penalty, but we go through. We're in the Champions League. That's it. We did it. We're in the Champions League. Like stream boys. Callum says like stream boys. But to be fair, we got thirty one likes and twenty eight people watching, so it's not a bad. Not a bad ratio, I would say. Uh, Leon says, it's my fave English team, but the defense is trash. Are you talking about Manchester United? Jamie Vardy is carrying my FPL team, says Harry. I don't even have an FPL team this year. Just because every single year I do the same thing with FPL. I make a team. I'm excited. First couple of weeks, done. I'm not even checking it anymore. Um, <laughs> by Tavares now. Okay. We should have bought Ruben Semedo as well. Ruben was um, at Sporting Club de Portugal, wasn't he? Okay, so Tavares is a 78 rated. I'm, I'm happy to bring him in. I wish Rio and Vidic, Immortals. Yeah, that was a great partnership. JJ, that would be much better if Yoda said that. Wilson and Grealish carrying mine. Should have had a Guardi FC League, says Harry. Yeah, I should have, eh? I should have. I missed that opportunity, Harry, unfortunately. 36.4 milli. All right, let's go for... How about 28? That's not a bad offer, is it? 28 and a half. Keep the half a million just for yourself for some change. Oh, he really wants 36. Okay. All right. A couple shadow clone right here going at each other. 32. How about 32? Gardy, can you make the Discord server, please? Jamie, I, I promise I'll make it this week. I promise. Head is in the chat, says, what's up? What's going up? Head. Good name. Um, Gardy, good idea about the Discord. Yeah, yeah I'll, I promise I'll do it. I, I might have it ready for next stream. And I'll, I'll have the link and everything, and you guys can join the link. Um, Tavares agent. Importante. Muy, muy. Um, different is the wound of the heart from the wound of the flesh, says Albi. Right, boys, the missus is on the scene, so I'll be off, says Cages Thread. Enjoy your time, Cages Thread. Hey, don't do anything I wouldn't do. Um, I would destroy Guardian at... Wait, what? How dare you, Jamie? Are you turning on me, Jamie? Almost as if you're part of the dark side. Almost as if I'm starting to get some... Um, some evil coming out of you. Get uh, Diogo Jota from Liverpool. I was actually kind of looking at our attacking offense. Uh, our attacking options. Like, who do we have? We have actually quite a few options. No cap. We actually have quite a few options. So Tavares will come on for Tavares. Are they related, you think? No, uh, one of them is much darker skin, but still, they could still be related. I was kind of looking at our, our offensive options. Like, this guy's pretty good. Servi or Chervi, I don't know. Suss on Jamie? Yeah, I'm Suss on Jamie as well. Yo, 38 people watching. Shout out to everybody watching. Shout out to everybody that's liked the stream. Portuguese, too. Yeah, Jota is Portuguese. I just don't know where we played Jota. Like, um, I like Gonçalves on the right, and I like Everton on the left. Flick Raid? He's actually done it? No, nah, he hasn't actually done it, has he? No, nah, he's, he's memeing. Flick Raid? Oh, he's actually done it. Flick has actually streamed and actually raided. No way. He's remembered. Yo, shout out to Flickify. Thank you very much, dude. Flick Raid Pog? Angry World Cup Gaming is from Flick. Tim Games, XP from Flick. 41 people watching. Hype. Actual hype. What's going on, everybody? Tim Games, XP is in here. Hog raid. Yeah. Huge raid. Massive. Shout out to Flick. With his... I hate the word pog, says Callum. <laughs> Brent says raid. Apex Penguin raid. Teddy Fenwa. Came from Flick. What's going on, guys? Welcome to the... Um... Welcome to the uh, stream. Flick is a great content creator. So I'm... If you guys like Flickify, you should like me. But maybe not. 
Maybe not. Flick is better than me. So there you go. Why Ihateren? Came from Flick. Um, and Pepega. <laughs> What's going on, guys? How did um how did his PSG thing end? Can somebody fill me in on what Flick did on his PSG um journeyman? Abdul Rahman says, hey bro, what's going on, dude? LFC, LCFC Robbie says, already liking the look of this. What's going on, LCFC Robbie? For those of you that are not aware, we're in our third season here. We were we did two seasons with Inter Miami. Uh, now we're with uh, SL Benfica, of course. And we have a manager that's called Female Undertaker. Shall I show you why she's called Female Undertaker? I think it's pretty clear cut why she's called Female Undertaker. <laughs> he signed Fatty, Weya, and Kamavinga. I was actually in there when he was signing Kamavinga, yeah. But then I got told by my chat that he was signing Fatty. Which is a good signing, by the way. Great, great signing for PSG. Do you watch wrestling, says Angry World Cup Gaming? Yeah, I do. I don't I don't watch WWE nowadays. I keep I, I kind of keep up with what's going on in WWE. But I watch AEW and New Japan Pro Wrestling. Those are my two favorite uh things to watch we got 48 people watching your shout out to the 48 people watching um shout out to the 35 likes on the stream thank you very much i appreciate that very very much um so just to fill everybody in that's new we just qualified for champions league we had to play a couple qualifying games you know what i'm noticing guys defense not that many options in defense that's what i'm noticing straight off the bat not that many options in the defensive uh, position, specifically centre-back. We've got plenty of midfielders, it has to be said. 36 likes now. It's actually 39 likes now of 49 people watching. Flick, if you're still in the chat, I appreciate it very much. Thank you very much for the uh, raid. Finally, I've been asking for the raid for so long. He finally gets it. Um, this is Epicon. He's in the chat. <laughs> uh, hey, all you can do is ask, right? Eventually, Flick will remember. I mean, it's difficult. I mean, when I end streams, I want to raid someone as well. But I got nobody to raid, and I also forget. Um, the legend Flick finally came through. Yeah, I know. I've been bad-mouthing him so much that he eventually did it. <laughs> nah, that's just cap. I don't do that. Flick is a very good guy. Give Calendar a start. We don't even have Calendar yet. Lindelof? But I don't know if I want a new starting... Look how many midfield... Oh, this guy can play centre-back. Shall we train him to be a center back? Six foot three. We should. Shout out to him. LCFC Robbie reminded me to be fair. Yo. All props goes to LCFC Robbie. Um, you and Flick should do a co-op ultimate team, says Tim Games X XP. I am down to do a collaboration with Flick at some stage. We just got to figure out what we got to do. What, what kind of series we want to do. We have so many midfield options. It's actually a bit of a joke. I can't even lie. Look how many solid midfielders we have. It's actually a bit of a joke. Uh, Apex Penguin says, Young CB with a lot of potential and quite quick is Gvardiol from Dinamo Zagreb. Starts at 69 but has 86 potential. I think I've seen him before. We have the same centre-back partnership, says Teti. Is a Kabak and... Um, and Tapsoba. I didn't even know who this guy was. My, my chat actually made me aware who, who this guy was. I didn't know who it was. Also, surely Pizzi gets a start. Like, he hasn't started a single game this year for us. And then we have no options of uh, defensive options. That's it. We're going to roll with that. And we're going to sim this. Top journeyman, best team each season wins. Yo. That's not bad. That's not a bad idea. I don't know if Flick's in the chat. That's not a bad idea. But how do you even... Best team each season wins. How do you even judge who the best team is? Like, if we're in different leagues, how do you know who's better? Get the free. Gardy, where's Calendar? I've left him in the free agency. I don't want anything to do with Calendar. <laughs> that guy, he was complaining when he was like 57 rated. Like a co-op speed rebuild. Co-op speed rebuild. So instead it would be a co-op journeyman. Yeah, I, I kind of see it, Flick. But then like if I'm, let's say we start in different leagues and I come third and you come second but in my league it was way more difficult to get third how do you judge whose team is better i don't get it that's the only part that i don't get unless we go to the same teams unless we literally but then how can you even control that that's what i mean like i could come first in like scotland all the time but you and you'll be coming like fourth in spain or something can't believe we're going back into lockdown callum's not happy go to the same leagues says angry world cup gaming but then we might get a season where we don't get the same leagues offered so then what do you do Daddy, you and Flick should do it. 
I want to. I want to do a co collaborative video with Flickify and with Bemonus specifically, and others, but those two first. Or we go to the same league depending on what offers come in. We'll sort it out. All right, Flickify. We'll actually that that sound that does sound cool. We'll we'll figure it out. Do the same leagues. Yeah, I think most seasons we should get the same leagues offered. Has to be said. Most most seasons we should get similar leagues offered at some stage. Like there is potential. Yeah, there's something there, Flick. There's an idea there for sure. Um, get Lingardinho, please. Head-to-head uh, -head rating comparison. That's also not a bad way to do it. Um, how are we? I'm jumping in. I'm jumping in. That's it. It's time for Guardi to take over. It, you know what I mean? It's just embarrassing is what's going on here. Tondela? I've never even heard of Tondela. No, I have. I actually like their color scheme as well. I have heard of Tondela, by the way. Anybody that's going to rinse rinse me for that one, I actually, I actually have heard of them. I'm not only the best FIFA player you've ever seen, I'm also the most knowledgeable FIFA player you've ever seen. Like, look at this skill right here. Look at this. Oh. Bang. 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 Look at this one touch. Yeah, okay. It didn't go to plan. I'm going now. Have a good rest of stream. Well, thank you very much, Tim Games XP, for staying here anyway. Uh, I stream at about this time every day of the week, so some days I might cross over with Flickify, but if you guys aren't watching Flickify and you want to watch some live remote content, do hit me up. Also, this Tavares guy is huge. Is it just me or is he like six foot three, six foot something? He's big. Yo, Addy's here. Addy, you told me you weren't going to be here, dude. You no cap, you told me you weren't going to be here. If you didn't get the same leagues, offers stay another year. I think we could do it based on, on, on rating as well, team rating. But again, then a lot of that comes into play with like the ratings that you actually... Um, Inherit is the word I'm looking for. It's it comes down then it comes down to the team that you actually inherit as well. That also comes into it, which I guess that's that's part of the the, the luck, right? That's part of it. Guardy, that's the original series you were looking for, says Jamie. Um, what days do you stream? Angry World Cup Gaming. I stream from Sundays to Thursdays. I didn't stream this Sunday. Some Sundays I miss out on. Basically, if there's Formula One on, I don't stream on the Sunday because I stay up late to watch it and I, you know. I need to get my beauty sleep. I don't look this good all the time, you know. If I don't get my sleep, I don't look good. Oh, here we go. Vold Schmidt puts it on his right. Got a pass to Pedrinho. He probably shouldn't have passed. Pedrinho puts it back into Vold Schmidt and he puts it over the goalkeeper. Fantastic scene. That was a good goal, actually. That was actually a very good goal. Um, bourbon all day, but custards are nice. Yeah, usually Sunday to Thursday. So there you go. Um, hey, Socrates is in the chat. What's going on? Good to see you again, Socrates. Mavridis. Pitch Gaming says, can I get a shootout? Yes, you can get a shootout. Me and you will have a penalty shootout. You want to do it? Master Bucks rages a lot. Yeah, Master Bucks is also kind of fake. No cap. What season are you in? Um, Teti, I am in season three at the moment, but we were with Inter Miami in the first two seasons. So, uh, this is our first season with Benfica. Actually, the start of the first season with Benfica. Hey, are you really Guardi GF at Albi? Where's your bloody kiwi? Callum, I didn't bring any fruit in with me today. Should I go get my fruit? Would you guys allow me after this game to go get my fruit? I actually didn't bring any food in with me today. Because I woke up a little bit late anyway, so I didn't want to keep you guys... <laughs> I didn't want to keep you guys waiting more than you had to, you know what I mean? I have a bottle of water that's kind of getting me through it, and that's about it. I've only, you know, honestly, these first this first hour and 40 minutes has actually flown by. Like, actually flown by. Masterbucks is a fake YouTuber, says Jamie. Yeah, the last Kiwi was not good, right? No, the last Kiwi was good, I think. There's been a couple of not good Kiwis, but I think the last one was good. Also, I'm so happy that I have, um like, some filters on my microphone, because there is a bloody tool outside being used, and it is so annoying. Someone, someone's doing some. Someone's using a power tool, and it's very annoying. Also, all of a sudden, I, it looks like I can't play FIFA. I'm just giving the ball away for some reason. No way! Get that out of here. Get, get it out. Get it out. Get that touch. Go, Pizzy. Started you for a reason. You're the experience on this team. You've been here for about. How long has Pizzy been at Benfica? I feel like he's been there his whole career. Um, praying for Vienna. What happened to Vienna? I'm pretty sure it wasn't. 
There's an Albi. Rotten Kiwis. Was the last Kiwi I had bad? No, I thought it was good. I can't remember the last bad Kiwi I had. Maybe I've blocked it from my memory. That was a good ball. Medellini. Bang. Oh, he just bullied Quebec. No, I don't. I won't allow that. Oh, good stuff from Conti there. Quebec. Oh, here we go. He's got Quebec is going back in there. Oh no, that was a good turn. That's a goal. Oh, Odysseus. Oh, how do you even say Odysseus? That sounds like a freaking. That sounds like a, either like a god, like an ancient Greek or Roman like god or like a ruler. Odysseus. Wasn't that someone's name? That sounds very familiar. Guys, here is some chicken. Oh, Paz has some chicken for us. He's eating burgers and wings. Odysseus was a... A Roman politician, maybe? Was it? He was something, wasn't he? Can someone look up who Odysseus was? I'm really curious. A god or very similar to one? I feel, I feel like he was a Roman politician. But maybe he was a god. Maybe he's an ancient god. Odysseus. I need to look that up. I'm curious now, but he's in, he's our goalkeeper either way. So I hope he is a God, to be honest. If he's our goalkeeper, I hope he's our God as well. We're just going to refer to him as the God Odysseus. How about that? Oh, nice ball. Nice ball. Oh my God. Hey, crosses this year are really good. Or like chip through balls are really good. Like headers are really good too. He's a Greek king. Okay, so I got it wrong. I said God, I said Roman politician, but I did not say Greek king. Well, oh, I should have known he was a Greek king because but he is Greek. The goalkeeper is Greek. The guy in our goal is Greek as well. Should have known it was Greek, not Roman. Anyway, we've got a Greek king slash Benfican god as the goalkeeper because that was a hell of a save. That was fantastic. I think it's fantastic. I think it's a fantastic idea. Get that out. Quebec has had a really big game so far. Also, how about the comeback, boys? Jota. Duval Schmidt. Chips it over to Pizzi. Oh, what are you doing, Pizzi? What was that? <laughs> what was that from Pizzi? Oh my god. It's alright. We'll just hold on to possession then. Duval Schmidt to Pizzi again. Here we go. He doesn't mess it up this time, but he does give away the ball. It falls to Florentino. Florentino to Volschmidt again. Oh my gosh. Um, it's football, not soccer. It is soccer in some parts of the world. Uh, Angry World Cup Gaming, my favorite football team though, will we'll keep everybody happy, is Manchester United. But we're not going to talk about them today because uh, I'm still not over what happened. I keep biting my nails. Why, Callum? That's one of the worst habits you can have. My girlfriend has that habit sometimes. I always like rip her hand out of her mouth. Get, get that stuff out of there. What are you doing biting your nails? There's nothing there. I know it's like a stress thing, like a... Uh... That and wanking. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. That's not where I expected that to be going. Bang. Oh yes. Oh no, Joe. You had to score that, Jota. <laughs> Oh my god, that pass was exquisite. I am back. What happened since I've been gone? Nothing. We've we've brought this one back from 1-0 to 2-1. I don't know what else. I think that's about all you would have missed. I'm, got, I'm wondering what on earth happened that you won't talk about MUTD. I have no idea. I just don't want to talk about them. Nothing happened. They're, they're, we're still the best club in the world, but I just uh, I don't want to talk about them. Oldschmidt. Oh, I see the ball. The Shervy. Is it, can someone tell me how to pronounce that? Is it Chervy or Servy? Someone surely knows. I always thought it was Chervy. Someone surely knows. One of you surely is smarter than me and knows. I mean, I think everyone in the chat is smarter than me, but still. Uh, I gotta go. Good luck with the rest of the stream. Thank you very much, Angry World Cup Gaming, for the, um, it's Chervy. Okay, cool. Thank you very much for dropping by, dude. If you if you find yourself needing to watch some live content, Flicker Fly's not streaming. Definitely hit us up, dude. Thank you very much. Leeds just lost 4-1. Oh! What the hell? Oh! I didn't do that. I pro Boys, I promise you, I did not do that. He was just out there on his own. 
Odysseus, Flaco. Oh. Look at the. <laughs> Where did he come from, <laughs> man? Dude, what the hell? Where did my man come from? Where did my man come from? Odysseus, Flacodemos, just dominating. He really is a god. Forget the king. He's a god. He's both. He's a king and a god. Waldschmidt, he's a bit tired. I think he's going to get caught here. No? Waldschmidt, on the left! Puts it away, and that's 3-1. There you go. By the way, I don't understand the thing about bondage. Why do people like it? I don't know. It's not for me either, personally. Um, Leicester won 4-0. Woo! Manchester United also lost 1-0. No, Albi, we didn't. We, we didn't. We didn't lose 1-0. I mean, how is that only a yellow? Yeah, I know. I mean, he came all the way out and took the goal-scoring opportunity away from him. All, all man, no ball. Surely that was a red. That was a straight sending off. But I guess you don't send off a king, do you? Because then you get in trouble. All right, let's make some substitutions. The midfield needs a, a, a revamp. Krovinovic, Krov, Krov, Tomato, and Santos are coming in. All, all three of them are coming in. The depth at this team is pretty impressive. I'm not going to lie. We've got a lot of depth here at Benfica. Barboza. Also, this was a very good comeback. I can't believe we were losing to this team. It's, no disrespect to them, but... We're Benfica. We just, you don't lose if you're Benfica in the Portuguese league, right? Depth like Everton. Ah, oh, Conti. Captain. Steps in and gets a tackle. 3-1. How about that? Arsenal, says Ashish. No, we, we didn't lose to Arsenal. I don't remember that. I don't, I don't remember losing to Arsenal. How much longer are you going to stream for today? LCFC Robbie, I'm probably going to still be live for another like couple of hours, to be honest. I got a day off today because it's a public holiday in Melbourne. Um, and the reason it's a public holiday in Melbourne is because the Melbourne Cup is on today, which is a horse racing event. And uh, so Melbourne is the only place in Australia that gets the day off. So there you go. Luca Waldschmidt got a 10 out of 10 match rating because he got himself a hat trick. I didn't even realize he scored a hat trick. There you go. Daddy, please do longer stream today. I will, Ashish. I am going to be streaming for longer today. So we've been going for an hour and 48 or an hour and let's say an hour and 52 hours. I still think I got another two hours in me. I'll stay for the rest of the stream then. LCFC Robbie, where are you from? My guy. Um, I'm moving to Melbourne, says Apex Penguin. I don't believe you. Who's heard of the Chum Drum Bedrum? No, Callum, I haven't. Ashish says, yeah. Tim Games says, yes. We've got an offer for Krono Krovinovic from Porto. No, not Porto. Anybody but Porto. Uh, I call Liverpool Liverpool because I'm actually a respectful human being. I will stay till the end, says Tim Games XP. Where are you guys from? Would you watch it in stream? The Melbourne Cup? No, I think that's much later in the day. I think that's uh, that's like six hours from now, I think. I could be wrong. I actually don't... I'm not that into horse racing, so I don't know when it is or... I mean, there's a bunch of races throughout the day and then there's the main V race, you know what I mean? I don't know what it's called, though. Well, I mean, it's called the Melbourne Cup, but I don't know what. Yeah. Um... Is this a group stage game already against Leon? Let's take a look at our Champions League group, shall we? Let's have a look. Oh no, it's another playoff round. Are you for real? We're gonna do another playoff round? Oh my god. Against Leon? Really? We got Leon of all teams? We might we may not make it. We may not make it. Leon are a good side. Back five as well. Should I play these games? What do you guys think? Should I play these games? I'm going to wait for you guys to let me know if I should play these games or not. LCFC Robbie says that's hard. I mean, yeah, what the hell? Play? As if I got Leon. As, of all teams I could have gotten, as if I got Leon. I am from Surrey, England. So isn't it late where you are? Like, don't you want to go to bed? Sim and jump in if you need. Play. Um, Ashish was timed out by Jamie. Jump in IMO while I'm back. So Theodore the Third, welcome back, my friend. Um, let's sim and jump in if we go down 1-0. I don't know what to say in this chat anymore, says HyperJJ. It's 10 p.m. already. It's only 10 p.m. Oh, okay, all right. Oh, yeah, because your clocks have gone... Of course, yeah. 10 p.m. So, yeah, I might, I might stream until, like, midnight. 
Maybe even 1 a.m. Who knows? I mean, I got all day, so it's just whenever I feel like. Also, this room will eventually get hot, so I might need to bring a fan in here. Which shouldn't affect my microphone, because I do have filters to stop that. So I might, um... I'll tell you what I'll do. While this is going, I might quickly go get some fruit and a fan. So I'll let you guys watch this, but I'll be back in a bit. So I'll just do this. And probably my border as well. And you guys can just watch this while I'm, uh... I'll be back in like two minutes. If we go down 1-0, I'll jump in at halftime. Or maybe we'll go down more, I don't know. Anyway, I'll be right back. Be quick, I'll be right Oh, yo, the microphone actually doesn't pick it up. That's sick. The microphone actually doesn't pick up the cam. Uh, the, the fan. We're 1-0 up. Yo, boys. 1-0 up. Pog. Um, OG stream game, where you at, says Addy. Um, oh, I spoke too soon. Yeah, okay. It's actually, the, the it's not picking up the... You guys can't hear any fan, can you? Just to confirm. You guys can't hear any fan. Gadi, I'm sus. OG stream game. Okay. Got myself some fruit. We're going to start off with a kiwi. For the guys that are new to the stream, I do eat my kiwi with the skin on. I don't hear any fan. No. Okay, cool. Um, One punch man. Ooh. Oh my gosh. I, I like full ran downstairs. <laughs> I full ran downstairs and upstairs. I'm puffed. I'm gassed. I'm done. Man, Jamie, need to say I know because I said I love you. Why did you ruin it? He's ruining it, man. Um, anyway, so kiwi first. My God, that's a good looking kiwi. Ooh, baby! That's a juicy one. That is a juicy kiwi, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, class, for today's lesson, we are going to explain why Goku beats Saitama in the most simplest form. Oh, okay. I'm down for this. I want to hear why Goku beats Saitama. Let me know. Go on, Teacher JJ. That's what she said. Mmm. Mmm. What were you guys saying while I was gone? Um, Gardi, what's your favorite Akatsuki member? Hmm. Hmm. I was always a fan of Daedara. Don't ask me why. But uh, Itachi has to be number one, right? But um, it's like, other than Itachi, I think Daedara was one of my favorites. Um, someone said they already failed No Nut November. Who was that? I saw it before. I, I don't know where it was, but I saw it before. Uh, how many seasons are you planning for Benfica? Xander, probably one or two with Benfica, yeah. OG stream ga gangway. Okay, that's why I came back. Guardi is venting. Yeah, I was. I, no, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. No, you didn't see me vent. That was not me venting. That was me coming from the vent. But I wasn't actually in the vent, okay? I was just walking from the where the vent is. I promise. Don't... Why would you get rid of a crew member? Okay, so Hyper JJ is explaining it to us. 
in Dragon Ball Super Anime, Goku is stated when fighting Beerus that he would tear apart the universe, which is a universal feat. Now, Saitama's best feat was beating Boros, who is capable of beating plane, oh, planets, I see. To put that into context, there is trillions of planets in one universe, and that's not even Goku's best feat. Guardia sus. My mum dropped me down the stairs when I was one. I'm still keeping no nut and no shave, says Addy. Nice. So what's the best memory you have in your life? Everyone answer, says Callum. Alright, so 1-1 one, one against Leon. That's not too bad. Callum, my best memory in my life? I don't know. Probably winning a sports tournament or something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what my best memory is. Oh, Manchester United won't come back. No way, man. Are you serious? Um, to put... Yeah, okay. Gadi is sus. I'm not sus. Why am I sus? Don't vote me. Imagine... Imagine I ever stream Among Us with other people. You guys in my chat would keep saying, Oh, Gadi is sus. Gadi is sus. My best memory is getting into the Southampton Academy. Tim Games XP. No way, dude. What position did you play? Um, how old are you? Are you still in the academy? Are you, where are you at? Where, what are you doing now? Are you any good at football? I was okay for my school, but in Australia, you kind of have to be playing for like a private club for it to go anywhere. Yo, Kevin is in the chat. What's going on, dude? Kevin, good to see you. Of course, as you guys can see, Kevin is a official Guard FC member. He's a water boy. So he makes sure everybody's hydrated. And he's also good for just a bit of banter, right? You have a broken finger. No way. How old are you, Tim? That's crazy, dude. That's actually a really good accomplishment, man. Like, same as Caden reckons that he's part of Newcastle, or he might be part of Newcastle. Can we play Among Us with you? Teddy, the only reason that wouldn't work is that you guys would stream snipe me. Like, you guys could see that I was the imposter. Um, not much. Uh, Friday I get out of quarantine. Oh, Kevin. Finally, right? Finally you get out of quarantine. How's that been, dude? That must suck. Um, could you stream GTA? Guardy, thanks for the shout out. No worries, Jamie. Could I stream GTA? I mean... Yeah, I, I could. Maybe when, the, when they finally release a new one, maybe? <laughs> Man, I, this team is so deep, I don't even know who to play. I guess Conti will have to play another game, so he'll come in. Uh, we don't really have a backup left back, but I guess we could play the other Tavares at left back. We could even train them him to be a left back as well, just for fun. And we'll play Volschmidt up front. And surely we be Portimonense. Um, buy a better starter striker. Also, honestly, Darwin is not bad. Darwin Nunez is pretty good. Also, I'm out of self-isolate. Okay, I've got to read the rest of Hyper JJ's analysis here. <clears throat> um, where are we at? Also, Saitama has faster than light feats. However, Goku managed to travel his key around the universe, which is said to be infinitely expanding, so it gives Goku inaccessible speed. Also, Goku managed to beat Jiren, who was said to transcend time, so that gives Goku a four-dimensional feat. It's a 4D construct. So Goku will be the one-punch man to Saitama. Okay, the lesson is over. Next time I'll explain any fights you desire. There you go, boys. Goku would beat One Punch Man. It's not me saying that. It's Hyper JJ, the expert. Um, a backup center back left back that has high potential is Gvardiol from Croatia. Dazed Viking, thank you very much for reminding me. I want to sign him. I like the look of him, and I want to sign him. Okay, we should win this game, right? I can, I can, I can, I'm going to jump to a result. We're going to win this game. 3-0. Nice. 70% possession. Muy bien. Muy, muy, muy. Um, okay, let's get Gvardiol. 
I'm ready to get him already. What do you think of Norwich City? I like the color scheme. Anything with green and gold, I'm a big fan of. Because that's uh, Australian uh, colors right there. That's why I liked, like, Brazil growing up as well. It's Yosko, isn't it? It is Yosko. That's him. That's the one. He's at FC Nantes. Not for much longer. That's going to be a Benfica boy real soon. Real, real soon. Don't worry about that. Um, Dazed Viking says no. Wait, no, not him? He's the younger one? What? Oh, okay. Well, that's the one that I know. Are you sure? It's not Mirko. Look, Mirko's a regen. <laughs> Guardi sign Azani. It is him. Yeah, Albi, I thought so. Azani. We're in the third season based Viking, so maybe he's a little bit older than what you were expecting. Yeah, we're in the third season, that's why. No, no, that's okay, Days Viking. No need to apologize, dude. You did, you probably didn't know we're in the third season, so he's probably a couple years older than what you were expecting. This guy looks good, Javier Faldo. Um, sorry. <laughs> Poor Days Viking. He feels like he has to apologize. Poor guy. Um, yeah, I think if we bring in another defender, we might be set. We might be looking good. I broke my finger saving a penalty in an academy match, says Tim, Tim Games. That sucks. That really does suck. How old are you, Tim? That was a good Kiwi. I can't lie. That was a fantastic Kiwi. Also, shout out to everybody who's liked the stream. We have 47 people watching, but 50 likes on the stream. So shout out to everybody that's liked the stream. Um, you're 15. Nice. Brent is Mark's name, says Rusin or Ivanusek. <laughs> I like that name, by the way. Brent is Mark's name. <laughs> That's very good. I like that. Do you, Are you in the United Stand chats usually, or? I ate and now I can't sleep. I need to go tomorrow. I hate my civil service. Oh, I have my civil service. What is civil service? I can't believe we're going to have to play a rested lineup against Lyon. And we're trying to make the Champions League and I have to rest my players. Because the, the fixtures are so bloody, you know what I mean? Um, I'm going to sim, but if we go 1-0 down, I'm jumping in straight away. What's your favorite food, says Teti. Um, my favorite food would have to be lasagna. I don't know. What do you guys think? What's your favorite food? Mine's lasagna for sure. But chicken is really good. Like chicken, like parmesan and stuff are really good too. Um, ja uh, Jardi. <laughs> can't even read my own damn name. Gardi, I don't know if you've answered this, but how many seasons are you planning and will you move on? Xander, one or two seasons and maybe. Depending on what offers we get, we may move on, yes. Um, Ashish says, not happy with mods. Bye, Gardi. Ashish, you were spamming. Oh, we're jumping in. Ashish, you were spamming. I saw that. You were definitely spamming. Rusin is so good on FIFA. Did a career mode. How got... Many go uh, Brent is Mark's name. If you remind me after this game, I'll shortlist him. Just remind me after this game. You like Pez? I haven't played enough of it. Hyper JJ likes Thai food. Yeah, Thai food's pretty good. Pad Thai is pretty good. But there's nothing like a, a lasagna. I'm a pretty big, pretty big pasta fan in general, but lasagna is so good. So, 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 so good. All right, Everton. Everton's going to be our main man this game. I have a feeling. Or it's going to be Darwin. Or it's going to be Fernandez, Or it's going to be Nunez again. Oh, what? Oh, offside. I was going to say, they didn't give away a penalty there. Surely not. That was... That wasn't... That's not a penalty in any day of the week. I'm at the fire department office. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. That's a very commendable... Um, that's a very commendable job, I, I feel. But you're too, you're too full with burgers and wings that you can't even go to sleep. You're going to be tired tomorrow at work. That's not a... F Gardy, did you check the youth? 
Jamie? I don't think I did check the youth, actually. That's a good point. That's actually a good point. You have to remind me after the game. Why do you guys remind me of so many good things when I'm, when I'm playing the games? <laughs> it's like you guys do it on purpose. No, no, but just remind me after the game. Or I'll remember. But that's not likely. If you guys watch the streams, you know I don't really remember things. Fuck. Leona's so good. I'm so scared. I don't think we're going to make the Champions League, boys. Maybe we should just... Uh... Oh, no. This is going to be a goal. <sighs> okay, here we go. We got a mountain to climb here. We got a big boy mountain to climb here. We got Mount Everest to climb, boys. Does, um, can someone let me know? Does the away goal thing happen in qualifiers as well? Is away goals a thing in qualifiers as well? So do I need to score three goals right now? Can someone please confirm? Connor, uh, Connor Duncan says hi. What's going on, Connor? I think I've seen you before. Good to see you again. If not, then it's good to see you for the first time. What a terrible ball. Yes, and I don't think so. Okay, so I got two different responses. Ah, man, if I have to score three goals, this is going to be... Impossible. Oh my gosh, that was a really good ball. That was such a good ball. Oh man, um, thanks bro. Honestly, I just hope they accept my decision. Oh, what, what's this about Callum? Oh, about the girl, I see. Um, it's never impossible. Who have you signed? Connor, we've signed a few players. Uh, we've signed that, that center back that just passed the ball, whatever his name was. We've signed this left back here, Tavares. We signed a free agent who I believe is Matuidi's regen. Oh my gosh. We just, we can't do anything with the ball. Look, there's no options. I mean, maybe I'm just bad, but probably not, right? I'm pretty good at this game. It's Jeff Rennie Adelaide. Come on now. You can get the ball off Jeff. I may have to play two strikers in the second half. I may have to get fancy with it. I mean, it's only, we're only half an hour in. We have time. Oh my God. What was that? Took forever to pass the ball. Look, we, their players are just so, like, physically ridiculous. I'm gonna get... I reckon I'm gonna get frustrated playing this game. It feels like... Oh, no. I can't tackle with... Um, I can't tackle with him like that. Who are you after? Uh, I don't know. We've got a lot of options. Maybe another attacking option, but probably not likely. We've got a lot of options now in, um, in attack. Oh, we already had a lot of options in attack. We need maybe another defender. I think I'm going to get Gvardiol. Nice. Go on, Everton. Oh, great slide tackle there. That was a little bit better. I may change formation. I may sacrifice a midfielder. I may sacrifice a midfielder for a striker in the second half. What do you guys think? Think about the... What substitution should I make? How, how can I bring this back? Formations? Is it a certain player that I have to bring on? What, what do I need to do? What, what's... Get better at the game? Like, what, what, what do you guys think? Oh my god, that's nice. That's nice gameplay there from Leon. If they'd scored that, I would have applauded them. Go on, Everton. You can't get outrun by Jeff Rennie Adelaide. I'm sorry. You cannot get outrun by Jeff Rennie Adelaide. Bang! Oh. That was the first fake shot I've done in FIFA 21 that worked. That somewhat worked. All right, here we go. That's a free kick. Okay, all right, all right, all right. It gives us a chance here. Guardi, I'm just realizing other countries don't know or don't do Thanksgiving. Yeah, we don't... I, We don't do... No one else does Thanksgiving except you. 72, 72. Is 72 really our best free kick taker? Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on. Let me work my magic. <laughs> uh, what's your body count? Uh, 100. 
Oh my god, the crossbar, dude. That was such a not powerful shot. Okay, we need to do something different in the second half. I don't know what it is, but we need to do something different. Oh, you don't have to give a yellow card for that. It's Austra Australia, mate, for Gardy. Yeah, it is Australia, mate. I feel bad for you guys. Thanksgiving is the best. We have, um... I don't know what our equivalent of Thanksgiving Day is, to be honest. We don't have one. What do I need to do here, boys? I think I need to go to a 442. What does everybody think of a 442? We'll bring on Volt Schmidt. Or should we bring on. I don't know what to do. She DM'd me on Insta, says Tim Games. Who did? My crush just asked me out. She DM'd me on Insta. Oh my gosh, Tim Games. She heard about the Southampton uh, Youth Academy. 442. No, 442 is bad. Okay. What about this 4411? Muhammad, what do you think about the 4411? This is what they um, have as like their default. And I'll put. Um, I'll take off Semedo. Whoops. I'll take off Semedo. And I'll bring on Vol Schmidt. Why DM do it face to face? If you're defending, is good play three at the back. 441 is good, says Muhammad. Okay, 4411. All right. Here it is. This is what we're doing. And then. And then Shervy will come on at some stage. I will go now. See you guys. Good luck sleeping, Paz. And have fun tomorrow at the fire station. Or wherever you work. Fire. Something to do with fire. Alright. That's it. I'm leaning in now. Arms are on the desk. I'm serious now. Although my monitor looks a little bit weird. Has to be said. Hold on. This actually does look a little bit weird. I bet you that's why. The angle of gameplay is a little bit different for me. Now the camera is going to look a little bit different for me. Gonna make sure everything looks okay. Bring that up a little bit. Maybe that's why I'm playing so bad. Maybe that's the excuse that I'm gonna roll with today. The camera is so high up now. Hold on. Look at this. Custom, customizing on the fly. Look at that. Oh yeah, look at that. We get that all the way down there. Fantastic. All right. Does this look a little bit? Yeah, that looks much better. My my monitor was facing down. I don't know why it was facing down so much. Now I feel like it's facing up too much, but we're not going to think about it. We're just going to play. Stop making excuses. It has nothing to do with the monitor. It has everything to do with how bad you are at the game. 4411. Should I go attacking? That's the question now. Should I go attacking? What are we thinking? Um, you should get Renato Sanchez back. Actually, maybe we'll still do that. Azan says, I'm downstairs. You've been downstairs for a long time. Ethan Davo. Why are you playing with Benfica? They suck. You know what you can do, Ethan Davo? Take your opinion somewhere else. We don't suck. Alright. Not that I care. I don't really care. Guardi, what did I miss? We're getting dominated by Leon, And this is the last opportunity we have to qualify for the Champions League. And we're going to ruin it. Because I'm bad at the game. I need three goals. Actually, I might need two, but I think I need three. Oh. So, yeah, this is going to be a really sad season with no Champions League. Which sucks. Gardy, you're brilliant. I've been watching since your Leeds career mode. Keep up the good work. Thank you very much, C-R-W-F-Y. Thank you very much, dude. I appreciate that. Thank you. Their players are just physical beasts. It feels like we're playing like under-18s versus seniors. What was that? Odysseus, you come out for a freaking ball that's 40 yards away from you, but you don't come out for that corner? Oh my god, what season am I in? This is the third season of the career mode, but this is my first season with Benfica. This game is over, boys. Well and truly over. Why did Odysseus just watch that? That's it. You know what it is? It's ultra attacking time. 4-4-1-1 is already picked, I think, but we gotta switch Volt Schmidt and Florentino, and then we gotta switch Goncalves out, and I'm gonna bring Shervy in. And we're just going to go balls to the wall. Just sim the rest. Lol, unlucky. No, 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 no. Muhammad, you never give up. You never, ever give up. I can still score four goals. <laughs> no, I know I can't. But I, I, I just want to see if I can get another couple goals here. Make it look a little bit more respectable. You know what I mean? I don't want to give up. If I can get one in the next, like, play, then maybe. 
You never know, right? Sometimes the, the CPU just goes really bad. I believe you can score five. You just told me to sim the rest. Now you think I can score five. Their players, honestly, on the physical side of things, have been insane. They're all really quick and all really strong. I don't know what it is. They're ridiculous. Oh, Odysseus, you're so slow. Oh, good block. That was going to be a sick goal if I didn't block that. <laughs> Holy sh... Oh, why did I chip that? Why did I... Why was I pressing left bumper? Yes. There you go. Good stuff, Ozan. Oh, my God. You can't even pass the ball, man. Oh, my God. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Let's get two back, then push for a third. It's been done many times before. You can do it, lad. Nah, it's... I think I needed a goal by the 70th minute to even give myself a chance. So, I think it's done. But... We're going to play anyway, because it's ultra attacking. So, I may as well just play. Try to make my passes sharper and faster. Oh my god, what a terrible touch. I think the problem is, like, they're just good. It's just a very good team we're coming up against. Also, I'm not very good at the game. Um, but I'm not going to blame myself, because I'm really good at the game. Ah, he's offside. Well, I, I, why are you just standing in an offside position? Why was our defender standing there in an offside position? I don't understand. Doesn't make any sense. Like, you're waiting for the cross to come in, and you're literally just standing in an offside position. Okay, Guardi, I'm going to start a Getafe career mode. Nice. Good choice. Guardi, you should take a look at the Wolves team and buy players from them since they are Portuguese. Honestly, we might do that. Oh, that was not, not a bad idea. Europa League? We'll try and win the Europa League, yeah. Xbox, PS4, PC. I'm playing on Xbox now, but I am going to eventually play on PC. That was a... I don't know. Why, I, I'm tilted now. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't even know what I'm doing. Only if you... If we only still had Diaz, yeah. Nice. That was actually good defending for once. Nice. That was actually good defending again. Look at this. Like, we can't... Like, where are the runs on the counter-attack, though? Like, where are the runs? We were three versus three there, and they all ran into each other, essentially. Go, Darwin. Get one for us, No. Give the home fans something to cheer today. Jesus. We're missing, we're missing out on Champions League because of you lot. Look at that. Look, look at that. Did you see the way he bumped my player off? That's ridiculous. Dogs or cats, bro? I like both. But I think growing up, I was more of a dog person, personally. I like both, though. It's not like I hate one. I actually didn't like cats, but then my girlfriend kind of convinced me. Oh, that was our best opportunity right there. That was our best Goal scoring opportunity, that. That was our best opportunity we created today, so far. Oh my god, how did he know that, that I was going there? Just, I don't want to give away a red card, because it's just like, there's no point. We've lost anyway. There's no point in getting a suspension as well. Their players are just beasts. That's all it comes down to. Their players have just been such beasts. That's a bit better. This might be one goal at least. <laughs> oh, and he saved the corner as well. Female Undertaker is going to kill everyone. 100%. Everyone's getting choke slammed after the game. Oh, what a header. That's a goal. That's just a goal, isn't it? <laughs> I sweated it as well. <laughs> oh, if you have money, Ruben Neves, maybe. No, we got so many midfielders. We have so many midfielders. That's not even the problem. 
This is just a one-off game. That's just ridiculous. What other sports do you play or do you like other than FIFA? Uh, Tim, I watch Formula One, basketball, um, rugby league. Uh, I guess, I don't know if you count wrestling as a sport, but I do watch wrestling. That's just, that's, uh, that's just something to forget about right there. Brent is Mark's name. It says, now check your youth academy. Yeah, I will. Man, that's just, that's just one that we have to forget. God, he just got motivation. It became personal with me. It's become personal. If we ever see Leon again, I'm smashing them. All right, who's in the youth academy? We have Simon Meyer is our good, no, oh, actually, no, he's not. We don't have anyone that's good. I guess he's all right. Like, potential-wise, he's the best. But uh, he's the only one that could kind of do a job on our team, but he's a midfielder, and we don't really need a midfielder. Guardi, you should watch cricket. I do watch cricket. Guardi, are you avoiding? Uh, avoiding who, Ashish? Um, can you do a Groningen rebuild? Guardi, you should support the Chicago Bulls as your NBA team. Fun fact, Connor, I have family that live in Chicago, so I kind of do go for the Chicago Bulls. But I also go for... I don't go for anyone, actually. I, I, in basketball, I don't support anyone. But I always want to see the Chicago Bulls and Phoenix Suns do well. 30 million plus Percy Tau. For Pedrinho. Uh, Gadi, you should watch uh, cricket. I do watch cricket, Jamie. I'm actually big into cricket. Um, Gadi, are you avoiding? Gadi, do you like darts? Please read. Brian says please read, but I don't know what he wants me to read. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna reject this. Give me some suggestions. Guys, I need a striker for and right mid for my FIFA 20 Getafe career mode. Give me some suggestions. Favorite F1 driver? Well, other than Ricardo, because he is Australian. So that's an easy one. Other than that, um, I would say my next favorite is... Hmm, I don't know, actually. Um... Maybe Gasly or Sainz? One of them, one of them. But Ricardo's obviously, obviously the favorite. Fabio Silva from Wolves is a young striker. Jota transfer offer, Sheffield United want him for 17 million. Gadi, do you follow Indian Premier League? I hope you have heard about it. I've heard about it, but I don't follow it, Ashish. I know, I know what it is though. Uh, man, that's that 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 loss against Leon. That's deflating. That's really just. Oh, we got that Benfica derby as well. Oh my god! Because I watch F1 and I'm a fan of Russell. Tim Games. That's a good shout. Russell is also very good. Very very sad what happened to him at uh, at the at the race this weekend. Really really upsetting. I was so sad for him, but he'll come back. He'll bounce back from that. He's a very very talented driver. Very talented. Uh, just been thinking, when you and Flickify collab, it'll be one of the biggest career mode collabs. Well, probably anyway. Um, I don't know. There's been big ones in the in the past. Don't get me wrong. It's just, I don't know. It just doesn't happen nowadays, does it? Gonzalez to Internacional. Okay, we'll accept that. Quebec, no chance. No, wait. What is the weirdest question someone has asked you? I'm not quite sure, to be honest. I don't really remember. I'm sure someone now will ask a weird question to outdo it, regardless. Raphael Leao at striker. That's actually a good shout for you, Hyper JJ. That's a good shout. Everton is injured. Oh my gosh! What? When did he get? When did he get injured? What did he do? Three weeks. Oh my gosh. Gadi, do you wipe standing up or sitting down? Sitting down. Gadi, JJ, get uh, Adam Armstrong at striker and Sochia Hansen at right mid. Even though he is not anymore in F1. Who? Uh, Fernando Alonso. Trolloito is in the chat. What's going on, dude? Um, he's, com he's coming back next year, Trolloito. So there you go. He's coming back and racing with Renault F1 team. Oh, wait, no, they're going to be called Alpine. But yeah, basically Renault F1 team. Um, hold on. There was someone that I had to look up. There was a, there was a player that I had to look up. I don't remember who it is. Konstantinos? I've never seen this guy. Sebastian Cordova. Silva from Wolves. Renato Sanchez, that's right. Fabio Silva. No, I think it was Renato Sanchez. But we don't need midfielders, so I don't even know why I want to look him up. We really don't need midfielders. If anything, I'd kind of want another attacking option. Like a winger or something. 
I'm back. What did I miss? Teti, we got beat by Leon 4-0 and did not make the Champions League. Uh, Cornet, please don't spam. Yeah, if you guys can try not to spam, but I'll read everybody's thing. Sign Emil Hesky. Is your belly button inny or outy? Inny. I think. Uh, <laughs> no, it is. It's inny. Felix? Jao Felix. Yeah, he's going to be very expensive. I don't think we have the money for Jao. To be honest. Nicholas Bentner. Yeah, that's a, actually a good shout. Uh, Jao, 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 Jao. Jao Felix. He's going to be like 200 million. 137, he's going to be, or 126, he's going to be impossible to sign. I'll put him on the short list, but he's going to be impossible to sign. Anthony, <coughs> Anthony from Ajax left wing. Trin Chao, I think is also expensive, Mohamed. We have 36 million, so we can't, we cannot sign anybody too expensive. Thanks for the suggestions. Eric Lamella, wow. That's actually, like, one that makes sense, kind of. Only he's got less than a year on his contract as well. Um, Dedic, underrated talent. I've never heard of him, but I'll look him up. Wow, that is it. Abzia Halilovic. Are you related to V Halilovic? Who is it? Um, Dedic. Is it Amar Dedic from Salzburg? Bosnian. Uh, why don't you sign one of the bigger Chinese league players such as Paulinho or Taliska? Yeah, Taliska was at Benfica, wasn't he? Nathan Redmond for left mid. <laughs> Probably not Redmond. Doku. Who's Doku? Jeremy Doku. Okay. Exciting prospect. Yo, I like that. Ashish Trinchao is too expensive. Trinchao is too expensive. Sozozozozbolai. Papi Sise? Yo, let's get him. Uh, who is Sozozozbolai? So Oh, this guy. Soboz Salai. Okay, I see. Dominic Soboz Salai. 20 million release clause. So even if he's more expensive, we can get him. Um, Trollorito said Fernando Alonso with Ferrari or Vettel with Red Bull. Wow, Vettel at Red Bull was just so dominant, wasn't he? Tiago Almada. Or is it Almado? Almada. Tiago Almada. Okay, we've got another one on the uh, exciting prospect. Man, you guys are banging out the exciting prospects here. Buendia from Norwich. Papis Cisse, is he, still, is he still playing football, Papis Cisse? No, there's Papa Abu Cisse, but there's no Papis Cisse. Um, Buendia. Emiliano, isn't it? Ahmed... 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 Ahmed Odic. Ahmed Odic. Mohamed Itaren. I think he might be a bit expensive, to be honest. Itaren. From uh, the Dutch League. I think he might be a little bit expensive. Or how do you spell it? It. Uh, how do you spell it? Iha. Iha. Mohamed Itaren. He might be a bit expensive. Proms from Ajax. Go for De La Vega. Very young. De La Vega. Pedro De La Vega. From Lanos. Proms Haggy. Proms. I want more of a winger style player. Quincy is... Oh my God, I can't believe Quincy Proms is 30 now. Pedri. Ahmed. Ahmed O. Anel Ahmed Hodjic. Oh, he's a center back. Um, Tavernia Alerio from Leverkusen. There is always under for right mid. I think his first name starts with T. Oh, the Turkish guy, Gonzalo Plata. I like that name, Gonzalo Plata. Oh, that's right. Gvardiol. We have to sign Gvardiol, guys. So we're going to have even less money. Where is he? I don't know what he's worth, though. We might have to wait a little bit longer. We'll play this game against Lisbon. Or do we want to... Um, or Sporting Club de Portugal. Or do we want to sim this one as well? We may sim and jump in, but man, this team is starting to get tired. There's been so many games to start this season. It's ridiculous. Good thing we have a very deep, deep squad. Very, very deep. Depth all around. 
Except it feels like we only have two strikers. Oh, we have we have Kadiv. I'm gonna play Kadiv. I'm gonna No, I'm not gonna disrespect them actually. I'm not gonna disrespect them. We'll play a respectable lineup, won't we? We got so many midfielders, it's crazy. It's actually kind of nuts how many midfielders we have. We don't have that many defenders. That's why I want to bring in another defender. Can you guys think of any good, like, defend... But I don't know. If we bring in too many defenders, then it's like, what are we doing with our lives? Oh, that's right. I want to train Semedo into a center back. Someone remind me to do that after I sim this game. Someone remind me. Semedo to center back. Someone has to remind me as I start to eat my banana. Gadi, I'm going on my second account. I'll be back, says Jamie Ahern. Okay, why do you have to go on your second account? Also, shout out to 50 people watching and 58 likes on the stream. Shout out to everybody that's liked the stream. Thank you very much. Gvadio. We're going to definitely sign Gvadio. And we're going to train Semedo to a center back. And that'll give us a lot more defensive thing defensive prowess jamie is actually ignoring me why would he do that uh sign shah from newcastle nah callum we'll probably not do any newcastle players we already did newcastle so i'm too used to the newcastle players samato was a beast for me in my nottingham career mode yo nottingham is a really i might do a nottingham forest career mode stream i want to take nottingham back to uh um to the tippity top also there's another video there's another stream series it's i flow what's up guardy i think that's jamie's second account <laughs> um yannick vestergaard he's huge let me know what you guys think of this idea i'll do a arsenal invincibles career mode and basically it's like a challenge i have to go invincible invincible with arsenal I can do whatever financial takeover I want. I can sign whoever I want, Messi, Ronaldo, whoever I can get. I have to go invincible. If I lose a league game, I have to reset the save. And we'll see how long it takes me to get invincible. What do you guys think of that? Would you watch that? And I'll literally just do that. <laughs> and it's gonna be simming every game though. So it might be a little bit boring. That would be hard. That's the point. It's a challenge. It's a challenge live. And I'll have a little counter that tells me how many times we've started again. And we'll see if it's possible. And if it is possible, how long would it take you to do? I'm thinking of doing a Nuzlocke in FIFA. That's also another good idea. And Nuzlocke is also a good idea. So if you lose a game, you have to release a player at random. Is that is that going to be what it is, Joe? At random or specific players? Dedic is um, best right back talent for one to five mil. Okay, Abzia. If you remind me after the game, I'll I'll put him in. I'll I'll look at him. Oh my God! Signed Ben White, center back. Ginter, German center back. Signed Domingos Quina. United Alex7, what's going on, dude? Good to see you in the chat. Also, Aduka Babuka, Klosterman from Leipzig. I didn't see you before, but shout out to you. I don't think I've ever seen you before. Iggy underscore AS. If you need a backup goalkeeper, get Florian Muller. Samuel Prez says, what um What positions do I need? I need someone who's versatile in defense. That jersey is nice. The uh the Orlando one? Yeah. Shaquille O'Neal on the back, by the way, obviously. The only other person I'd get is Hardaway. I don't really like anyone else from Orlando. <laughs> Can you please do Messi at Stoke City next? That is a video series I'm going to do. Um, when I'm on PC and I can do mods and stuff. Eric Dyer. All right, so we get the 3-0 win against Sporting Club de Portugal. Okay, guys, I have 10 million left, says Hyper JJ. Semedo to center back. Semedo to center back. Brent is Mark's name. Yep, you're on it. You're on it. We'll do that first. We'll get that on. We'll get that going first. I'm not edit players. Why do I always go here? Squad hub. 
Um, he is a center mid or a center defensive mid? There he is. Center defensive mid. Because we don't need that many center defensive mids. Has to be said. We don't need that many. It's just not, not a necessity. We have so many midfielders. That to be honest... Oh, where am I going? To be honest... Two weeks? Perfect. Hold on. I want to look through my other midfielders. What other positions can they play? Someone can play right... One of the cams can play on the wing, can't they? Pedrinho can play on the wing. Shall I change him to a winger? Dwight Howard or Tracy McGrady from Orlando Magic too. Um, yeah, that's a good shout. Yeah, more so Dwight Howard. I wasn't a fan of T-Mac. I don't know why. There was no reason to hate T-Mac, but I just didn't really like T-Mac. I'm going to make Pedrinho a right winger. He's left-footed, so that'll be good. He's going to be like an inverted right winger. And who else can we change? Gary, for your next video idea, how long will it take rest of the world team to win the Premier League? That's not a bad idea, Xander. It's not a bad idea. Um, anybody else I can change the position of in these center mids? Probably not. What about the defensive mids? No one else can play center back? Julian Weigel could play center back. I think I'm going to keep him as a defensive mid. Yamga, I'm going to train to be... Oh no, I'm already training him to be a center mid, isn't it? You know what? I give up giving you suggestion. That's okay. Why are you giving up, Bryant? Um, okay, what's everyone saying? Make Pizzi a cam. No, I think I like him on the wing. Actually. You don't have enough money to buy, right? Uh, Ashish, we have some money. We have some money. Are you going to try and do full 15 seasons on this save? Maybe, Muhammad. Maybe. Probably not, but we'll do our best to see how much we can do. Or how, how uh, long we want to go with this. Um, Katarino can play right back, but I don't, uh, right mid, but I don't think I need that. We want to train this Tavares to be a left back as well as the other Tavares. So we'll have two left backs confirmed. So that'll take him nine weeks. That's not too bad. How much do you have? I have about 30 million, but I want to buy Gvardiol. But now I'm not sure I need him if I'm going to train... If I'm training Santos to be a center back, I'm not sure I need Gvardiol anymore. Dedic. Tadic. Domingos Guina. Man, you guys have suggestions at the wazoo. Gotta have an experiment for you to do. What if the Eredivisie and Liga Nos combine? Uh, that's not a bad idea. Guina. Guina. That's not a bad idea, actually. Hmm. Dedic, Sandro from AC Milan. You need a replacement left back and a winger. No, Mohamed, we don't need the left back. We don't need the left back, I don't think. Dedic. Amar Dedic. I thought I... Yeah, I I'm already looking up Dedic. FFS, Ryan Giggs has been arrested for assaulting his girlfriend? Oh, really? That sucks. That's really shit. If that's true, that's really shit. Oh man, that Vienna news really sucks. What the hell? That's really that's really bad. I just saw what happened in Vienna now. That's really shit. Uh, Ryan Giggs arrested on suspicion of assaulting his girlfriend. Ah, uh, that's shit house. I don't get guys that do that. I really don't. I really, really don't. I don't want to get a, go off on a huge tangent. I've got a little sister, so that's that stuff. Kind of really annoys me. I don't. I don't like that. That's like um. I don't get how you feel like big and tough by physically attacking a woman. Yeah, I don't know. I don't. I don't like that at all. Um. What happened? He's been arrested, apparently, on suspicion of assaulting his girlfriend. So, it's not confirmed yet, so I don't want to speak on it, but... If he has, that's really shit. Um, Gerd Muller died, biggest legend in the club of Germany, when I was small. He gave me and my brother an autograph and photo. Nice. Hey, bro, try Semedo in center back. You told us to remind you. I did. I, I, Trollorito, I'm training him right now. I'm, uh, I'm developing him to become a center back. So, we'll have a, um... What happened in Vienna? I think there was a shooting at a synagogue. 
from what I saw, one person has passed away, I think. Um, what happened in Vienna? Check out Atal. The Wales squad announcement has been delayed because of it, says Joe. Okay. All right. Yeah, yeah that's right. He's the uh, Welsh manager, so that would obviously... What position do you need? That's the thing. I'm not really sure anymore. I really don't know if we need anybody else. <laughs> I'm in a position now where I think I can sign anyone I want. Like, we have... Like, Conti really should be on the bench, but he's not. We're going to get a second centre-back in Santos. He's going to be a centre-back. No, wait. Wait, what? Oh, Semedo is going to be a centre-back soon. So, we're going to have one, two backup centre-backs. We're going to have right back, right... Uh, right back, left back. And... He's not bad. A, a buoy. He's not bad. You need to start selling players. I actually don't think I do. I actually like the depth. He's good. He's got pace. Jota's got pace. Maybe another cent like a young central striker. Like Kadith is all right, but he's six foot three. He's not very quick. I don't know. I actually don't know what I need. What about Gvardiol? I'm not sure I need him anymore. Dazed Viking. I'm not sure I need him anymore. I don't think I need a center back anymore. Um, not Tierney, no. Calendar, I don't want to see his face ever again. Bernardo Silva, maybe in the future. Asun Shao, we don't need. Although, I like the look of this guy. Oh my god, and we can get him for so cheap. That is ridiculous. We can get him for so cheap. 19 million and he's worth 30. I want to get him just for that. That's ridiculous. Theo Hernandez, too expensive. Trinchao, maybe in the future. Konate, probably not. Tolvin, probably not, but we'll keep him there. Gvardiol, we still haven't scouted him that much. Fabio Silva is a backup striker. Uh, we, might, we might buy Azani. We might buy Daniel Azani. Renato Sanchez, maybe in the future. Jao Felix, maybe in the future. Lamella, Dedic. Dedic can play right back and left back. I'm actually interested in signing him. Doku, he looked all right as well. We, I, I kind of wish these guys were scouted fully. Chromes, probably not, but we'll keep him there just in case. This team will not sell the player. He's too important to Malmo. Timothy Weyer from USA. He's at Lille at the moment. Alario for striker, Fabio Silva back on loan, Fabio Silva backup option. I don't really like, I'm going to be honest with you guys, I don't really like Fabio Silva in game. I don't like him. Gardi, the mods are not timing out people for spamming. I don't see anybody spamming, to be honest. 7.8 million release clause though. Yo, that's not too bad. That's actually not bad at all. The only problem is, like he really would be the third choice striker. Like, Waldschmidt and Nunez are the two strikers. He would literally be on the reserves. He would literally be on the reserves. So I don't know if it's worth bringing him in for the reserves. But 7 million is nothing. Like, it's not going to cost us anything. You know what? I'm going to send it. And if it works, it works. Who's spamming? Yeah, I, I don't know who's spamming. I, I don't think anybody's spamming. I haven't seen anything. 7.8 million. But maybe he's not even worth that. Is he going to be worth 7.8 million? You guys let me know what you want to do. The mods have gone. Phillips, your favorite right... Uh, your, Phillips, your favorite fight in Naruto. Tim, you spammed a few times. No, I mean, I haven't seen him spam, to be honest with you. Jovic for striker? No, we're not going to get Jovic. No, guys, if we, if I bring in a striker, it's a third choice striker. Think about it. If I bring in a striker, it's a third choice. Bryant says, wait, never mind, it's good. Malachi says, Gardi, you should do a Blackburn career and try to win the Premier League with them again. Loan in Facundo Pelestri. Weyer can play on the left flank. Is that right? Get Tonali? No, we don't need Tonali, RJ, but thank you for the suggestion. Nah, putting the same message twice isn't spam. If he did it rapidly in quick succession, then I, it's spam. That's spam. I agree with Joe. If you say something and then I don't respond to it and then 
a minute later or two minutes later, you say it again. That's fair enough. But if you just say the same thing six times in a row, that's spam. I'm going now. Have a good rest of the stream, Guardian. I will see you tomorrow. Tim Games, I appreciate that. Thank you very much. I will see you tomorrow, dude. Could you do a Volta career mode? Does anybody actually want to see that? <laughs> um, does anybody even care about Volta this year? Guardian, you literally have read my messages for the past... Haven't read my messages for the past half an hour. How am I not supposed to feel ignored? Albi! No, I haven't. Gonzalo Plata. What is the manager's name? It's Female Undertaker. Samuel Perez says, I would. Yeah, bye, gotta go. No worries, Days Viking. Thanks for joining us, dude. Much appreciated. Volta? Does, do, I, don't even, I didn't even know Volta was a thing. I thought Volta was a meme. I'm going to bed. Hopefully, to uh, join the stream tomorrow. No worries, Tetsy. Thanks for joining us, dude. Much appreciated, man. Good having you. Albi says, until when are you streaming? Um, I might do another hour, to be honest. I don't know. I can, sh I can literally stop whenever I want. Perhaps you could ignite it, bro. Um, okay, so we're not going to be able to scout anyone further than we've already scouted them. What time is it over there? Samuel Perez, it's currently 10 in the morning right now, so... Gardy, do you still think I should do YT? It's up to you. If you think that um, that's something you want to do, if you, if you feel like it's something that you're enjoying, then do it. Why not? As long as you're enjoying it, I feel I feel like do it. As long as you're enjoying it and it's not taking away from um, from your life, I think do it. See, I don't like this. The team will not sell because he's too important. But what if I give you 20 million for your club, for Club Atletico Lanús? 20 million is like what their whole, the fucking club's worth. So that doesn't make any sense. Like, I get that he's their best player, but that literally does not make any sense. Get the guy from Nuns for depth. The center back? Vardiol? I guess he could play left back as well, so... Alright, let's bring him in. Let us bring him in then. I thought it was cold and badass, Philip. Have a look at Antonio Sanabria. I think if you put in a good offer, they should accept it. I mean, it really, like... It's like, um... It's like a championship club saying, like, no, our best play is too important for us. And a Premier League club going, yeah, but... Here's 30 million for him, you know what I mean? Like, it's money. At the end of the day, it's money, and you can reinvest that money. It's so silly. Anyway, who should we offer? If anybody. I know we've got a lot of midfielders. I just don't know if I want to get rid of any of them. Alpha Semedo. No. Um, do you like this career, this year career mode? Honestly, Samuel Perez, this FIFA is pretty good in general. I just can't wait for it to be modded so all the silly things are not there anymore. How much is Yosko Gvardiol worth? Anybody know? What I should offer him? I offer a play and see what they say. I just don't know who to offer them. I don't I don't know 12 mil. I don't know what like I know we have a lot of midfielders, but I don't really want to get rid of any of them. Maybe like a, a, a Krovinovic. Maybe a Krovinovic and 3 million. So 10 million all up. You reckon they'll storm out of the room? So they want Pedro Pereira and 7.2. Is Pedro what is Pedro Pereira a second choice right back? So he's he's worth about like 15 million, roughly like 15 million. So Kev, Kevin got it bang on around 15 million, but I don't know if that's actually his worth or not. I think so. First. Is he our first choice right back, Pedro Pereira? I don't think he is. Yeah. I don't think he's our first choice. I might not accept that. Um Yeah, uh Catarino is our first choice right back. And then he's going to be a, a left back eventually. No, I want to keep him. We're just going to... I'm just going to offer money. I'm just going to offer 15. And see what they say. I'm going to go with Kevin. I'm going to trust Kevin's judgment here. Go for 14. No, wait. Did I just give him a player as well? Oh my god. I did. I gave him a player as well. 
Okay, I'm not going to go through with this then. <laughs> I just ruined it. Sorry, boys. I just ruined that. Oh, my God. I thought I took the player out. Sorry, boys. Sorry. I can't, uh, I can't accept that. Sorry, guys. You offer the player. Yeah, I know, Xander. I can't do that. I'm going to just not talk to him anymore. I'm going to remove him from the shortlist as well. Oh, I, I completely ruined that, didn't I? What about this guy? Oh, no. He, he's too important. What about, um, Deadditch is the one that I, I wanted to sign. What do we think of Deadditch? You don't need a center back anyway. Yeah. Low key go through. What if we buy someone that can cover right back and left back and he's young as well? What do we think about this guy? Is there a week left in the transfer window? No, it's deadline day, Albie. It's actually deadline day. Irish Mick says... Rochich. Dedicated sounds good. <laughs> dedicated. Let's get dedicated. And we'll try the same thing. We'll give them... Um, we'll give him Krovinovich because I'm not really down for him. And no money as well. No, they, okay, they don't want him. They just want three million. Well, I'm going to offer them two and a half just to stooge them. Just to show that I can negotiate. 2.7? Done. Um, Isco Hyper. Swap with a jobber. All right, lads. I need a cam. Let's get this guy. Let's get Amar Dedic in. He's a young fullback. He can cover both, both flanks. Yo, I just want to say, I can't believe I got donos today. Three donos. I know it's from the same person, but that's ridiculous. It's like 10 pounds of dono or euros. I don't know what he was using, but that was, that's hype. Shout out to him, Ryan. I think it was. He, he separated them in... Ryan McCoy separated them in three different donos. Four euro fifty, three euro fifty, and two euro thirty. Insane. I do appreciate that from Ryan. That was nice, nice of him to hit me up with some donos. Um, Domingo Quina Hyper. Domingo's Quina. I could stream on Twitch, however, um, I ran how I couldn't read the chat. Are you getting Xbox Series X slash S or PS5? I didn't get my hands on any of the, um, on any of the initial uh, batch, I don't think. But um, maybe later, yeah. Brent is Mark's name records that we could sell Dedich at his peak for 50 million. That's good. That's the kind of player I want to bring in. Just someone who's happy to stay on the bench for a bit of extra cover when we're resting players. Okay, so we're going to have an extra center back. I think that's it, boys. I, I don't know if you guys want to sign anybody else, but I'm pretty happy with the team right now. I'm pretty happy with the team right now, I think. I don't know what you guys think. Nice signing, Guardi. I think that's a good... I think that's a very solid signing that gives us just a little bit more depth, I think. Hyper Zaniolo. Sign Suso. Suso? The one that was at Liverpool? Guardi, it is me, Jamie. I know, it's iFlow. I know it's you. <laughs> Why do you uh, go on the second account? Is there a reason? <laughs> nah, look at that release clause from Suso. You know who I really want to buy? Just because... Oh, man. It's such a steal. Is this guy from Family Cow. Gustavo Asunchao. 19.1 million release clause. Should I send it? I have the money. I'll leave it up to you guys. I'll show you how much. I've got 34 million. Should I send it? There's no, there's literally no room for him as well, but it's just the fact that he is that cheap. He's 22 and he looks like a beast. He's so well-rounded. Sign him and try and sell Krovinovic. I'm going to sign him. And um, I don't know with Krovinovic. Yeah, he's a beast in the future. Okay. All right. Samuel Prez says do it. All right, we'll do it. We're just going to have to rotate the squad a lot. Let's see if we can get him on a lower... He wants important. Okay, we'll give him important. That's all right. This is my YT account. Oh, okay, cool. I see, I see. Do you want mod on this one as well, Jamie?
You want mod on this one as well? I'll give you mod on this one as well. It's a fucking steal and it looks better than those faceless players. Yeah, that's also true. What's up with all these faceless players in Portugal? That's what I, I don't understand. Why Portugal? Why is Portugal so mistreated? It's a good question, isn't it? All right, so we got um, we got another player, which is Asun Chao. Uh, <laughs> so we're a little bit stacked now. Quite stacked, it has to be said. Quite stacked. All right, let's just put him up. He will be up in the first row. Ponty, you'll drop out. He's going to be like the main... And this is a stacked team. Leave your transfers. You had a good win though. Yeah, for sure. I also need to offer some new contracts to players anyway. So we'll keep the money for contracts and stuff. If I can sell Krovinovic, I will sell him. Uh, where am I going? Squad hub. I want squad hub. If I can sell Krovinovic, I will. Do I also maybe want to loan out one of these defensive midfielders? 22, 23, 25, 21, 26. Do I kind of, I kind of want to loan him out like straight away? Or maybe Florent, no, not Florentina. Maybe, maybe Santos. Maybe we try and loan Santos because he's 74. He probably won't get game time. And we'll try and sell Krovinovic, whose contract is expiring anyway. I like Liga Nos over the Liga. Yeah, I like Portuguese League, to be honest. I like the Portuguese League in general. It's pretty good. Like, you, there's a lot of talented players there. Good vibes. You know, you're near the Mediterranean. I don't know. I wish they had the official licensing and stuff. That would be sick. Are you in the Europa League? Samuel Perez, we must be. Because we lost the Champions League qualification game. So we must be. Josko Gvardiol wants to get uh, the contract sorted. No way. No, sir. You are not joining Benfica. I'm so sorry to say. It's over for you. Santos loan offer from Porto. Okay. It's a loan to buy. I just want a loan, not a loan to buy. Yo, uh, Gardi, every manager has fave player. Wherever manager joins, he buys that player. Which one is yours? What's up, Gardi? I'm back. What's going on, Angry World Cup Gaming? Um, I actually don't, Ashish, I don't really have a player like that. Bad day for United yesterday. Jason, the situation, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't remember it. Negotiate. If, yeah, but if you, if you, this always happens. Brent is Mark's name. This always happens. If I do this and then go propose loan without buy, they always storm out. Always. Gardi, do you want to know my plans for YouTube? Yeah, go for it, Jamie. Let me know. What is it? Bye, lads. Got to go. Muhammad, thanks very much for being part of the stream, dude. Much appreciated. Thank you. Um... I have a channel, but I am trying to get a headset for the PS4 and I am thinking of streaming instead of making normal vids. Select is the best option for loan offer. Select? Who is Delect? Oh, delegates that offer you get. I see. If you delegate it, you can get it to be to get it, get it to work. Is that what you're saying? Samuel Perez is laughing. I don't know what it was, but it was something that I said for sure. I don't know what I did, but it was something I said. Hundred percent. You can just tell. You can just tell. Delegate. My bad. <laughs> um. Okay, so if you if you delegate it, you can go from loan to buy to just loan. You could loan out delegates. Okay, my first time. More Knight King. What's going on, dude? Welcome to the stream. Uh, because you said who's delect. Yeah, okay. Are those good uh, Flamengo youngsters in the game? Ashish says, yeah. Interest in Ihat Taren. Valencia have received an offer from Leon. They just beat us in the Champions League qualifiers. Now they're trying to steal our players. I'm going to get Leon one day. Trust me. Gardi, it's iFlow is the YouTube channel. Yes, I know. That's that's literally your name right now, Jamie. If you didn't realize. Oh, wait. What's that? Katarino transfer offer. 32 million. Big ones. Huge. No, we're not selling him now. 
Maybe if they came at me earlier in the window, I'd say yes, but not right now. Because that's some good money for um for a right back. That's a good money. You don't need that much money to buy a right back. They just need to be quick. That's it. Fun fact, your right backs just your full backs just need to be quick. That's it. Um Santos loan offer from Braga. Nuno Santos on a short loan. See, why does this come in now? I accept. So they'll take him in January, isn't it? That's good. He's still in Portugal. He's still playing Portuguese league football. That's really good. I'm happy with that. Why didn't that come in earlier, though? Okay, so yeah, we are confirmed in the Europa League. Our group consists of Basel, Anderlecht, and Copenhagen. So that's easy peasy. We're going to win the whole Europa League. Watch. Just watch. It's iFlow. I will sub and watch everything you make. Yeah, what kind of videos do you make, Jamie? You got to let me know. You have to let me know what videos you make. Also, I don't know why I can't just click your name and it takes me to your channel. I don't know why it plays me like that. But uh, I found your channel anyway. But you don't have anything on your channel. Oh, nice header. Nice banner header. It looks like you do FIFA stuff though. Are you going to be doing FIFA stuff? Yo, 62 likes on the stream. Shout out to everybody that's liked the stream. Thank you very much. Wait, it's iFlow is Jamie Ahern. Yeah, this is his second account, which is also his YouTube channel. Check it out if you guys want. I don't. He, there's nothing on there, <laughs> but check it out still if you want. Okay, so transfer offer for Kabak, which is no. A transfer offer for Krovinovic, which is a yes. Real Betis can have him for 7.2 mil. That's not bad. FIFA is the plan. Cool. And he's still ignoring me. Albi. I literally just read it out. I literally just read out your comment. How did you not realize I just re read your comment? You want to fight me or something, Albie? Let's fight. Let's see. I'm ready to go, mate. Let's go. Um, okay, so this is against a really weak... You know, you know what I got to do? Hold on. You know what I got to do? Not you, Jamie. Oh, I see. Well, you can fight Jamie instead. Um... <laughs> I'm going to make a second team sheet here. I'm going to do a rotated team sheet. How about that? Uh, row... Lol. Ashish? It's pretty funny, isn't it? <laughs> 63 likes on the stream. Sorry, my bad. Thank you. Thanks to everybody that's liking the stream. Alright, so it's gonna be Servi, Schmidt, Pedrinho, Florentino, and Asunshao. Can... Who's gonna lose more playing as a midfielder? Or should I make... I'll do the second formation as a two center defensive midfield. What is it? Defend? Yeah, okay. And so it'll be Pedrinho. Wait. No, Pedrinho there. Florentino there. And I might move Pedrinho up a little bit and make him a cam. Um. Then at left back, we'll have the other Tavares. Pizzi's up front. Uh, on the right, I should say. Pereira on the right. Center backs will be uh, Semedo and Conti. Uh, we'll also, for the rotated lineup, we'll put Dedic on the bench. Santos on the bench. Jota on the bench. Gonzalez on the bench. Man, this is such a deep lineup. This is sick. We've got so many options. Ridiculous. Um... That oh Dantas doesn't have a spot on the bench. Uh shit. 23 years of age. 28. Okay, Gonzalez is a little bit older, so don't worry about him. Alright, what's everyone saying? Yeah, second team. Yeah. Guardi, I've got a channel as well, but you don't have to go look at anything. I'm just saying because why not? Is it the channel that you're commenting with right now, LCFC Robbie? Is it about Leicester City? Is it a, a channel? I've never seen any YouTuber streaming FIFA Cremo, dude. Great to see. Really? More Night King? Flickify also streams um, every so often. He doesn't upload his streams, but he does stream. So there's that. I don't know if you know who Flickify is. You should check him out if you don't. But um, I'm here um, Sundays through Thursdays, dude, at around well, a little bit, usually a little bit earlier than this. Today's a little bit different from other days, but a little bit earlier than this. 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. UK is usually when I'm streaming. So if you got nothing else to do, I'm here. Guardia, once I get a headset, I'll make content and FIFA 21. Nice. Good luck, dude. I'll be keeping up with your stuff. For sure. Yeah, it's on this channel, currently in the middle of a bio-level accusing career mode. 
How come you don't have like a um a picture or anything, LCFC Robbie? How come you don't have uh, uh, uh like a, a DP or anything? That would help. I think that's good. If you're doing a YouTube channel, you'd need like a, a like a logo or something. I found your channel. You got a few videos up there. Violet Vicuzin episode one, two, and three. Short but sweet. Oh, I see. You don't. Oh, you don't even have a game capture. Wow. That's um. That's proper old school LCFC, Robbie. I haven't done it yet. I'll do it now. Ah, uh, it's. You know what? If you're just starting out, it's not a rush, dude. Just start, enjoy it first. Gotta you inspired me to do YouTube finally. Really? Ah, oh, man, that's really nice of you to say. I don't really see myself as an inspiration, but that's very nice of you to say. My first game in the Getafe Carimera is Atletico Madrid. That's tough, Hyper JJ. Good luck, though. Albi and Ashish both say good luck. You need to do training to get their sharpness up. Um, I kind of simulate the training, to be honest. I don't really care. By the end, by the time you get middle of the season, I should say, by the time you get, like, into the season, the, the sharpness goes up naturally anyway. So, I don't really, I don't bother with it too much. As you could tell, I just sim through the calendar, and then they, I assume they train on their own without me. They don't even need me. Um, Gardy, you saw the potential in me, and I thank you for that. <laughs> well, you know what, Jamie? I just think if you enjoy it, I think everybody should... Um... Everybody should do what they enjoy, right? That's my thing. So as long as you're enjoying it, and just don't look too closely at the numbers, because at the beginning, the numbers are going to be hard to come by. So if that's... if Just enjoy what you're doing and build a little community. That's what I was saying. Like, my favorite thing to do is stream, because I got a little community, I got the people that I know, you know what I mean? Like, you guys are becoming more and more familiar with me, I'm becoming more and more familiar with you. It's, it's, sometimes smaller is better as well, like, with, um, with YouTube. But just be true to yourself, and just make content you want to make. That's it. And if it works out, it works out. If it doesn't, it doesn't. C'est la vie. Winning, Gardi? Yeah, we are actually winning. Make some substitutions, actually. I'll bring on uh, um, Dedic. I want to bring on Dedic. So we'll bring him on for Tavares. He's got a little bit more match sharpness, so he probably doesn't need to be out there as much as Pereira does on the right. Jota will probably come on for Shervy. And Dantas will come on for Pedrinho. Three substitutions. I'm a madman. Confirmed. Uh, Gardi, thank you so much for the beginning of the stream. It means so much to me. Callum, honestly, dude, don't even mention it. Don't even mention it, man. I'm more than happy to chat with you guys and help you guys and talk to you guys. That's why I'm here, man. That's why I'm streaming. That's why I like doing this. It's so interactive. That's why I like it. I like it more than videos. I've been wanting to do career mode on YouTube for four years now, but where I live, I can't get a capture card, so I can't record. Yeah, see, that sucks, Albie. It's just, it, it sucks a little bit that um, you kind of need that. You know, it's, it's at this point in YouTube's maturity, like if you, if Albie, if you were doing that 10 years ago, you could get away with it. But now it's, you can't, you like, you need the capture card. You need like HD quality and all the rest of it. You know what I mean? Which kind of sucks because it, it, you're limiting some content creators ability to even get found in the first place and that kind of sucks but what are you gonna do it's just the way of the world you know what i mean it's just i'll tell you what if i buy a new capture card i'll send you my one albi to be honest i did i have an elgato hd60 now i used to have the original elgato but i got rid of i sold it to someone here in melbourne i put it up on like gumtree and i sold it on to a little kid in melbourne so I can't join or donate here because of my country. It sucks so much. <laughs> yeah, that does suck, Albie. I know you would as well. I can tell. Um... Gardy, you have sh uh, become my straight-up favorite YouTuber. Thank you very much, Jamie. Honestly, that means a lot. Thank you. Joe says you're such a natural streamer as well. I think so too, Joe, to be honest with you. I think it suits me a lot. Me, me Flick and B have talked about it a lot. And we're all in agreement that 
that streaming suits me a lot. So, you know, I'm going to keep doing it, to be honest. This is because you know what it is, Joe? I, I've come back and I just, I'm only doing what I want to do. And streaming is something I want to do. So I'm doing it. I don't care if this gets better numbers than videos or not. Which, by the way, these streams do better videos, better numbers than my videos at the moment. But I don't, I don't really care about that. Like, for me, I just want to enjoy what I'm doing. And I have I honestly, straight up, love streaming. It is so, so good. So I'm going to keep streaming. Because that's what I want to do. And that's what you guys should do. You should do what you guys want to do. Um, best way to do it? Exactly, Joe. All right, let's get some uh, contract renewals, shall we? Let's get some of these players on the books. But the recording is too short. Um, because of your clean nature, you must have lots of friends around you. You're so kind, kind guardian. Oh, thanks, Ashish. I, d I have friends around me, yeah. I mean, I, I tend to stick with a smaller group. My friendship group's around 10 people. I don't really need more than that, to be honest. Sutru says, I want to be loved. I love you, Sutru. Wait, isn't Krovinovich leaving? How can I give him a new contract? Getson Fernandez definitely needs a new contract. You've kept me going uh, tonight. I appreciate it. Callum, you're more than welcome. And you know I'm going to be here tomorrow as well. And you know you're welcome to come back tomorrow again. And you know that chat's going to be here for you as well, Callum. And I love the fact that you used Kiwi emoji as well. Nice. Uh, Pizzy? What's happening with Pizzy? Is he retiring? He's ret Wow, Pizzy's actually retiring. He's got a release clause of 73 million. That's ridiculous. Pizzy is retiring at 32. That's crazy. All right, we got, we got the important guys on contract, so love you too, guards. <laughs> I swear I remember watching your YouTube videos a long time ago, says Samuel Perez. Yeah, I mean, I've been making... Honestly, it's kind of crazy how long I've been making videos for. Or I guess how... I guess when the first video came out, I can't believe it was like that many years ago. Bro, honestly, lifesaver. Ah, oh, don't, don't say that, though. I'm sure, Callum, I'm sure you have support around you as well. Outside of this. I'm sure you do. My first video came out six years ago. Six. I've been... I've been... I've been making videos for six years. I mean, I took a couple years off, but still, like, let's say... Even just, say, five years. Four or five years. Crazy. Um... Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. Of course, mate. Congratulations. Uh, I don't know if there's a... Con I mean, I'm pretty happy with what I've done on YouTube. Like, I still want to be successful. Don't get me wrong. I still want this to bang. I still want to be... I still want this to be my job. But I'm, I, I'm still proud of what I've done on YouTube. Because I did it the, the hard way. The real way. You know what I mean? Like, I didn't have... Shoutouts. I didn't have... Uh, a big YouTuber like giving me a, a platform like I literally just made videos and grinded and I, w I got to where I was you know what I mean this stream and Guardi's comeback has been one of the best things to happen in, FIFA, in uh, 2020 <laughs> in FIFA 20 in 2020 well it can be your job keep grinding exactly Callum that's it that's that's why I'm here I mean I enjoy it but it'll, it could also get it could also become my job Guardi when you become a big YouTuber don't forget us <laughs> I won't assist, trust me. You should be, uh, Gardy. You're a great YouTuber. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Hi, I'm back with a pick, says LCFC Robbie. For me, it hasn't loaded a pick, Robbie. Maybe for other people, it's different. But for me, it hasn't loaded it just yet. I think Hyper JJ tries changing his pick a lot. And he gets problems with how quickly he gets updated as well. So, uh, you really made me sad. Don't ignore me like that again. What is with Albi trying to get Jamie's attention and Jamie just doesn't want to listen to Albi? What's up with that? You should change your profile pic to a Kiwi. I'm actually thinking of making an emoji and it's me, edit my face edited onto a Kiwi fruit. Guardi, if you didn't take the breaks, you'd easily be over 100k now, I reckon. Only a matter of time. Joe, I'd have to agree with you, to be honest. I don't like saying it because I don't like bigging myself up too much. But I reckon I'd be on the same level as like or not not same level but i'd be close to b minus i think in terms of subs but de I, i'd say definitely 100k and that's me being a little bit uh generous as well 
a little bit moderate, I would say. Because I, I really thought I was I was banging when I was when I stopped. Like I was doing really well still. So that'll be a lit emoji. Guardi with Kiwi. We're talking about Star Wars, and he just stopped talking, and I think I have separation anxiety. <laughs> Jamie's playing hard to get, that's what it is. It's just him playing hard to get. But yeah, Joe, no, no disrespect to some of the guys that have gotten big that I used to make videos with, but I look at some of them and I'm just like, man. I could do what I could do what they're doing. Like, this that would be so easy. Like, they're not doing anything special. Um, dude, I really missed you the last couple of years. You really are my Jesus and your streams are my prayers. <laughs> oh, Kevin, you're too much, man. You're too much. I do appreciate that. Honestly, it meant a lot to me when I came back after two years and I still had people that were interested in, in me. It, it's such a touching thing. Like, it's... You realize what you're building on YouTube is not just digital. Like, it's real. You know what I mean? Like, there's real people that are actually invested in you. It's kind of crazy. It's... How do you get the screen recorded so well? I need to improve on that a lot. LCFC Robbie. I um I uh, got the HD60, but I recently got uh, I I tinkered around with some settings in OBS. I use OBS to record. I don't know what you uh, didn't you have a um Yeah, you you record your screen with a camera. Mine is literally a capture card. So I just I'm not using a camera to record the screen. It's literally the screen feeding into, like, a, it's like an Elgato. It, it is an Elgato game capture. So it's not, it's not a camera recording. Like yours is a camera recording the screen. Guardia, I always feel bad when FIFA YouTubers leave. I got to go by Guardian, everyone. See you later, Samuel Prez. Thanks for dropping by, dude. Much appreciated. Um, just one request. Don't ever stop playing FIFA. Ashish, I probably won't. I can't imagine myself never playing, like, not playing FIFA again. Bye, Samuel. I thought for a second that Albie were talking to me. Yeah, uh, how do you get the capture card and all that, though? Uh, <laughs> I bought it online. PSV defeats... Oh, Barcelona in the Europa League! <laughs> Did you guys see that? My name is Samuel. Yes, Albie. Did you guys see that? Let me show you. Let me show you. Where are they? There they are. <laughs> Barcelona in the Europa League. <laughs> Sucked in. Who else? Is I mean, I don't know why I'm laughing. I'm not anti Barca or anything like that. That's a huge group. PSV, Wolves, and Celtic. Who else is in here? Any more surprises? Spurs. Well, that's not a surprise, actually. Milan, Sporting Club de Portugal. Arsenal as well. Wow. So both Arsenal and Spurs missed out. Um, do we know when Ellen Road comes to FIFA 21? No idea. Yeah, um, LCFC Robbie. I don't know. I can't suggest because it depends on where you live. I can't really suggest a website to buy it. But for the Elgato, I think if you go on their official page, you should get... You should be able to buy it from there. I'm just not sure that that's the cheapest place to get it. Depends on where you live. So that's all I can say for that. Farence. All right, we'll sim against Farence. Uh, simulate match. But uh, again, L uh, LCFC Robbie with the game capture, you also kind of need a good computer. So I don't know what you're rocking with in terms of computer stuff. You kind of need a good computer. Uh, Suchu says use Pedrinho in the first team. Barcelona is shit. <laughs> uh, Callum, I don't know when Ellen Road is coming to... I thought it was already in FIFA 21. Maybe they're doing it for next gen? If I had to guess, I reckon they're doing it for next gen. If it's not in FIFA 21 current gen, then they're going to do it for next gen. Albi says, I can record the 15 minutes on my PS4, and then with USB, I can put it on my laptop and upload, right? FIFA career mode should blow up soon, I hope. Why would it not already have blown up? That's my thing. Why is it not already blown up? <clears throat> I 
We're down to 25 viewers. No, slowly, slowly withering away. Yeah, Albie, I did that for a couple years. Sam, where is AG? Who's AG? It should... Uh, where is Aleha D... Okay, I might... Uh, you got the best ones, though, says Callum. I got the best what? Alejandro Grimaldo. I'm still here, Guardy. What's going on, Hyper JJ? How's your career mode going with Getafe, dude? Did you win that game against Atletico Madrid? Uh, there's a setting where you can make clip, make the clips an hour long as well. Well, there you go, Albi. That's not bad. Is it also called a cam link? Robbie, a cam link is when you have a camera and you feed that camera into the computer. Like you link it to the computer and then you can have your camera being recorded. Instead of clicking record on your camera and then having to get the file from the camera and putting it on your computer, you record from the computer your camera. I don't have that. I just use a webcam, which is already connected. But if you have like a Canon or like a really good camera, like a, a really, really good camera, then you cam link it and you can you can feed it into OBS. So uh, you can stream with it. You can record with it already in your PC. But if you don't have a cam link, you can still record on your camera and then put the files into the computer, like with a USB or, whatever, or however you use, however you do it. When I first started recording videos, I had a little Sony video cam, flip cam. I used to put on a tripod and record my face. And then with the Elgato, I used to record the game capture. And then um, I used to take the, the memory card out of the camera, put it in the computer, get the files out, and then use the camera again whenever I had to. Now with the webcam, because it's specifically made for it, I record just straight from the computer. But if I had to use another camera like that, the Sony flip, flip cam, I'd have to keep doing that unless I bought a cam link. So I haven't used the cam link personally, so I can't give you any ideas on which one or how to use or what to use it for. I haven't had to use it personally, but if I keep getting bigger and keep making money from YouTube, eventually I want to buy a very, very nice camera. And then I probably do need a cam link to stream with that camera while using my PC as well. Um, Joe's also giving Albi some advice about the uh, recording on PS4, and he's also subscribed to Albi. Albi, do you upload videos? I'm going to subscribe to LCFC Robbie real quick. And I'm also going to subscribe to um, Jamie. I'm just going um, to subscribe to you guys, and I'm just going to keep up to date with you guys. I can't promise that I'll watch every video, but every so often I'll just look at, see what you guys are doing. Okay, guys, I've got soccer football practice today, so I've got to leave. No worries, Hyper JJ. Thanks for being here, dude. Much appreciated as always. Thank you. Uh, Albi, send, send in your link there. Albi, no, he doesn't make videos. Okay. We can sim the rest of this, I think. No subs as well. The audacity of me. Have a great rest of your day, chat. Yeah, that's true. Chat, what time is it where you are? The people in UK, it's only 11.30, innit? You still got plenty of time. You can still all stay awake a little bit longer. Good luck, JJ. Yeah, have fun at practice, dude. So we're top, tippity top of the table. We've, we've taken um, perfect points. Ashish, it's 5 a.m. Ashish has pulled an all-nighter. In Bulgaria, it's 1.33 a.m. Wow, that's huge. It's um, 12.30 a.m. in the Netherlands, I think the Netherlands uh Kevin you are from the Netherlands aren't you I always forget and uh in England it's 11 30 okay cool Guardy, I'm trying to sub to him to who to whom are you trying to sub um just search Albi Idrizi on YouTube but I haven't uploaded any vids I I tried I couldn't get to your channel there were some other things that came up some playlists and stuff like that but I don't think I could get to your channel I think if I search right and then filter and then channel even then you don't come up even if i filter it by channels it doesn't come up unfortunately 
Uh, sorry, I've got to go now. I'll come next stream. All right, LCFC Robbie, no worries. See you next time, dude. The best time for a nice joint, says Kevin. Nice. Kevin is getting drunk. He's getting turned up. Could you do a Volta next time? Um, Callum, I'm not sure if I want to do Volta, to be honest with you. I got, I got no idea if I actually want to do Volta or not. Um, when end the stream? <laughs> Honestly, I'll, I'll be honest with you, Sutri, I got no idea. I can end this whenever I want. I can literally end this whenever I want. I'm, I've been, I'm three hours, 26 in. I might try hit four hours today. Albi, if you can't link your channel, if the chat doesn't let you link your channel, send it to me on Twitter and then I'll link it in the chat. Don't end soon. Don't end it, lol. Well, I mean, I can go as long as I want, so yeah, I'm not going to end it. I'm still in quarantine, so fuck my sleep schedule. Nice. Oh, we're 1-0 down to Belen... Belen... Bel Belenense. Belenense. And we're at home too, so how are we down? That's my thing. We're at home, so how are we down? If these boys don't get up uh, by half time, we have to jump in, eh? We simply have to jump in. Perhaps search into it. Don't end lol. I'm awake to see your stream, says Ashish. Don't get me wrong. I will watch it if it is 11 hours, but I need to sleep. <laughs> ah, suit you. It's not going to be 11 hours. Don't worry about it. I'm not streaming all day. No. I won't be streaming more than another hour and a half, I don't think. So do got to go bed soon. <laughs> I got less online lesson at 9.15 tomorrow, so got to go to bed soon. Yeah, fair enough. No, I, I don't think I'll be streaming more than an hour and a half. I kind of want to enjoy the day. It's a nice day today in Melbourne, a really nice day. I might sit outside, have an alcoholic beverage, enjoy the sun, you know what I mean? I'm going to make a different account and keep this as my personal. How about that? Okay, thank you guys for the support. Albie, no worries, dude. As soon as you make the channel, you let me know. You link it in here if you can. If not, I will. I'll sub to you. I'll keep up with your stuff. Don't worry about it. Don't even worry about it. Anyway, um, did I hear alcohol? Yeah, Kevin, I will definitely be having an alcoholic beverage today. I don't know what. I'm not quite sure what. Maybe a scotch and a Coke. I don't know about beer. I might have to walk down to the bottle shop, actually. I do have scotch. I also have Hennessy. I also have some other stuff. I also have gin as well. Well, skull to you, mate. You too, Kevin. Skull to you as well. Um... I might make some gin. I might go get some juice. I might make some gin and juice for the daytime. The thing is, Gardi's thinking way smaller to my older brother. He is no more now. You remind me of him. Ashish, I'm not sure what you're trying to say, but if you're saying that I remind you of your older brother and that he's passed away, that is a very big honor, to be honest. If that's what you're saying, I don't know if that's exactly what you're saying because you says he is no more now. So I don't know if that's what you're trying to say. But, um, this fan is starting to annoy me. But, um, if that's what you're trying to say, uh, that's, that's, that's a huge compliment. That's right. Wow. That's a huge compliment, man. Thank you. I don't think I could ever be your brother or replace him. But, uh, if I remind you of him, that's a huge compliment. Thank you. I don't understand what you just said, Jamie. Have you subbed to me? Well, uh, why? Kevin, what's your choice of drink? Skull to you. What, what's your choice of drink? I need to know. Big love hearts for Ashish from Callum. Yeah, let's all get around Ashish. He didn't have to share that, but that's, that's, uh, that's a very high compliment from him. It's iFlow says, give me a second. I just, I call you Jamie. That's the thing. I'm not going to call you anything other than Jamie. You should just make your channel Jamie Ahern. Um, it's 1.38 a.m. in South Africa. Wow, more Night King. You're from South Africa. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. What part of South Africa? Johannesburg? South Africa.
I only guessed Johannesburg because I don't really actually know any other cities. I mean, like Cape Town as well. You could be from Cape Town. Pretoria, I know that. Look at me, I actually know a lot more than I thought. Um, there's also... Durban? Is Durban in South Africa? It's not, is it? Can you understand Dutch? Hey, that's true as well. Yeah, more Night King. You should... Or, well, maybe you understand Dutch. Beer with lime? I prefer beer, but I like everything. I still remember losing my stepdad to lung cancer four years ago now. Wow, Callum, that's big. That's huge. My, my best friend, or one of my very close friends, he just lost his dad to throat cancer very, very recently. Um... A week and a half ago now, so yeah, very sad. Um, but yeah, rest in peace to him, dude. Four years is a long time as well, so. Gardy, can you call? You can call me Jamie. You're my favorite YouTuber. Well, it is your name at the end of the, <laughs> at the end of the day. Uh, I have the privilege of saying I've had a pint with Cutsy and B Monus at the same time. Yeah, Joe, that's sick. Two absolute legends as well. Uh, I wish I could have gone to like a, a one of those meet meetups or whatever. Uh, I'm gonna have to in the future. Bless him. I hope he's okay or at least coping. Says Callum. Okay, guys. Yeah, he's actually doing really well. Like, he's got a good support system around him. Like, his family is very close, close knit, and all his friends have been around him as well. And they've known for a long time, Callum. Like, it's been terminal for a while, so they kind of knew that it was coming. It's just. It's different when it actually happens, so. Albie was diagnosed with leukemia in 2018. That's a really bad thing. I'm so grateful for everything, especially my family. Yeah, Albie, I think you've mentioned that before, and yeah, we're all here for you as well, Albie, so. I mean, it's just crazy when you get into it, how many people have gone through things and, and the, the different paths that, that lives take you around, so. um, Yeah, everybody sort of has that story behind them, you know what I mean? Oh god, yeah, it's horrible. You know it's gonna happen. Yeah, I mean, it's it's positive and negative count. Like you can kind of come to peace with it, but then you're just waiting almost, and then you still have them there, so you don't really know what it's like, and then it it happens, and then and then it's uh it's final. You know what I mean? So, I mean he he's he's going through a little bit now. I'm sure he still has these moments in his personal in his personal life, but with us, with his mates so far, he's been he's been good. He seems to be in good spirits. So. He's got a girlfriend, he's, he lives with his brother, and he's close with his family, so... Yeah. Did he manage to say goodbye? Yeah, he did, Callum, yeah. Yeah, he did. Um, thanks, Ashish. I actually caught the cold a couple of days ago, but I'm doing much better now, thank you. Thanks, everyone. Um, Kevin says, dude, you should come to the Netherlands so we can get high, as high as the birds. Kevin, I have a feeling you are into some good stuff. If I had to guess... I reckon, like, you know... Obviously, you're from the Netherlands. So, I reckon you know... You know what's good. Let me just put it that way. I have a feeling you know what's good. Apparently, more Night King doesn't know any Dutch. Ridiculous. But what part of, did you did he answer East London? What? You're from East London, South Africa? <laughs> Why are you capping for? <laughs> I just want to know what part of South Africa you're for you're from. Sorry, I'm just uh, sending a message here. No prizes for guessing who it's to. Um, dude, do I know what's good? Lowers glass. <laughs> dude, do I know what's good? Lowers glasses, winks. Kevin is like an expert, 100% expert. I'm glad you're feeling feeling better, Albi. Hope you beat it. Hey, Gardy, who's your favorite player in Cricket Australia? Among Golden Era Batch, pick one. Ooh. Um. I would say... 
I'm just Gil Adam Gilchrist is part of that, isn't it? Because it, for me, it's it's Gilchrist first. I'm just trying to think of if it's not Gilchrist, who 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 would it be? Um, I'm trying to give you who would be my second because Gilchrist is my favorite player of all time. I'm just trying to give you who would be second. Maybe like a Justin Langer, someone like that. But Gilchrist by far was my favorite. I loved Adam Gilchrist. 2-1, by the way. Correct, it is. I might make some subs here. We're playing our actual... No, we're playing the second lineup. Okay, okay. I was going to say, we're struggling with our actual lineup, but it's our second lineup. Also, Semedo at center back. I don't mind that. Because I'll tell you what. He's six foot three, but he's also kind of quick. He can pass. He's good defending and great physical. I actually like him in the, in the center back position. I can't lie. Suchu has a problem. What's going on, Suchu? What is my favorite car? Um, a Lamborghini Miura. No. Ah, oh, maybe a Lamborghini Miura. I'm happy you got a Liga Nos offer. You're back, Flickify. What are you doing today, Flick? Anyway. Um, if not a Lamborghini Miura, a... A Jaguar E-Type. That's the one. A Jaguar E-Type. Look that up. For anybody that doesn't know what a Jaguar E-Type looks like, please go look it up. And tell me it's not the sexiest thing you've ever laid eyes on. Um, recording a vid for tomorrow. Nice flick. Nice. Is that Southampton? And then cooking up some food for tonight. Nice. You should record that as well, flick. <laughs> you should live stream yourself cooking. There's an idea. I don't know if you could actually set that up, though. Um, such a great car, man. Speed, Lamborghini, go. Brr. 50 tips and tricks for FIFA 21. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. You actually wrote out 50... T oh, my God. Flick, thanks for Guardi's raid. Yeah, Flick, I do appreciate that. It's obviously worn off a little bit, but I think I've got some people that'll come back. Full G. How to find regens? Full G. Did Flick, is there a way you could set it up so you could stream yourself cooking? Probably not, right? I would watch that. It's a good bunch of folks. I could tell. I have a feeling like our communities would be very, very similar. And we should... Yes, it is possible to live stream cook. You should definitely do that. Chef Flick. You should get it. You should actually get like a chef hat and everything. You should dress up like a chef and live stream it. I would watch it. Oh yeah, that Jaguar is nice. Callum is a fan of the Jaguar. I think I prefer the Jaguar over the, uh, the Lamborghini Miura, but the Miura is sexy as well. Can you cook? Oh, wow. Kevin. Okay, maybe not. Um, I may or may not already have a chef hat. Nice. <laughs> nice. Joe Hay, I'd watch Chef Flick. I think he'd be cooking at bad times for UK. I think for UK, it'd be middle of the night when he was cooking. But for Australia, I could definitely watch him. It'd be, it'd be a fantastic time for me to watch him cook. Give me some inspiration on what to eat during the day. Maybe a cheeky lunch stream. <laughs> Just a cheeky one. <laughs> Chef Flick. That'd be good. I'd be so down for that. Do it, do it. Even Jamie Ahern is saying do it, do it. Um, I'm trying to get to my email box, but I can't do it. Training injury. Julian Weigel is set to be out for eight weeks. No. I want to do cooking vids eventually. I mean, you've already got a few people supporting. Probably incorporate it into a Q&A or something. All right. Julian Weigel is injured. But luckily, of all positions, that is the one that we have the most cover in. And we're going to get Asun Chow straight in. Ahead of Florentino. I'm going to disrespect Florentino and put Aswan Chow in there. Why? Because I'm a bad son of a gun. Um, you can still check the Youth Academy if you if they have updated. Not Vigel. I know. I really like Vigel. That's why it's in the thumbnail. I, I requested him specifically for a reason. Um, the Youth Squad. So it's still Maya at 61 rating. 
from Switzerland. Do a how-to basic style cooking stream. Um, no one else is really interesting me at the moment, to be honest with you. Like, these guys have good potential, but their overall suck. Hey, Flick, when is the next Southampton episode coming? Come on, Flick, the people want it. Um, Flick, you could do it with your career mode. To whatever time you're at, you have to cook a meal from there. What? I don't get that one, Xander. Fleek, you could do it with your career modes. To whatever time you're at, you have to cook a meal from there. Oh, whatever team you're at. Yeah, you could do like a... a, a um, it's like if you're in the f in French League, you cook a French dish. And you have like dish of the day. Today's French dish is escargot. And then you eat it. That's not a bad idea. Yo, Xander, that's actually good. That's actually a good idea. I like that. If Flick is here, he should take that. If he's still listening, he should take that idea. 100%. Then if you go to Spain, you get you do Spanish dishes. And because you're doing only half a, a season per episode, you only maybe need to cook like four dishes for like, or six dishes or whatever. However many seasons you do. Escargo, my cargo. Yeah. That's a big time biggie line. He's not here anymore. I don't think Flick is here anymore. He heard the idea and he's now like, he, he peaced out. He's like, oops, now people actually want to see me cook. I'm out. I'm gone. Um, go to a Swedish team and eat like a Viking, says Suchu. Yeah, you can full get like a, um, like the, 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 the things they drink in, the, like the horns or whatever. Man, that's a good... Xander actually comes up with some good ideas. That's another one for you. I mean, Xander didn't say the, the Swedish one, but he came up with the original idea to have the meals. I'm going to... You know what, Xander? I'm going to... If Flick's not here, I'm going to DM him that idea. 100%. I'm going to DM him. That's a good idea. That's a good way to incorporate cooking in a career mode video. You just have a quick, like, two-minute little vignette of you cooking and eating the food and talking about it. I'm DMing him that if he's not here. He hasn't said anything, so I assume he's not here, but he could just be listening. He could be he could be the imposter. And he could just not be saying anything in the chat, so we don't find out he's the imposter. Sam, do that now. I'm not a cook. I, I I'm not a chef. And Gardy would react. I'm not a chef. I, I could do the commentary. I could do the commentary on it. If he writes something up about the meal. I could I could commentate him cooking and then he could eat it and react to his food. I, I would be okay with doing the commentary for it though. I'm putting my hand up now. I'll do it. It's for the fun. Cook something Portuguese in the streams. It's for fun. Now the problem is I can't stream in my kitchen. No, I couldn't set up my sh uh, stream in the kitchen. <laughs> I could stream off my phone, but I just don't know how I... I don't know where I put my phone for you guys to see. Also, I don't know the first thing about Portuguese food. Gardi, call him while he's while he does it. All right, we're up one nil. Darwin has scored, and we're struggling a bit. Copenhagen here. Come on now. Uh, Gardi, say F copyright and play who shot ya. <laughs> yeah, I'll do that. I will do that. All right, we've got 15 more minutes until we hit four hours, boys. So we're going for it. Portuguese are famous with wine and sweet stuff. Ooh, sounds sexy. I do like uh, some wine. Red wine, delicious, nutritious. Good save. Wait, are we the ones in red or the ones in white? We're the ones in red. Yeah, okay, cool. We have to be the ones in red, surely. Um... I could have sworn I went to somewhere that I did go to one Portuguese place, I think. It was called Asado. No, Ar Argentinian. That's what it was. It was Argentinian. And it was really good. They cooked a bunch of meat. S delicious. Fantastic. Um, Brian says, read my suggestion, but I haven't seen Brian in the chat for like two hours, so I don't know what suggestion that is. Have you heard of Jack the Ripper? Yeah, he was a murderer, wasn't he? Um, they have one traditional sweet named Nata. Gardi, you should ring Flick for the laugh. Um, it does have the color scheme in either, uh, in either corner. 
Yeah, yeah, it's, it has the red dot and the white dot. Is that what you mean? Nunez, goal, 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 goal. You know what I watched the other day? I watched Messi's goal against... Uh, I don't even know what the team was, but Messi's goal where he runs like half the pitch. I completely forgot how hype that commentator is. Messi, 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 Messi. Goal, 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 goal. I forgot how hype he was. Daddy, I was just doing some homework. I'm back now, bro. Bryant, that's good. It's good that you were actually doing homework, man. Nice. I was in Portugal two years ago. Um, I have a YT channel about stuff like FIFA soon. But it's FIFA 20, says More Night King. You got to get on FIFA 21, More Night King. Nobody wants to watch FIFA 20. Bill Bow in the cup final. You know what, Joe? That sounds actually... It sounds correct. Bill Bow, I think. Sergio Ramos has more goals than Messi this season. It's Callum. Gardi, I call Arsenal Arsmel. <laughs> nice. All right, Darwin Nunez gets the brace and gets us the W. So we're doing really well in the um, in the Europa League. I don't know how we're going to win the Europa League with Barcelona in there. But how are Barcelona not going to win this Europa League? Tell me that. And also, we're doing really well in the league. We've gotten perfect points in the league. Oh, and Tavares can be turned into a left back. Nice. <laughs> what else is here? And Yamga into a center mid. There we go. We've got some more position changes. Fantastic. I think it's fantastic. I think it's a fantastic idea. What's your opinion of VAR? Callum, I think it's good in some situations and really bad in other situations. Like, VAR should be for things that are very obvious. Not for things that are literally one centimeter. If it looks onside, even on a replay, then it is onside. I don't care if his fingernail is offside, right? Or I don't care if his kneecap is one or two millimeters offside. No, if he looks onside, he's onside. And man, you man shitted. Yeah, we kind of are right now, aren't we? Um, Pedrinho as a right wing. He looks a bit weird as a right winger, isn't it? <laughs> he does look a little bit weird as a right winger, but he nevertheless still is one. Um, I might change Pizzi into a center mid as well, just for aesthetic purposes. But he does play on the right. He's slow. I play him on the right and he's slow. What's wrong with me? Um, I completely agree with you. The penalty we got at Spurs was stupid, says Cal. The penalty that we... The, the penalty that Liverpool didn't get against... Not penalty. The goal that Liverpool didn't get against Everton was crazy. I don't like Liverpool. I'm a Man U fan. Man United fan, because I know people don't like Man U. I'm a Manchester United fan. I hate Liverpool. I'm so happy they didn't get the W. But that was not offside. It just wasn't offside. Even if you watch the replay as a human... It wasn't offside. The only reason they knew it was offside was because they drew some lines and it was like literally a millimeter. Th th that was not offside. I'm sorry. I'm just, Honestly, I hate to say it, but it wasn't. If that was Manchester United, I would just boycott the Premier League. Straight up. I would just be boycotting the Premier League. I'm going to play this Tavares at right back because he can still play there. So I'm going to have double Tavares. Jota will come onto the bench. And you know what we imagine we had Ruben and Nelson Semedo and we played this Semedo as well. So we can have two center backs as Semedo and the right back as Semedo. We just need a left back that's Semedo and we'll do a all Semedo back four. Or we'll have the two Semedos as center backs and the two Tavares as full backs. For that. Um Yay, Pedrinho is a starter now. Well, not yet. I still think Goncalves will start. Even the Lamptey goal last night was so dodgy. Yeah, that's true, Callum. I did see the highlight of that. It's just there's some moments where it, it it should be better, but it just isn't. Ugh, my nose is so itchy. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my cousin sent me a video of me streaming. <laughs> uh, Gardy, I'm going back to the other account. Okay, Jamie. Well, you got you got moderator on either one, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, what's your opinion on the Europa Super, European Super League? Callum, I don't like it. I don't like it. I like the Champions League. I like how the Champions League works right now. 
I think it's I think it's fine. Why do we need a European Super League? For what? Oh, hello there, says Jamie. He's back. He's back on the actual account that I know him for. Honestly, Jamie, you should just make your FIFA account the Jamie account. Nope, hate it. I don't want it. Hallam doesn't want it. He asked me just so he could tell me he doesn't want it. I don't want it either. General Kenobi. Hello there. Um, ruins football, it would. I think so too. I also don't like this whole top six thing, whatever the hell they did. I don't even know what it was called. Uh, long, long-term long vision? What was it called? What was it called? Long-term vision? Uh, fuck the Super League. Uh, <laughs> are you hyped for the third European Cup? Again, Kevin, no. I don't really like that. I get that, like, for the smaller clubs that don't get European football, it's great. But it's like, if you're going to make a third, then make a fourth and a fifth and a sixth. Like, you may as well have every team in Europe just qualifying for Europe. Like, it's... I don't like it. Again, I just don't. I don't even like the Europa League. I don't... I actually don't even like the Europa League. I wish the Europa League didn't exist. It's a second division European uh, competition. It doesn't make any sense. If you win the Europa League, you were the best of the shit teams. Like, of the... of the You were the best of the second division. It's like winning the championship. Like, it's great. But... Uh, it's not even a first division title. You know what I mean? It's not even a first division title. So it's, it's great. You won it. But you're happy that you got promoted. You're not happy that you won the silverware. Well, at least that's the way I see it. Like, obviously, you're happy your season got rewarded with silverware. Don't get me wrong. And I guess a league is a little bit different from Europa League. But for me, like, Europa League is literally just... Here's a Champions League B-Tech version. It doesn't make any sense. And then and you're going to do a C-Tech version. Jamie said, fuck Project Big Picture. And then Joe said, agree, Jamie. Yeah, me too. I don't, I don't agree with it. And one of my teams, oh, my, my team is one of the teams that are, are proposing it, but I don't want it. I don't want it either. There's some good things in it, but the amount of bad things that are in it are, is ridiculous. Goal, 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 goal. Yamga. What a goal. Uh, are you going to record all your videos while high on crack, says Kevin? Me? Mickey on crack? Who's Mickey on crack? I don't see a Mickey on crack. Um, because I don't. My brother came up with that years ago. I couldn't change it. Oh, I see. I want to change my name, Mickey on crack. Do you think? Ha! <laughs> my brother came up with that years ago, and I couldn't change it. Says Alby. That's a terrible name, Alby. A terrible name. <laughs> nah, actually, it's Mickey Mouse who's on crack. Haha, <laughs> okay then. Oh, ha ha ha. Nah, Albi, um, it's not a terrible name. I just, I don't think it's a good name. I'm just gonna be honest with you. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's not a good name. In my opinion. Hello, Darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk to you again. Mickey Mouse on crack, like in South Park or Paradise PD. I don't watch either of those, so I can't even tell you. Uh, yeah, Shervy can come off. The Europa League 2 is bullshit. I just, I don't understand why you'd want to see Division Europe. It just, I just don't like it. Like, who's going to win it? Like, RB Salzburg or, or I don't even know, Michiland or something? Like, who's going to win the U Europa League 3? Or Europa League 2? Whatever the hell you want to call it. Who's going to win it? You know what I mean? It's so unnecessary. I think it's it's just all about dinero. At the end of the day, it's all about money. If they think they can make advertising money off of it, they'll do it. Well, I haven't got a plan for my channel and name, so any suggestions? All right, Albi. Here, I got a good name for you. Bulgarian teams are going to win it? Yes, yeah, Sisica Sofia is going to win it. Um, What about... Here's one. Here's a good name. 
Albie's FIFA chat. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Uh, um, I don't know, to be honest with you. I have no idea. I'm really bad with names, as you can tell, because my channel name is terrible. When are you ending the stream? Joel says hi. What's going on, Joel? Good to see you. Um, soon. It's Water Break RN, so I got two minutes. Yes, it's Hyper JJ. <laughs> you're at training and you're watching me. Hyper JJ, what is wrong with you? Albi FIFA. Honestly, Albi FIFA is not even that bad. Because Albi is such a, um, like a unique name. So no one's going to think like, oh, he's just literally used his first name. They're just going to think, well, I don't know what Albi is, but Albi FIFA kind of works. Uh, they drew with Roma last week. Pretty good. Pedrinho gets a light injury. Who's the big Pedrinho fan? Your, your boy just got injured. All the lads are watching you RN. Okay. <laughs> Hello to Hyper JJ's uh, football team, I guess. Where you guys are from, it's soccer team. I did not know you was live today, said Joel. I started a little bit later, Joel, but I've been live for nearly four hours now. Four hours, nearly. Enjoy a water break, uh, Hyper JJ's uh, boys. And if you guys want to watch me, subscribe. You want to watch some Aussie playing FIFA? Spinning an apple on his desk that you guys can't see, but he's spinning the hell out of it. Volt Schmidt got the goal. Oh, Padrino is not injured anymore. They said they fin a sub later today. Yes, yeah, sweet. Get your whole club in here. You guys can dominate the chat. It did not tell me, said Joel. Oh, that's... That's just YouTube acting a fool. Um, I mean, Joel, you know I'm live every day regardless, but... It's, it's weird, because I don't have notifications on for anyone. For any channel. So for me, I can't even tell you how if notifications work or not, but yeah. Did you watch Man U versus Arsenal? Joel? No, I didn't. I'm going to pretend that I didn't watch it. Jamie said, lol. I need to sleep soon. I'm up at 8. Harry, you haven't said a damn thing. But why are you still here? How about Obi-Wan Kenobi? I'll be one Kenobi, I see. Um, I need to sleep soon. I'm up at 8. Harry, what time is it where you are? You should probably sleep, to be honest. Joel said, bad luck. Yeah, I know, it is bad luck. Isn't it? I mean, if you want, you can watch it, but we haven't done much. The only, I reckon the highlight of the stream was me losing 4-0 to Leon to miss out on Champions League. <laughs> I was watching. Yeah, Harry, you're a bit of a lurker, aren't you? You don't chat much. Um... The highlight of the stream was me losing 4-0 to Leon to miss out on, on Champions League qualification. We went down 1-0 and I full thought I was going to jump in and save the day and I got pumped. Absolutely pumped. That was a horrible loss. Even Ashish is not happy with that. Horrible loss. Albi plays FIFA. Did you sign anybody? Yeah, Joel, we've signed a lot of players actually. I can't even remember who. Good night from me. I can't stay awake anymore. See you tomorrow, lads. See you later, Suchu. Thanks for dropping by, dude. Much appreciated, as always. Thank you. Um, that's also very good, says Albi. No, I think Albi FIFA is better than Albi Plays FIFA. If you either do Albi Plays or Albi FIFA. Don't do Albi Plays FIFA. That's too much. It's too much. One or the other. It's your choice, Albi. But I would pick either Albi Plays or Albi FIFA. Or, honestly, just Albi. I would do that as well. Uh, stream highlight, Guardi reveals he's a big player by turning a young Callum to the dark side. Oh yeah, true. That was also, highlight of the stream was probably helping out Callum as well. Emma Undertaker went mad and threw Guardi through a window. Yeah, I actually, I had a, after that match, I had to have a, a Hell in a Cell match with female Undertaker. And she fucking chokeslammed me straight through the top of the cage, man. All the way down. Name should be short and catchy. Yeah, Ashish is correct. I'll be playing FIFA is too long. Albidinho, says Harry. What about just Albinho? Or is that too close to Albino? Probably close. Probably too close, right? Um, Albidinho. I don't mind that, actually. Try to win the league. I'm doing my best, Joel. I think we have a perfect record in the league. It is too close. <laughs> Albi says it's too close. I think we're actually on a perfect run at the moment, Joel. I think we've picked up maximum points from the league. Whether or not you believe me, that's up to you. But I'm pretty sure that's the case. Let's jump to result here. 3-0 against Maritimo. 
MUFC Forever says, hey, how are you? What's going on, MUFC Forever? I'm surprised that you even show a name like that after the results on the weekend, but yeah. What's your target this season? Um, honestly, Ashish, it's to win the league. Get back in the Premier League. And yeah, as you can see, we do have a perfect record. Fantastic. I think it's fantastic. I think it's a fun We've only conceded two goals in nine games. We're dominating. That's what I like to see. Can I suggest a player? Yeah, if it's Donnarumma, then no. I am Albanian and my name is Albi. Hey, how's it going? McCollman, welcome back, dude. Good to see you. Nice to have you around again. I missed you, McCollman. You're like a calming presence in the chat. Uh, Harry says, exactly. Callum says, Albi FIFA, best one. I like Albi FIFA. I also like just Albi. Albi is just short and sweet. It's who you are and it's what you do. All right. So Santos will play in this game. Look, I mean, Rovinovic is leaving, but we can still have him on the bench, right? We'll probably put some extra play, extra stamina on the bench for this one. Just because, um, bloody hell, we got a tired squad at the moment. Not Magnuson, no, Kadiv. Dedic will come on the bench. Um, and I guess, it, oh no, jo Jota, 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 Jota. We got Jota. He'll come on the bench. Catarino and Tavares are rested up. So there we go. That's actually a strong team though. It's just the bench that needed a little bit of um, a little bit of help. Uh, what about Bradaric, 20 year old, 75 rated left back? If you can, if you're gonna be here in future streams and you can remind me when the transfer window is open, then I might look at him. Or, after this, I can put him in the shortlist. Also, they have Byram in this uh, Moren Mo Morerens team. Why you have to be rude? Why you have to be mad? It's only game. I'm not being rude. Glory man shitted, glory man shitted. Yeah, Jamie, you like that name, don't you? I didn't think they were. Oh, they aren't. How about Coke and FIFA? Like Pepsi FIFA. What happened to Pepsi FIFA? I should know. I, I'm the one that I've spoken to. Low-key stressed about the election here in the States. I'm glad FIFA exists so I can relax a bit. Oh yeah, when does that get announced? Or... When when do the results come in, McCollman? Do you know? Biden will win? I actually think Trump will win. Is that weird? Tomorrow? Is that weird for me to think that? Not, not because I, not necessarily because I want it. I just have a feeling he's going to win. Tomorrow night. Okay, cool. Um, Albiminati. I don't like that name. I think Trump will win as much as I don't want him to. Yeah, it's not, it's not about what I want. It's just about what I think. I don't really care, to be honest, either way. I think they're both, uh... I, I think American politics in general is it damned if you do, damned if you don't. It's like a, a wolf and a fox is what they are. Philosopher Gardi is going to give you a little uh, thought, thought, what is it? A thought, uh, what's it called? Anyway, um, one is a fox and one is a wolf, I think. Well, I think that's in politics in general. I think most people are foxes. So foxes are deceiving and cunning. Wolves, they're not going to try and deceive you. They're just going to literally tell you, I'm going to kill you, and then they kill you. Foxes will try and be your friends, and then they'll kill you. Both are bad, but different kinds of bad. And I feel like in, a, in America recently, there's been a lot of foxes and a lot of wolves. I watched that last debate, and Trump is very good in that climate. Says Joe Hay. I just think that um, that's what I think. Like Usually it's two foxes. Like two people are trying to deceive you. Right? But I don't think Donald Trump's trying to deceive you. I think he actually just tells you how it is. It's kind of weird. Where do bears stand? I don't know. Bears are just chilling. They're not part of politics, I don't think. Darwin Nunez with a goal. Nice. Um, I don't think bears are part of politics. If they were, they would be... I don't know. Bears hibernate. They can't be part of politics. What are they going to do throughout the winter when they're sleeping? 
through. Am I right, Harry? I am right. Bears are like my favorite animal as well, so. And there's no way my favorite animal is involved with politics. Uh, why is that? Why do we have the wrong people at the top ATM? Callum, you know what it is? We've always had... We've always had the wrong people at top, up top. You just are realizing it now. I've said this before on stream. There are very, very few politicians, especially in modern times, that are actually good people or that actually go through with the promises or that actually tell the truth. In fact, if you're a politician, you basically never tell the truth. It's just that now people are realizing it. That's all it is. Kanye is a bear. His hibernation is not dropping enough music. Gadi, uh, wait, wait. Gadi is sus. No, I'm not. Do you live stream Among Us ever? Ashish, if I get a group of people to play with, I will stream it. Shout out to the New Zealand Prime Minister. Callum, how would you know what the New Zealand Prime Minister does? I'm not saying that Jacinta Ardern doesn't do good things, but how would you know? She's doing a good job with COVID. I don't think you can give politicians credit. <laughs> or, I don't, think you give, I don't think you should blame politicians or give them credit for how their countries deal with COVID. I've heard good things about... That's the problem, Callum. That is the problem. You've heard good things about what she's done. That's the problem. That is what... She's done good things for her country. You can't even name one thing. You've heard that she's done good things for her country. That's the problem. You know what I mean? That's my. That's literally why I'm asking you, how would you know? Her public image is great. Don't get me wrong. And I don't, I don't know what she's done either. But I'm just not going to judge her. I don't know what she's done. I couldn't name you one policy. You know what I mean? That, that's what I'm trying to... I'm not saying that you're right and I'm wrong or, right, or I'm right and you're wrong. Re regardless, I don't know anything she's done. You don't know anything she's done. But her public image is really good, right? That's half of politics. How do people see you? That's politics. You just assume that Jacinta Ardern is good and that um, Boris Johnson is bad. But I don't know what either of those two have done. That's the, that's the problem with politics. So much is public image. That's why politicians lie. That's why politicians do things like AOC, right? Like she streams on Twitch now. That's why she tries to be edgy. That's why Jacinta Ardern tries doing all these good things. That's why a lot of pol politicians do public appearances at hospitals or schools or whatever it is. It's for public image. That's what it is. The way you see a politician, most of the time, like people think Barack Obama was a great president. If you ask them to name a couple of policies that he introduced, they don't know what the hell he's done. You know what I mean? Like, um, you, no one really knows politicians for their policies, which is what they're there to do. People know politicians as personalities. That's my whole point. I don't know about Boris, though. I actually don't know any... You guys would know about Boris because you live in those countries, but I don't know about Boris. I, I couldn't even tell you the first thing he has or hasn't done. So I'm not going to judge Boris. I'm not going to judge Jacinta Ardern. I'm gonna judge. I'm gonna judge anyone. I don't really know what any politicians have done. I barely know what Australian politicians have done. But I wish more people would admit that they just don't know what politicians have done, instead of saying, "Oh yeah, he's a good president. He's a bad president. He's a good prime minister. He's a bad prime minister." Gardy, one word: corruption. Yeah, Jamie, huge, massive corruption. Obama was better than the current one. Based off what, Ashish? Based off of what? That's, that's my whole point here is based off of what? Off of policy or of, of, of how he carried himself? Obama carried himself more presidential than a lot of presidents. I, I, I agree with that. I accept that. But as a president where he actually introduces policies, how do you know that he was better than Donald Trump? 
name me the policies that each introduced and how Obama's were better than that's my whole point nobody knows anything about politics but they act like they do that's my whole point So wasp <laughs> um joe says not not nah not even the right wing like boris atm we're a mess harry we don't uh know this though and then harry said better than corbyn would have been well yeah you don't know that Bom boris has promised england will beat COVID by spring next year so that's um well like march for you guys march april is spring in over there no one is better except me i mean jamie would be a great president slash prime minister what, what do you have in ireland is it a prime minister But he can't promise that. Um, yeah, unless he's going off of the... Um, I think he... Unless he's going off some sort of modelling. I mean, that's what our, our Victorian state premier... So not the prime minister, just Victoria's state premier. A lot of the things that he was saying was based off of modelling. And you got to realise that these politicians are only relaying you information from scientists. you got to realise that. Like, it's not like Boris Johnson has the plan to beat coronavirus it's the scientists that have the plan to beat coronavirus and boris johnson's job is to communicate that to the people and also pick and choose which piece of advice that he wants to follow but he's just a messenger it's not like COVID happened and boris johnson came up with a plan like uh <laughs> he has advisors he has scientists he has chief of staff that in those fields that give him the best and worst advice and then he makes an executive decision that's his job but he's the the the, the um plan the, the reason he's saying that we will beat up by spring is that he's been given modeling that shows if we do this this and this we can beat up by spring and so to keep morale high he's saying we will beat up by spring it's still his neck on the line he's still the one making the decision at the end of the day no, Gardy is right, though. I completely agree. Yeah, look at me. I'm so smart. But what happens if we don't? Then it's on him. Then he has to find a reason why not. We didn't hit this sort of benchmark, or we didn't do this right, or whatever it is. It, it, it's up to him at that point. But the reason he's saying that is because there's modeling from someone. I don't know, a set of scientists, a department, a laboratory somewhere saying, this is what our modeling shows. If we're going to lockdown now, if we do this at this step, and things will change. You might have to delay one thing. You may have to bring forward one thing, but things will change. But the modeling suggests that if you do this, this, and this, you will beat up by spring, or you will you will bring it down by spring again. Whether that happens or not, I have no idea, because I don't know what the situation is in England. What I've learned, though, is you don't make promises that you can't guarantee to keep. Well, Callum, technically, you can't guarantee anything. <laughs> Me and my friend have this conversation all the time. You can't guarantee anything. I can't guarantee I'm going to stream tomorrow. I could be dead. You know what I mean? Like, I, you can't guarantee anything. So, you should, in that regard, you shouldn't promise anything? Is that what you're saying? Big, at the same time, you can't force people to stop mixing. There's always a minority that don't follow the rules. That's true as well, Harry. And that's happened here as well. But we've still got it down to zero cases a day. I don't, I don't technically, I don't really like the way our government went about it. Um, but we're still down, down to zero cases a day. Reg regardless of if I like it or not, the results speak for themselves. You know what I mean? We, we stayed in a, a pretty hard lockdown for months. Months. And it's, it's the, 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 the premier that's getting, um, the premier is getting all the blame for following the advice but at the end of the day, we're down to zero cases a day by staying in a pretty hard lockdown, by having a curfew. We got the cases down. In Queensland and New South Wales, so other parts of Australia, it was open. And they have minimal cases a day as well. But for us, the way we did it was a different way. He listened to different advice. <laughs> Dude, you truly speak the stoner language, man. <laughs> I think that's just because you have stoner ears. So you're hearing me in stoner talk, but I'm not speaking stoner talk right now. I'm speaking straight facts, which I guess you would probably count as stoner talk. Um, people still don't wear masks a lot of the time. 
I mean, that's down to the individuals at that point. And, and you know what? You would hope, Harry, that modeling shows that as well. Like, you would hope that the modeling takes into account that some people don't wear masks. Surely the modeling has not made it so everybody is wearing masks. I would assume not. And we got a lot of outs here. Katarino, Weigel, and Fernandes. Gardi is venting. Not really. I'm just... My, my thing is... I just wish people were a little bit... Um, when it comes to politics, I, I wish people were a little bit more... Careful with just throwing out an opinion like that. Wait, Gardi engages in consumption of the devil's lettuce, says Harry. No. No, Gardi does not. Tiago Araujo says lol. No, I don't. <laughs> I don't know where you got that from. Albi says Gardi on crack. Gardi is venting. Do you mean venting like um, Among Us venting or venting like getting things off my chest? You could mean both, technically. Yeah, I just wish people thought about it a little bit more. Like, uh, in, in this day and age with the internet, we're just quickly, uh, we're just very quick to put out our opinions, get it out as quick as possible, try and, you know, have the most outrageous opinions ever, try and get the, the clickbait, you know what I mean? But all the, all the, you're trying to get like tweets to bang and things like that. And it's just like created this culture of, um, having an opinion as like as quick as possible and sticking to it. And it's like, no, just sit back, breathe, you know what I mean? Take some time. Think about it. And then formulate an opinion. Don't just listen to what everybody else is saying and make that opinion and uh, make that your opinion and just roll with it. That's the worst thing you can do. Because people are stupid. Including myself, but people are stupid. If you're listening to everyone, if your opinion is based off of everyone else's opinion, I'm telling you, your opinion sucks. <laughs> Okay, I'm going now. Good night, everyone. Bye, Harry. Can I... Harry, did you answer the question? What do you guys have in Ireland? Do you have a, a president or a prime minister? Or what do you have in Ireland? I don't know if you ever answered that question. But if you don't answer it, it's still a good night and goodbye. All right, we're going to jump to the result of this one. I'm not Irish. Oh. I'm mixing you up with Jamie. My bad. <laughs> Sorry, Harry. Maybe you still knew the answer. I don't know. See you later anyway. Um, that's inside and rules are, are unclear. Mm. We're going to invade, invade Boa Vista tomorrow and burn their stadium down, says Tiago Araujo. Why would you do such a thing? What did Boa Vista ever do to you? Uh, you do. Okay. Which one? Do you have a president or a prime minister? I assume it's a prime minister. If I had to guess. <laughs> if I had to guess. Which I don't have to guess, but I want to guess. Um, Kevin also different countries, so yeah. I mean different different countries are gonna tackle it differently. If you are with more than four people outside, then you get a, a fine of a hundred Euros, wow. <laughs> My country has a prime. <laughs> Joel, I don't know what that was, but that word was not minister, and then you deleted the message. How dare you. You didn't let me read the meme. Oh my god, everybody's retracting their messages. Spiri. I think you mean sorry, Joel. You don't have to delete that one. I know what that one. <laughs> I, know, I know what you're saying on that one. Um, first versus second here. We're dominating in the Europa League as well. We can proper play the rotated lineup here. Um, if you get caught while having a party with more than four people inside a house, you get fined 400 euros. Guardi, I think you're tired. I am going to call this very, very, very soon. I want to get to December and we're at the end of November. So I'm going to call this very soon. I appreciate the 25 of you that have stayed this whole time. I mean, we've had more than 20 the whole whole stream. That's crazy. And 66 likes on the stream. Shout out to you guys. 
If you get caught while having a- Oh, I read that one already. Guardi- Guardi is sus? I am so sus right now, yeah. Massive sus. That whole po politic talk as well? That really got me. 67 says Ashish. 67, apparently. Uh, mine says 66. Either way, shout out to everybody who liked the stream. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Four hours, 20 minutes we're going. So we're going to hit the four and a half hour mark, I think, I feel. I know, Joe, every country should have the same measurements, says Kevin. I don't think so. I actually disagree with that, Kevin. Every country is different when it comes to this. So the punishments should be different as well. And also, I don't know, it depends on how much money the government wants to make, right? Again, this is something that's been very, very quickly politicized and monetized. Guys, we need to vote Guardi off. Don't do it, Jamie. It's not me. I, I, I'm the one that fixed lights. Yeah, so how could it be me? Why would I fix lights if I'm if I'm killing people? True? Uh, it's right. It's true, isn't it? I'm telling the truth. I've been here from the start, too. Yeah, Albie, you have. A lot of you have, actually, to be honest with you. A few of you have been here from the start. We're down 1 0 to Basel. Yeah, I can't be bothered jumping in this one. I'll be honest with you. I cannot. If we take the loss, we take the loss. We're still going to be three, uh, two points ahead of Basel, even if we lose to them. We had a rule of six households within half a mile uh, of me mm, have been fined. 40k? Nah, Joe, that's. Are you for real? $40,000 uh, pounds? Wait, like for parties, like how big? Like a proper party, like a house party, like 100 plus people? My first full stream. <laughs> it's been a while, Joe. Hey. Oh, I just I said your name. I was saying Joe. Hey, like Joe, comma. It's been a while, Joe, comma. Hey, but I said your name. Um, yeah, man. I'll get you the article. There were like fifty, and it was forty k per person or forty k for the person hosting, because he had that many people. Is that why? Or was it like forty k total, or was it forty k per? Per That's crazy that's wild first of all why would you do that like as if you're not gonna get found out for the house you know you know what S screw it for the house that makes sense you had 50 people it's like what 750 per person something like that fuck it i'm the imposter says xander he actually is i'm gonna jump to result how about that look at the confidence i have in this team one one we bring it back undefeated still I think their only defeat of the season is that Leon defeat, which is completely on me. I'll be going now. Good night, everyone. Good night, Kevin. We're only going to be up for another maybe five minutes here, so don't worry about it. You were basically here the whole time. Well, no, you weren't actually, Kevin. You were here like half the time, but good night. As always, appreciate it, Kevin. Waterboy. Love it. Good stuff. Uh, enjoy the rest of your lockdown, dude. I hope I'll see you tomorrow. See you tonight? Yes. <laughs> True. Uh, yeah, what well, tonight? Yeah, tech. Well, I guess if you're talking technically, yes, it, it would be tonight. Guardy, can you time out a mod for the laugh? Okay, Jamie. I'll time Kevin out because, uh, where is it? What year is in timeout? Because he's leaving anyway. Gimeras. Okay, so we're still a perfect record in the Portuguese Liga Nos. Uh, before leaving, will you play one match? Mm, Ashish, I don't think so. I'm going to sim this one and that'll be it. Uh, most recent one here. Okay, cool. Uh, Katarino is injured. Rit. I'm going to play... Where is he? Oh, there he is. Dead I'm on him. I'm going to play Dedich. I'm going to start him. The audacity. Alright, let's have a look at this article. Shall we? Nottingham party students find 40k putting lives at risk. Wow. Um, more than 30 people hiding in their house in Lenton on Tuesday night. Nottingham has the second highest COVID infection rate in England. Lenton Drives and Neighbours Residents Association Chairwoman Kate Lewenthal said the students only have themselves to blame for the fine. Mixing of households indoors has been banned since Nottingham went into Tier 2 restrictions on 14 October. Ms. Lewenthal said she had received calls from the large number of elderly and vulnerable people who were upset at the flouting of COVID restrictions by the student household. She said, We wouldn't wish students to be fined this much money, but there's no one in the city or indeed the country who can say they don't know what's going on. If they're going to continue to put lives at risk, then they only have themselves to blame. 
She believes the size of the farm will act as a deterrent. In September, a 19-year-old student was fined £10,000 for hosting a house party of 50 people in Lenton. Ms. Dunthor said that the fine definitely had an impact in the Lenton area. When officers attended the most recent house party on Tuesday, they were told everyone had left. But inside, they found more than 30 people hiding. What? They let the police officers in inside? Don't you need a warrant? And when challenged, organizers complained they should be having the time of their lives jump in yeah well a half time if we're still down i'll jump in nottingham trent university said the third year students have been sus suspended the police find the students ten thousand pounds each i'm gonna jump in for the penalty all right that's enough of that article i'm here for the penalty <laughs> since i started reading the article everyone left <laughs> we're from 25 to 18 nobody wants to hear about an article I'm wearing black i like that i like a black kit not gonna lie just black you can wear black no matter where like it just it's always good it goes with everything um so what that's close to you joe i thought you would live in sunderland not nottingham or are you there for school or something Bang! oh what a shot by everton uh i'm back lad hyper jj how was practice dude Nottingham Uni. Oh, nice, Joe. What are you even studying at uni, Joe? It's crazy to think you're at university. Bang! That's one. Beautiful stuff. Darwin Nunez. <laughs> I'm on my last water break. Oh, you're not finished from training, I see. Okay. Well, make sure you um make sure you go hard on the last um on the last session, right? Music tech, second year. I have 20 minutes left. Well, make sure you, you go hard. On, don't leave anything behind. Make sure you go hard in the last 20 minutes, yeah? That's what Guardi FC would expect of you. So that's what you're... Uh, that's what... Yamga? It's a scrimmage. I promise you a goal. If you don't bring me a goal, Hyper JJ, I'll be firmly disappointed in you. Firmly disappointed. Oh, it's a goal. Oh, he missed! Oh, he missed. Oh my gosh. That should have been a goal for sure. Um, That would have been a nice goal as well, by the way. What a ball from Asun Chao. Beautiful. On Chalves to Darwin. Darwin. Oh, nice tackle. Nice, nice, nice. I'm studying business management here in Dallas. I'm heading online classes. Um, Music tech. I like that, uh, Joe. That's nice. That's a nice... Uh, you're going to have a lot of job opportunities as well, surely. I didn't know you were into that sort of thing, by the way. Asun Chao. That was a terrible pass. Oh, and then he... An absolute... Screamer of a slide tackle as well. Online classes are a pain, yeah. Yeah, I uh, would like to think so. I mean... I, I would like to think so as well. If people are using like, that sort of stuff more and more... Uh, at like presentations and stuff, you know what I mean? Chalvez, nice. Cutting in. Oh. Oh, referee. We're going to play on here because... Oh, Everton. That was a, a bad touch, actually. We're going to play it back out to Aswin Chow. One touch. Shot. Good block. Ah, oh, man. I thought Everton, that touch was so heavy as well. If the stream isn't over by then, I'll tell you the results uh, next stream. Okay, cool. I think it will be done by the time you come back, Hyper JJ. You could alternatively leave a comment on the video. I went to choir school age like 10. Was always interested in the composition side since. Um, they did tech a college and got into a decent uni. Nice. I like that. That's very nice. Well, I, I wish you the best of luck, Joe. What's um What's Jacob doing? Is he still in high school? I don't. I forgot what the age difference was between you. You know what I do remember with you two? One of you goes for Bristol City and one of you goes for Bristol Rovers. I don't know if that's still a thing. I know, obviously, you both go for Sunderland, but you, one of you prefers Bristol City and one of you prefers Bristol Rovers. I remember that. No, that was meant to be for Darwin. 
Oh my goodness. Everton has had a couple of blunders here. Bang! Straight to the keeper. Straight to... Jacob is 16 now, doing sports at college. Oh, so the, the gap is huge between you guys, age-wise. Oh, Darwin. Oh, Darwin, stop it. Doing sports at college. Actually, he did mention that. I think he did mention that. He was doing sports. I didn't realize the age gap was so... I thought it was maybe like three years between you two. Gardy, um, didn't someone shit in Sunderland State? <laughs> I wasn't aware. I wasn't aware of that, Jay. <laughs> I did not know. Did not know that. How do you even do that? <laughs> like, obviously, you could do it at the toilets. Is that what you mean? But you, uh, the way I'm reading that, it's like it happened on the pitch. Oh, Darwin. Again. Oh. I have a soft spot for Bristol Rovers because of a mate. Jacob naturally decided to support Bristol Ro uh, City. Yeah. Um, did you know Benfica lose in real life? Uh, I haven't actually kept up with the Portuguese league at all. I couldn't even tell you what's going on in the Portuguese league. Usually, I keep up to date with like tables and stuff like that, but I haven't really. <laughs> so, I don't know. I don't know what's going on if it's the standard Porto, Benfica. Let me look it up. Um, Liga Nos table. It is Sporting Club de Portugal, 16 points in six games, so five wins and a draw. Then Benfica, who's five wins and a loss. Auto, three wins, one draw, two losses. They're in fourth. They're not even third. But it is early days in the season. I expect those three to be the top three once again. Although Braga, Braga might do something. They're always there or thereabouts, Braga, but across the whole season, those three are just too good. I think. It's just the the the, the level is too high. Oh, that's a good ball. That's a goal. That was scintillating. It looked like some it looked like it happened in the stands, but people took it out of hand. Okay, so okay, the <laughs> what I imagined when Jamie initially said that, this is what I imagined. Someone had like ran onto the pitch and just took a dump on the pitch and like overnight and then they found it in the morning. Why did I imagine that? It would make more sense that it happened in the stands where the people are. Oh. I thought like someone snuck into Sunderland Stadium and took a shit on the pitch. That's what I imagine. Can we not? Joe doesn't even want to imagine that. Doesn't want to even think about it. Kim Jung Min. Edwards? Oh, Edwards. He's, uh, he's English, isn't he? He was from... I think he's from Spurs. I could be wrong. Why this? Why is this team playing like Barcelona all of a sudden? What's going on? All of a sudden. They're playing like Leon were. Uh-oh. That's some solid defense here. Oh, yes. Beautiful. Beautiful stuff. Oh, what a ball. All the way out. Guardy, look it up. I don't have time to look it up, Joel. I'm too busy trying to get a winner here. Bang. Here it is. Yaminga! Oh, it falls to Darwin. He's going to be offside, isn't he? Oh, man, you know I'm playing Wednesday? That was an okay counterattack. That was not, not terrible. We have a perfect record, and I'd like to keep it up. So, a winner here would be big. I mean, eventually we're going to drop points. It's bound to happen. But not today. Come on. Maybe tomorrow, not today. Nice ball. Family Cow. Uh, that guy from Family Cow, whatever his name is, the player. Um, he's played well. Oh, it's an own goal, but I'll take it. The sweat kind of works. I forgot what uh, his name is, the guy from Family Cow, but he, the defensive mid, he's playing very, very well. He's got good passing. Uh, Champions League, yeah, we're, we are playing Champions League. Don't forget it. Manchester United are a Champions League club. Don't forget it. That's Sunderland football for you. Look at that. The sweat kind of works. The, uh, the own goal, you take it. 100%. You gotta take it. 3-2. All right, let's hang on to this, boys. 
please. Please, let's hang on to this. That's Sunderland football for you. I mean, I hope Sunderland come back. I'm not gonna lie. I want them back in the Premier League, personally. Just because growing up, they were always a Premier League club. Like, it just, it, there was just a thing. It was just Sunderland wearing the Premier League. And, of course, I have a spot, soft spot for them with doing my first ever career mode on them. Ah, that's not it. Damn, we rocking some Synthwave RN. Are we? Oh, yeah, I've had Synthwave on the whole time. Oh, I thought I had Lo-Fi on. <laughs> I don't listen to the music, so... Uh, what do you think of Man Yamga? Oh, this guy, our regen, he's good. He's very good. Uh, Flick, Xander had the idea before that you do a little cooking vignette depending on what league you're in. For example, if you're in Spain, you have a little two-minute vignette of you cooking the food, and it has to be a Spanish dish. And, yeah, I don't know what part of the video you put it at, like start, middle, or end. But then you could have, like, a, let's say you do a career mode for, like, six episodes. You cook six dishes from that country and you you talk about it no no oh thank god he missed a and you talk about the culture and the thing you know what i mean that's a good idea it's like if you're in spain you cook a spanish dish and for two minutes you're talking about this spanish dish uh you know became cultured in this year and that year and it involves these ingredients from these regions of spain is where it came from you know what i mean it'd be cool i could do the commentating for you I could do the commentating or the cooking for you. I don't know if... I think Flick already left. I'm definitely DM DMing him the idea. Incorporate it into the press conference, maybe. Yeah. I mean, you, you could literally just spend, like, a minute or two talking about it. Oh, Darwin. Stop it. Oh... Not bad. Bro, I tested positive for COVID-19. Rooney, I'm so sorry to hear. That just came out of nowhere. That just came out of nowhere. I'm sorry to hear, dude. Best of luck. I'm sure everybody will be wishing you the best of luck as well. Best of luck. Where are you from, Rooney? And we get the W. The perfect record continues. The perfect record continues. And that... Is the last game of today's stream. Oh my goodness. Four hours and 40 minutes. And not once did I go to pee. That keeper had a strong mustache. Not once. Oh. What am I? Some kind of animal? Flick, if you do a cooking stream, I'll watch it. I must be some kind of animal. You vented in between. That's true. I vented in between. I'll figure something out. I think that's a good way to incorporate a flick because you know what? It forces you to cook from different cultures. As well. It's like exciting for you because you can cook different countries' foods and stuff. You may Maybe you'll cook things that you've never cooked before. Twitch? I presume there'll be no Twitch later on. Joe, it depends how hot it is in this room later because the sun hits this room in the afternoon. But if it's cooling down later, I might try a Twitch stream. South Africa, bro. Um, did you get the COVID-19? I didn't get it, no. But best of luck, man. I don't know what the situation is in South Africa with it, but best of luck. Um, okay, so... Uh, unfortunately, that is the end of today's stream. Why is Santa Clara's badge just Benfica's badge inside of a badge? Has anybody ever asked this? It is literally Benfica's badge inside of a badge. Can everybody see that? Before I go, hold on, let me zoom in. Let me just zoom this in so everybody knows what I'm talking about. Santa Clara's badge is literally Benfica's badge inside of a badge, inside of a crest.
Okay. That's all I wanted to show. <laughs> That's all I wanted to show you guys. <laughs> oh my god. That's it. That's all I wanted. <laughs> it was very important for me to show you guys this. Uh, you like this little editing uh, display that I'm... You like that? Editing while streaming. Isn't that right? We see it, bro. So weird. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we see it. Oh, I didn't put the, um... They put the live chat link. I always forget to do this, eh? Oh man, today was a fun stream, I gotta be honest. Five hours, but like, man, that was fun. Ha I have to say, like nearly five hours, but it was super duper fun. Um, I guess thank you for everybody that was in the stream. Man, today was a sick stream. We had donations from, um... From Ryan, so shout out to Ryan. Hope I see him again to thank him again. Um... We helped Callum out with some problems with a girl before. Fantastic stuff. We lost 4-0 to Leon to miss out on Champions League qualifying. Scintillating. Beautiful. Just exactly what you want from a stream. Um, Gardy just killed Flick. I know, I'm giving Flick too many too many ideas. It is starting to get warm in this room, so I think I'm starting... Uh, I'm leaving at a good time. I will be live tomorrow at the normal time. Um, today was a bit different. Today was not what I usually do for streams. But... Um, yeah, it, unfortunately, well, no, actually, fortunately, I have the day off today, so it, it was a little bit different. Tomorrow, we'll be back to normal. I should do a raid. I don't even know. I don't even who is streaming right now. Is there somebody that is streaming that you want us to raid? I don't even know uh, who would be streaming right now, to be completely honest with you. Okay, I've just gone on FIFA 21 to see who's live streaming. There's Lad to Dad. There's High Times United. There's Adrian F, who's got 500. Oh, he's Spanish. Okay, we've got Blue Moon. Shall we raid one of these? Box Funny. Anyone doing career mode? No one's doing career mode, I don't think. It's all. Um, it's all ultimate team. It's all ultimate team. They don't deserve any anything. No, I'm just joking. But seriously, they don't. Is any no one's doing career mode? Ultimate team, foot, foot, pro clubs. No, not a single person. That just goes to show. There's a lot of pro clubs though on the pro clubs. Um, anyway, that's it. I'm not going to raid anyone. There's no one to raid, unfortunately. Anyway, <laughs> goodbye, everyone. Um, Joe, Xander, Joel, Ashish, Joe, again. Um, maybe next time. Yeah, Jamie, maybe next time. Albie, Joel, Rooney, um, McCollman, Flick. Man, I can't even name everybody. We had so many people today. Um, Callum was here before as well. Oh, man. Harry. We had so many people. Um, Ryan, of course, who donated again. Thank you very much. Uh, so, yeah. Thank you, everybody, for the uh, stream. Really enjoyable. I'll be back tomorrow at the normal time for the normal amount. So, today was a bit of a special stream. But uh, enjoy the rest of your nights. For those of you that are going to sleep, enjoy your sleep and enjoy the rest of tomorrow and all of tomorrow, essentially. And I will be back tomorrow. See you guys. Bye, 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 bye. Bye, everybody.